Okay, and welcome everyone to another session of hopefully 4v4 multiplayer. This time to make sure that the game actually launched, I decided to go with a 4v4 and then I pushed it up further. So now um, if people don't show up, we can still do a 3v3. Very likely to do a Southlands. I'll edit the thumbnail and the title where we, once we decide where we want to go. But for now, let's uh, see this. Error is kind of shit. Okay, so... Southlands, A. Eh? I guess? Well, I mean, it depends on what you guys oh, want to do. Do you want to do Southlands? Too? Yeah, so Imrik, Imrik got really fucked by the way, right? He got really fucked by the updates. No, not really. Well, Southlands yeah, is the only place for eight players, because Empire is going to be unbalanced as shit. The, okay, the problem with Empire is that it's so fucking easy to take multiple battles each turn to the point where, like, if you're one of the races that can replenish quickly and take lots of battles and auto-resolve quickly, you just get such an insurmountable lead. Plus, the second problem is Empire itself is actually kind of weak. Um, it's really fucking hard for Empire to kill single entities right now. Um, particularly uh, small... Uh, Say it again. Uh, Vlad is like... All the vampires are turbo broken at the minute, in my opinion. Yeah, it's just like... I, I don't see a realistic path for Empire to compete against Vlad. And then Vlad is just going to be like... He's just going to be killing everything. It just, I don't know, we've tried Empire so many times, and it literally just turns into the, the Vlad Grounds. Okay, so... Right, ever... so... Sorry. By the way, Ash, uh, Repulse is actually good, it's just Britannia as shit, is what I figured out. Well, then that means she's not good. No, she's good, she's a good lord, but, like, Britannia itself is just not good. Okay, so then oh. she's not good. But why? Can you play her? Yes, you can play Rapunz. Okay, so you could play Rapunz and you could expand and do as well as other factions. I mean, okay, yeah. the fact that you're 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 hesitating here tells me no. If you want to play Rapunz, go play Rapunz. I'm good. I'm gonna play something else. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so how far can we go up, like factions wise? How far up? It the, depends. The Badlands. It depends on where we want to go. Do we want to do Southlands? Do we want to do Badlands? I mean, it depends on a lot. Because I could go do Warzog right now. Where's that guy at? Where's my Warzy boy? Oh, someone's on Warzog. I got got! Okay, so we have currently seven people. We have seven people, we don't have an eighth. A gorgeous though shit. Have you got that uh, worst case, yeah. I don't mind dropping out for a 3v3. Yeah, I mean, if Tornado's not gonna... Um... Didn't Nakai wanted to join? He said he wanted to join, but he's not late. Who? Oh, well, uh, that, that guy has said he wanted to join so many times, and then he doesn't show up. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna ping him and see what happens. Okay, the thing is, if you ping people a lot... They're... Yeah, but you already, like... If you ping people a lot... I Okay, I, I know you don't understand it, but let me explain it. No. That I means they once. don't want to play, and they're just not... I don't ping not... them, like, ten times. I ping them, like, once, and if they don't want to play, I don't ping them yet. Hold on, I'll, I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some water. Okay, um... Okay. So everyone's playing across the entire map. Brilliant. <laughs> okay, guys, Southlands. Go go back to Southlands. It's very likely we're gonna end up doing a 3v3.
Okay, Cathay is not in Southlands. It's not even close <laughs> to Southlands. I would not do Krakar. His start is bad. Everything's bad. I I've tried my damnedest to make him work. I like, if your team carries you, you could probably make it work. But other than that... Yeah, Krakar is really shit. Even the good, uh... I can, okay, I can, I can, I can, I can jankily force him to work, but if you don't know the start and stuff, I don't know what to say. I mean, I played it a bit, and, um, it's bad. It's <laughs> I played, I played Lizardman a lot, and it's my main faction. It's I just, do. okay, so I'll, I'll explain it. The, the issue with other factions is they're going to start mass expanding. What you're going to do as Krakar is you're going to take your province, then you're going to have to run up, then you're going to have to choose to go to the north city or to the east city. Whichever one you go to, you'll then have to go to the other one. Once you go to the other one, um, you've spent like two turns doing nothing, and so in your first ten turns, you complete your province, you're behind two, three levels. Your your starting province is only two cities, so it's not even rich. You have that landmark, which is okay, I, I'll give you that. You have like a deep, good starting army too, but then like your faction doesn't really buff anything until late game. And <laughs> so... Like, you get your heroes and stuff, and then it just, it, it takes, okay, like, that's what I'm saying, like, if you, if you play him kind of like, as a late game scaling faction, it could work, but. I mean, it depends, you can also expand south, but, uh, that it has to do with where my other teammates are, and in the south you can get, uh, like, at least one or two provinces more. Yeah, the thing is, then you move south, so then you move from your, your province, you moved up there, you then move all the way back down to the south, and then again, now you're down like five, six, seven levels, and it just, it's painful. Other factions can kind of like complete their starting shit so early. Okay, guys, 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 when I said Southlands, I meant Southlands. I, I don't, I don't know, I don't, I don't know why we're like, like doing memes of picking elsewhere like at some point i'm assuming people want to start the game i mean is scrag okay or not scrag uh it depends maybe if they do like a i thing. mean people are picking like a dwarf so i assume scrag is okay i mean it depends are we doing like more into the north of southlands are we doing into the south of southlands because like belthazar gelt is way too north even those dwarves are probably. I could doing do more a bit north just to change it up a bit. I mean, we could try going further to the north, but then okay. So, the issue is if we play too much into the mountains, we're gonna have factions that can't really do much in the mountains, except mm. for the dwarves, greenskins, and rats. Yeah, yeah, it's so, gonna be a huge advantage. Also, okay. with tunneling into the rock. I'm surprised nobody's playing Manfred, to be honest. Well, I mean, we could do Manfred. I mean, if that guy wants to play Lizardman, the issue is we're going to have to play south to get the Lizardman in here. I can play something else, but... Uh, just... Yeah, I mean, it's just... You guys are, like, meme-picking in the north, which is making this hard to set up. Like, like pick who you want to pick, and then let's try to play around that. So, if we want to do, like, this area, then let's pick around this area. So, I'm like... I'm on the phone with, with AT&T, but I'm here. Are you, are you actually here? I'm I'm here, but I'm on the phone with AT and T. I'm watching. Okay. okay. Well, you need a. Okay. Then you need to get in here. Okay. If we want to do like this positioning, then how about we do like north and south? So we we have like two v two v two in the north and two v two in the south. Do you know how to expand okay. on Ikit? Because I got fucked on Ikit last time, and it took twelve years of nothing. Not really, I usually just sit up and build Skaven Blight. I don't mind playing something else though. I'm just not sure where we're actually gonna end up then. Well, it looks like right now we're kinda doing like a Southern Empire game. I mean, again, we could push people north or we could push people south. It depends on what you want. Yeah, I mean, I'm done for anything. Okay, this I kind of want to play Torgrim. Grimgor is too far away. Switch. That is yeah, way too just, far away. I'm just 
if you, you want know, to do taking a look where all the starting positions are. If you want to do Grom, he's pretty easy. His gobbles just auto resolve everything. Nah. Okay. Um. <laughs> uh, Torek is good, but his his expansion is kind of shit. Okay, the only problem here is we're a bit too far away from each other. Yeah. I mean, I can go down to Scrag if that is. Okay, here's what I'm thinking. Balthazar Gel is pushing us really far north. And the Wood Elves are just also pushing us really far north. Guys, guys, we're, we're going further away. We want to be in a position where we're not playing 30 turns of PvE. Even being two uh, provinces away from each other can add a lot of PvE time where we're just spending three hours doing nothing. Y you want to, like, uh, don't, don't do Scarbrand. The issue with Scarbrand is he he's really lame. He's pushing your team into winning or losing early game really hard, which I, I guess you could try to do, but it, it kind of uh, yeah. Am I am I missing something? Why is there an address? Why is there what? An address. In, uh, Southlands. He starts right under um, Orzog. Yeah, we could do elves and orcs. We could do a north south thing. Okay, tornado. Okay, tornado. Okay. Um. Okay, the only issue here this. is we're so far away from each other. Yeah. Hmm. Like, we don't have a connecting player right now. I mean, me and Ash. What about, what more. about, what about um, maybe I can play Queek? I mean, I, I know a bit about Queek is good. Skaven, but Queek. I didn't play his game and I didn't play his start in IE. You can play but Queek. I, you, you basically spam armies and chieftains and... Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I can, I could do that. It would be fine for me. I'm, I'm just not a fan of uh, Tomb Kings or uh, Vampire Counts. So, I mean, Manfred's turbo broken. Yeah, Manfred's really good. Such is really good. Uh, Archon, if you're bad at the game, if any of you are bad at the game, play Archon. If anyone is even competent, you, you you're banned from Archon. I mean, I could do. Well, I would uh, probably go for either Croca or Queek right now. I could do uh, Tic Tac Toe. I uh, didn't play his start either, but um, I mean, it's Lizard and I know Lizard. I've not played any of these starts. The only I've only played Wars of Chaos and yeah. Okay, so the problem is the dwarves. Okay, the dwarves I... are probably fine for the east. Uh, Eltharian's just gonna work with me. Okay, so yeah, I do have an email with confirmation number for the old order, but they canceled it. Tornado, you unmuted. I don't think Eltharian should work with you. All right. What? I mean, how do we do these teams? Do we just go? Through? Well, okay. The problem is now we have Beltus or Gelt. Like, guys, we're, we're going. Okay, let's push. Can we get the ogres and Beltus or Gelt further south? <laughs> we're like pushing so far north at this point. It just. We're, I don't. I don't feel like we're getting the idea here. Like we need a middle ground, somewhere. I mean, okay. Now we're like, awkwardly really south. Okay. Can we? Oh boy. So no one wants to play Tomb Kings. Okay. Does someone want to play Warzog? I'll play Tomb Kings if someone wants to play Warzog. I'll do. I'm playing Tomb Kings. Okay. I, I mean, Kalita. If, if you guys want to do, I can do Kalita if someone wants to do Warzog. I'll do Warzog. Okay, that I, I figured someone wanted to do Warzog. <laughs> okay, this is starting to get a little bit better. Um, the I mean, it's just, still... it's just, it's just going to be the orcs and the dwarves against each other then. Yeah, the problem here I is... I think we... dwarves is a little bit too much north. Uh, yeah, now the, the dwarves are a bit too far up there. But either Tomb Kings or maybe Queek. Setra and Manfred would be a little bit too close to each other. Queek can work. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Repans is also too close for uh, for Arkan, right? Volkmar and and uh, fucking like Manfred. Manfred. Yeah, that's cursed. Yeah. It's really cursed. It's gonna be a hot one. Um, we'll just okay. We'll sli okay. How are we gonna? It's Kairos. Kairos is too south, so. Yeah, I mean, I mean, if we put Tectus on it and uh, Tlaqua maybe, then Kairos, couldn't that be also fine? Um, as I said, I could play Tlaqua, uh, uh, so Tic Tac Toe, I mean. Tic Tac Toe probably works a little bit better. 
Um, okay, so I'm just more that. confident with Crocker, but yeah, yeah, Zinch guy, Zinch guy. Either. Do you want to play? You could play something else. I'm just. I saying, mean, you're you're gonna push up from the south, which is fine. I'm just saying, like, if you want to move, you could do Techless or something. I don't know. I mean, is Kairos too far south? Not really. I mean, we have eight people here. He's gonna push up north. Yeah. Okay, so the. Oh boy. The problem is this: the uh, Mars and Libaris need to be in one team. Same if goes if people team. actually expand well, this works. But if too many people don't know how to expand, then we're gonna end up with twenty turns of PVE here. I mean, I ha I haven't played any of the Southland characters, so no matter who I play, I've not played the start. Okay, so it should be me. It should be. Oh boy. Okay, stop, stop, stop moving for a second. So it should be Queek yep. and Wurzog and Archon join my team. When you type it in, or you're, you're looking up your device, type. I'm, I'm going to server mute Tornado for a second, because I don't want his uh, stuff set. <laughs> okay, we need Archon. Everyone else go team two. So Archon, join my team. Okay, yeah, you guys go team two. Can you pull Tornado into our team? Uh, no. He probably still. Uh, okay. Okay, okay, this this works. It feels like I'm a bit too safe, no? Who? I literally... Kairos, I literally have... Well, your team okay. isn't safe. Yeah. Yeah, like, your whole thing is you need to, like, get I up mean, there to help your team. You tweak and the barrels against Torek and Krokra is gonna be rough, and so we have a little bit backup in Zinch. Same goes for you with Wurzek. Archon's gonna come from the west. Archon's pretty OP right now. So, Anadoniak's not the greatest player, but he's gonna come from the west. So, basically, and Zinch, you have to push okay. up, and then you need to back people up. Yeah. And if I put... Uh, if I go Tic Tac, I guess then Torek is a little bit far. I haven't, I haven't really played Quick, so I'm not... I don't remember. Uh, but, you know. Just... just. It's just the even weapon teams. Well, again, it just, like, yeah. you, you guys are overthinking this. Like, you, you guys yeah. just got to... It's not a tournament, right? <laughs> well, it's not even that it's not a tournament. Mm -hmm. I feel like some of you guys are just like, I'm going to scale into late game, but then, like, if your team dies because you sat down and scaled yeah. the late game, it's just like, good late I game. I mean, late game, I don't think we're going to get to late game within six hours with I mean, eight people. That as well, right? I mean, it took us, what, Hash, in that game that we played in Nagaron, we would got to, what, turn... Okay, a lot of people need to end their turn quicker. That is definitely one thing. There's a lot yeah, of uh, non-turn enders. Alright, uh, it's just... Yeah, this seems good. Um, Make sure you do the settings, because I don't think you've done them. Oh, you know. Turn time, five minutes, keep the loading off. Okay. Are you uh, doing campaign difficulty very hard? Yes, it actually will make it easier. Turn time is on unlimited still. No, it's not. It is for me. What, what the fuck? Yeah. Okay, yeah, now it's five minutes for me. We could just do three minutes and we're done with that. Would camp? Okay. Never mind. Do you want me to go with Tornado, or...? What do you mean? That way. What? No, nah, don't worry about it, it's fine. Hash, how does campaign difficulty make it easier when it'd be more time for having to manual fight AI? AI is more, AI is more careful. Uh, it's only campaign difficulty, so it's not for uh, stats in battle. And the AI is uh, less more... Um, way more careful if you're playing on very hard. Yes, yeah, basically the AI is so careful and very hard that it actually becomes easier to expand. They can get more it's... armies, but they'll do less with them. This is gonna be interesting. The, the reason I'm not doing Manfred is because he's really, really... Vampires are really strong right now. Uh, and unless your opponent actually knows what they're doing... Um... <laughs> Unless your opponent actually knows what they're doing really well, vampires can just totally override people.
Okay. So basically, we have uh, Azog, not Azog, okay. the place like in the Archon in the West. Archon in the West is going to. So the player on Archon is not very good, but Archon is very overpowered. So that's a thing. We went to a lot of babies. I have no idea what the fuck that was. Um. Yeah, okay, so basically what happens, on the higher campaign difficulty, the AI plays more and more and more careful. And the issue is, on very hard and above, the AI plays so careful that they Lash? basically... What? You good? Yeah. Okay, I, I had myself... Yeah, what, what's going on with your SSD on there? I don't know. Basically, the AI will Seems end up playing... I'm gonna mute. The the AI ends up being so careful, so overly careful that um, they don't do anything. They won't. Even if they declare war, they'll sit back. If they do anything, they do nothing. The climate is irrelevant. It's a war with uh, Texas. Pardon? Uh, are you at war with Teclis from the start? Uh, let me check. Hold on. The goddess wills. Uh, Archon is overpowered. Not Archon. No. Not Archeon. Archon, the black. He's so ridiculously take, overpowered. Uh... Yeah, I can see. Isn't that worse? Will it not slow down expansion? Okay, so, Jeez. like, if you're playing Archon, and then the Ogres and Rapunz and the Dwarves and Rapunz's Bretonian are all chucking four armies into you, even Archon with this really overpowered start will struggle. If they sit back and defend their capital, you win. Archon starts with two armies instead of one. He also starts with undead units, which are really... All the undead units that Archon starts with, the bats, the ghouls, and the hex wraiths, are all massively overstat compared to their... Um... They're all massively overstat compared to their uh, undead counterparts, which just makes them way too good. Charge bonus for skeleton horsemen and a hecarn horsemen. Mainly defense for skeleton horsemen and a hecarn horsemen. Missile strength. Hmm. Why are they overstated? Their stats are just higher. They they just get more. Like their their crypt ghouls get like. I don't think it's fifteen, but it's like. It's like they just get like 14 more melee attack or some shit. It, it, it might actually be that much. It's a bizarrely high amount. <laughs> okay, which one do I want to go with? I'm thinking the cavalry and the archers. Hi, Queen Kalida. I am there. I smiles on us. Kill for Asa! My queendom expands. Queendom. I like that. Libarus shall rise again. Hi, queen. Uh, so for those of you who don't know, Karin warriors got buffed. The goddess wills it. Wanna be right back?
I'm gonna go with hey, early. Uh, trade deal coming through. Are we still doing one battle per team to return? Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting, I'm getting cock and ball tortured by AT and T right now. Sorry. Yeah. No. I. I, I saw. I was you. unmuted for a second and I didn't realize it. My bad. Yeah. No. I. I figured you might give away some personal info, so I muted you. Nope. Tomato is DC. I am crashing because I opened the diplomacy screen with someone. Oh, what's the name? I started the diplomacy screen as well. Okay. Mm. Uh, with Vinch, maybe that fucked it up. Are you actually crashing, crashing? I also opened the diplomacy screen with Ashen Shin. Uh. <laughs> that is one bug. If you double click on people and you all open it at the same time, it can bug out. Mm. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm going to take a save. Well. I'm taking a save, we and we yeah, yes, we just rehost now. Um, and in regards to the rule with only one AI battle, does that mean that uh, we only play one battle out, or that we can say, okay, I don't want players to join in that fight? No, you you play it out, but against other players. Yes. Yeah. Okay. No, that's you, you... only uh, against. Uh, that's only one game. Around. Each yeah, team gets good. one, but yeah. again, the other team gets to join, so it's not. You, you don't get. You don't just make us sit there and watch for 15 minutes as you crush an AI. Melee attack Christian when fighting against Lawrence and Greenskins. Ash, what technology do you think I should go first? Are you Archon? Yeah. I literally don't know. I don't know what Archon does. Uh, you go for the one. <sighs> Strict. You stream the game again. When when we again stream again, I'll, I'll tell you which one you go. It's there. There's a couple. Not the not the first one. The first one is good, but you don't like the first one actually. There's a much better one. I think it's the middle one. I, I don't remember which one. I actually played Arkan earlier, and I was surprised how quickly you can get Arkan is super down to one. strong. It's like an incredibly strong. No, I was just surprised about how. Quickly, you can get all the dynasties down to one turn. Yeah. I had that done before turn 60. Mm hmm. Alright, everybody here? Okay. So, yeah, the, ready up, ready up, ready up, ready up, ready up, ready up, ready up. Ready. Ready. The vampire count units. Although the crypt ghouls are shit, like, you don't want You can't get a technology for those. The crypt ghouls are also really good. No, they're. They're really, really good. Okay, and then someone next, uh, units of armors. And they die? What if you don't have infinite armor? Yeah, but like, crit bulls are extre extremely shit against armor. If you don't lose yes, that, is, that doesn't mean they're just bad. That means I they mean, have a Bretonia counter. I mean, doesn't get armor, so they have an easy time against Bretonia. Yeah, they, don't they spawn in with like 40 melee attack and high damage? Yeah, but that's not the only good, the only stat that matters, Ash. The problem is that the Creed Ghouls have no armor, they don't, they don't have armor piercing, and they're just like really, really squishy. Okay, they're a, f they do, they're a faster... They do good damage. They, yes, so. Dildrick, you're, you're saying that the infantry not meant to frontline can't frontline. And you are yeah, correct. Like, what I'm saying is you don't want to have like more than four in an army or even three. You want as many as you can get because they're better than skeletons. Mm, I mean, fair enough, yes, but... Yes, I just... <sighs> That is literally how well, two kings no, work. Okay, okay, no, no, but the thing is, like... If sure, you have a skeleton and it is not a special unit, you want it to be replaced with a special unit. That is how two kings work. Yes, I know, but like, you still get Nikon Warriors over Creed Bulls. Even that's debatable. The Nikon Warriors are good, but you have two armies. You're not going to be filling both armies with all units. Hmm. Oh! Uh, sorry. 
Hildrick sometimes just gives people wrong info so much. Who left? Uh, I'm literally looking at crypt goals with 46 melee attack, 49 damage, and a <clears throat> squad of 120. They have one less armor piercing than a skeleton warrior. There's literally no way that 23... No, it's literally impossible. There's actually no functional mathematical way for skeletons to ever outperform a Grip Ghoul. It literally cannot happen. The only possible conceivable way is if you're running into a pure ranged formation, and even then the 12 additional speed might win it. Hmm. Torek, I sent you a trade agreement. Speak that things! Damn it! Right, yes! Okay, followers in a gosh trade deal. For, I may just grant it. it uh, it's a bit sad how little of the vampire can coming in. That um Arkan gets. He only or gets sword. like At once. Yeah, but the thing is the parts he does get are just so overstat. That's why I was saying, like, if you're bad at the game, sure, play them, but if you're even uh remotely good you just kind of, you're going to dunk on people. Where is... Pendant negotiation, but why did it disappear? Um, it should, it should be right next to your diploma, so you should have pending negotiation. Oh, I can't trade with orcs. Orcs don't trade. Right. Okay, everyone. Squeak. We already did like we we're still on turn one, so let's finish this up. The ass. It keeps saying pending negotiation. When I click on it, it doesn't do anything. For who? For me. With who? I I don't know. It's just an exclamation point. Okay, and, and then I click, you on, click it, on it. Happens. And then it shows the it shows who you have a pending negotiation with. It didn't. What faction are you? Kairos. Just click the little skip bar thing. All right, guys, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. It's turn one. Orcs do not worship corn. They worship Gork and Mork. Tornado! Tornado, do not time us out on turn one. I've literally been on the phone with AT&T for over an hour. Just kill them. Yes, orcs form... Orcs and end times also formed a counter to chaos. So... I mean, yeah, if they if they worshipped corn, they would get more powerful, but then they'd, you know, be subservient to corn. What the fuck? McDonald's is doing a 10-piece chicken nugget meal, free with $15 purchase. That's... So good, and yet I don't want two meals. I forgot they changed the knowledgeable trait, to be honest. This 
that's too much. Yeah, it's still it's okay, you know, like experience game. The big issue, at least in multiplayer, in single player you're pretty much free to do whatever you want, but in multiplayer the biggest issue is you have to get levels on yep. your dudes, and not getting levels on your dudes dooms you. Yep. Focus! It's inevitable! Asap smiles on us. Because, like, yeah, I mean, that that's, it. that's again why I think Vlad kind of ruins the Empire. Not playing with Vlad is bad, though, because then that area is empty. But the issue is Vlad, he literally just runs down and Giga levels him and a bunch of vampires. And then it's just, like, impossible for any human to interact with that in a reasonable way. Mm. Um, I'm trying to keep the game as vanilla as possible. The pussy boss. <laughs> Great name, by the way. But yeah, I'm, I'm trying to keep the game as vanilla as possible, so anyone who like plays yeah, Total War and runs in. Who are you playing? Squeak. I'm assuming you went with the the Giga Chieftain spam. Yeah, I mean you already get like three Chieftains at the game time. So. Yeah, you should just spawn all of them at game start and run them down. And I believe chieftains got slightly touched up if you can get them to their mount. But again, it's it's like it's really frustrating mm. in multiplayer, and that's why. Like, if I was to change things, I would make it easier to level shit in multiplayer, or at the very least, start with shit leveled. Because a lot of heroes are only really useful if they're leveled. But eventually, in multiplayer, you kind of reach an impasse, if you will, where like you can't really PVE anymore. Everything's dead. And like going out to other AI would get you killed, but like you're not as leveled as the opponent, so you're just like kind of stuck. Get the things. I mean, I'm sure there's a corn worshiping orc, but you need to consider that, um, Death becomes like being subservient to chaos wouldn't be an orc thing. Come on, guys, take the turns. We're on turn two. Holy shit, I'm finally off the phone. Tailjuke and Tornado, uh, you I guys play the most. Me. How are you guys taking the longest turns? I forgot to build stuff. Yeah. Because I have literally been held hostage on the phone by AT&T for a millennia. That's Good. why. Good, I think you deserved it. No, I don't. You no had it coming. This. You had it coming. Every every turn time that you make us watch, I think to myself, God, I wish AT&T put him on hold once more. Wasn't even on hold. Like, I got transferred over three departments. <laughs> Literally three departments. And, like, eventually I just had to deploy the nuke and go to retention because they're the only people who know what they're doing in the whole company. I, I hope they just ruined your day. Tornado, I have a question here. It's pretty hard to ruin my day. There's a 10-piece chicken nugget meal, right? But you get it for free when you actually order another meal. Do I order a meal and then get a second? Hildrick, what are you doing? What are you going to do with your second meal? Are you, I mean, if you're going to eat it, then that's value. Right? I mean, do I, I, I don't know. Like, do I just eat all the french fries and reheat the burgers later? Is that healthy to eat that many french fries? No, it's not. But you don't give a fuck if it's healthy or not. I could go a double quarter pounder with cheese meal, then go with the 10 piece chicken nuggets meal as my free meal, then go with the 20 piece chicken nuggets on top of that. That's 30 nuggets, two fries, two drinks, and a double cheeseburger. Okay, that's kind of a lot for one person, don't you think? Okay, but you're saying this- that's all- okay, let me round up. I'm gonna check how much that would even cost with every single thing added together. Plus tax. I need a- do my double quarter pounder meal. Shall rise again. Oh, are you shitting me? The AI is gonna sack. Oh, god damn it. Holy fuck. This is actually annoying. Good. I'll have you know I'm pretty much. No, I'm not what? fucked, but it's. Oh, I'm fu I've completely fucked this up. Libaris <sighs> built their second army at their capital instead of. I said, Lamia, the, the Silver Host, they built it at their capital instead of the area to the west of me for once. And then they're gonna go sack the area I just built. <laughs> Good stuff, dude. 
Kairos has one of the starts where you have to fight the first battle or it's too damaged to take the settlement. <laughs> and I didn't realize. So I'm fucked. Just siege it. Yeah, just siege it. I did, and they brought a lord over from the capital, and it was Valiant Defeat. Oh. You can play it out? Just simp out all your money into Volkmar and things will turn out alright. No, because the, the army's damaged, and with you fucking assholes playing as them, I won't be able to beat it. Can I go for the casualty replenishment? Probably not. Okay, I want to go for elite cavalrymen. Oh boy. You know, the definition of gaming is whenever your free company militia have more defense and physical resistance than your actual frontline swordsmen. Yes, Gore Drinker is better than Eclipse if I'm you're not so happy the free company militia is on my side. <laughs> After what I've seen. <laughs> okay, they're actually gonna go sack my capital, and I don't know what to do about this one. Well, not my capital, but the area I'm building. Oh no, my Doomblade is my cavalry. Um. Oh boy. So you're actually managing to run it? Is that so? No, 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 no. I'm not gonna die. It's just really annoying. I mean, I guess I get to PVE in my starting location more, but. Oops. Uh, question, question for my teammates. Does anyone have 950 gold exactly to give to Daddy Volkmar so he can upgrade his... No, sorry, I'm pretty much broke right now. Okay, does anyone have, like, 500 gold? Can we pool our resources? There's three of you. You know... I have 199. Okay. I think we pool our uh, turn ending. Uh, Zoe? Free kill? Uh, that, that was me. I have about okay. 200 gold. Uh, Zoe, do you have anything? I have a lot of gold. Oh, hash. Just give it to me. Yeah, send it. Oh, Thanks. unfortunately I'm against you. Did I stutter? It's a... Well, I guess we're just gonna stop construction there. I mean, that's only a thousand... Ah, fuck it. I don't know. Thanks, Ironbrow. Uh, uh, no need to tease and teach. You kinda need the cash for yourself. Alright. Oh, that's right, Ironbrow's gonna come out right up my ass here. Yep. Yes. <laughs> oh boy. Why doesn't... Why do I get minus 100% income generated? What the fuck? Do Under Cities not do anything? What? Under Cities, do they not do anything? Escape Under Cities. Wait, what do you... Well, you have to build buildings in them. Yeah, but like, income generated, 200, minus 100%, zero. Um, there's some that give you food. Some that give you uh, know, and income. Like, why is this yeah, why yeah, is some... income zero instead of 200? Why is it minus 100%? Okay, while Hildrick tries to figure out basic game mechanics, almost all Tomb King units went down a tier. Uh, Ushabdi are tier one, or sorry, tier two and tier three. Um, let's see here. Sepulchral Stalkers, I think it's Necropolis Knights came down to tier three. Tomb Guard, were they always tier two? Anyway, you get Nehekarn Warriors, I think... Were they tier 2 or tier 1? I think these came down a tier, I'm pretty sure. Nehekarn Warriors got buffed, they now get 7 bonus versus infantry, which is pretty good. Screaming Skull Catapults are actually really overpowered right now. Um, that's it, they're, they're actually just kind of really overpowered right now, not gonna lie. Batteries need recharge. Or competes. Okay, who's uh who's still going? Ah, uh, Hash, you you missed my nuanced discussion about the virtues of free company militia against swordsmen and auto resolve. I actually think free company militia are better in auto resolve than swordsmen. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. I think that Panzer didn't understand that Volkmar got changed. Like Volkmar gives them ten physical resist and eight melee defense. Turn one. And then, like, the only way that swordsmen are better would be if, um, 
like they get full red line. But even then, the free company militia get 10% ammo and 10% missile damage. I just don't know how that factors in auto resolve, or if it does at all. I'll have you know, I've never experienced this start before. Boy, I'm gonna get killed. This might be a short game. Uh, Warzog, I'm gonna need you to, like, expand a lot and very quickly. You're kind of our late game carry right now. They've Warzog, got, they got carry? Zinch late game carry. We Oh, have you seen Warzog's late game naked orc horde? Does he still give them, like, 70% physical oh, yeah. resistance? Yep. Yep. Even if he didn't have that, that's it's gonna magic be... alone is busted. But uh, he's gonna have a hard time with Zinch, right? Magic um, is, uh, yes. missiles. I don't think he'll have a hard time with anything. Savage Orc Biguns, as of now, on turn 4, are already... Let me... Let me wait, can, can I click this? Okay, so you're already 40, 45 weapon strength, 8 anti-large, 44 melee attack. With a 59 charge bonus. <laughs> Already at 45 physical resist and frenzy, which would bring them to over 50 damage with 55 melee attack. And it only gets better from here. Oh, I got nothing to do. I, I move and I... Yep. Oh wait, they changed Kairos. They made his all of his changing of the ways become research now. Yep. Kairos got uh, put in his place. His place being not stealing your settlements turn three. What the I fuck mean, is the Bubonic still... Swarm? Uh, it's underneath me, Tornado. It's the faction underneath me. To the right. Does anybody have 200 gold for me? Which faction are you? Uh, not on your team. I'm uh, Krokka. Oh. Uh, yeah, I have 200 gold for you. I Remember, if you guys pull your gold each turn to build shit, it works better. So, like, you know what? Can we, let, let's split the teams here real quick. Who's on my team? It's me, Hildred. I actually, I actually don't have the gold croc guard because it would. Oh wait, hold. Anadoniac. And who, who's this guy? Shoke, Shoke, Shoke. Okay. Does anyone need gold pulled to them? Because we keep pulling our gold each turn. We can, uh, you know, like get capitals and shit built up if you ever have the growth. I mean, I got 20k at the start, but I don't need any gold. But if anyone needs gold, I can get. I am going to need help because the silver host moved in a really fucky way. So I'm gonna be like, instead of instead of taking the creator of the Walking Dead and then fighting Thoric for uh, the mountain. I'm gonna be taking the creator of the Walking Dead while he's running done from the mountain and killing me. There. Are you good with your turn? Uh, I'm getting things on. Getting money. Yeah. Money won't help uh, me. I, I need. I need armies. Okay, I mean, I guess I could send one army down, but I'm also fighting all of the guys right now. No, 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 no. I mean, I don't need it like literally at this moment, but. Stop this works. Because the Caracasol is already on my border and I got Gorfang Rogue on my border as well. It's going to be icy. Okay, if the Silver Host plays Leapfrog with me, this would suck. I'm hoping they go back to defend Lamia. But if they go back to defend Lamia, that's not great for me either. Can yes! You get okay, cool. Do you think they'd uh, take an ambush stance? Hmm. Okay, Caracas Gal is mine. The dwarves move away. As have smiles on us. This is now Liberus. Um, Lex Tails Roof. Where did my five points go to? One, two, three. Wow, really? 
Yeah, I think for early game, I'm just gonna tank up my melee. Because that'll give me good auto resolves. As quick as level 6, that's good. I, I could go... I, I just don't think... Yeah, like, her... her. Okay, like, I'll give you this. Graceful Warrior is good. But, like, Indomitable Will, as I remember, is pretty shit. Yeah, that that's shit. So I'd have to put one, two, three points. Now, Graceful Warrior is good. Speed and melee defense. But, like, none of these other ones... I mean, the Woundmaker is okay. Desert Strike is pretty good, too, if I could ever get to it. But I think I'm just going to focus on Red Line. I'm going to go Sun Scorch Bones, Elite Cavalrymen. Sun Scorch Bones tanks up oh. my early game. Elite Cavalrymen. Purple is nice. I'm going to need to get all three of these eventually. So we're going to be sitting down here in this line basically until end game. Move your tails. Hello? What? Can I move? I can move. What? Yes. I can't. I can't. That's why. Valiant defeat, really? Okay. I mean, if you think you win it, we could play it out. No. It's just. Isn't it's, it? Isn't it a really good army right now? Kill no okay. Yeah, Quake's not even that tanky right now. Well. I don't know. I think I could I could make Caracas Gulcher five from the get go. By the way, you could what? I could make Caracas Gulcher five from the get go. Oh, uh, yeah, then do it. I think I don't know how much food I need, but if I do it, that means I could ex I could scale really hard and really fast. Fight quick, because the I mean it's the uh, the issue food is bad. Okay, I'm gonna mute here so they, The thing about Queek is he's got a pretty decent charge, decent question mark speed, but he has 35 anti infantry. So, like, on top of his armor being okay, um, he's got a decent melee attack, 66 ain't bad. It's really just the fact that if Queek touches infantry, they get massacred. So, like,. The only thing he would struggle with is the trolls, but he does have a Halbeard Storm Vermin, and he could always just surround them. And I believe chieftains are anti-large anyway, so he could just chieftain them. Yeah, and I get I get gemstones as well from this tier five. I feel like that battle is actually kind of winnable. Kind of, maybe. I mean, do you get both your lords in here? Me? Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. I, well, I, I still have one that's recruiting, so I'm gonna next turn I'm gonna move him to Quick. I feel like getting six more clan rats to him. Yeah, Quick is here, my three chieftains are here. It would probably be very easy to win, but I don't want to bother because it's going to be against players and that's why not really annoying. Huh? What the fuck? Okay. Or does that to Retreat! Everyone. Not my fault! Alright. <laughs> okay. Did he, did he just ambush you? Yeah. Just ambush me. Oh my god. 
by one lord, that's not doing anything. I guess I have to kill Malagor too, fucking hell. Oh my god, the wait, they're all coming here. Oh my lord. Wait, the fucking Malagor is here to look at this, what the fuck? Yeah, that's what I was looking at. Oh my god, okay, uh, what the fuck? He must send a lord, uh, with 10. I might be fucked, so... It's gonna retreat from me. Kinda close. <laughs> Not my fault! What the hell is this? It's so dumb. The goddess wills it. Like Malagor is already here with a full army, it's like he's <laughs> Yeah, you kinda get screwed on that RNG. You're gonna that stay in ambush. Each percent chance. I say, say, move! This is my I'm gonna go ambush stance, so either the AI will run up to me and die, or my hopefully they don't garrison. Either way. Well, actually, what I can do, do not here... Not yet. Advance. Oh wait, there's no way their army reaches there. Is it hot? Can I fight it? Oh. Yeah, so I have five AI armies on my borders right now. Liberus shall rise again! Come on, magic. I think I'm just gonna do channeling to get my magic up. Even though we don't really have much magic. Having some magic is better than no magic. Stream! This army oh, cannot Lord. reach Lamia by next turn. Bring me so I'm just gonna start channeling now. Get my magic up instead of down. And then uh yeah. Bow Your commission. Move my creations. I must consider. Wait. Yeah, everyone's around us. There's Thoric here, Karkar here, um, Zinch here, and then over here there's, uh, what's his face? I'm gonna have to tank hella aggression here, which isn't great. Well, I've 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 still got my great incantation of power. Well, here's the ping. They come towards me. Yeah, if I blow my great incantation of power, then I won't... Yeah, I, I think... I mean, I could go for the Casket of Souls and try to get a second one, but I'm really... Reasonably, I'm only going to get one. So I think I just wait as long as I can. I mean, I could also use it to get a better auto-resolve. Are you good? Lagging, my It's really lagging.
Well, I just realized a really funny irony. Maggots. See his name. Interesting. Yeah, this is exactly what I mean with very hard AI being dumb as shit. They literally left their capital. Obey me. It just it doesn't make any sense why they're so stupid. Uh to play it out if you can't win it. Are you guys good to play out a battle? Yeah. Yeah. Uh they have black knights and grave guards. Oh, you should win that easily, you know. I think I just get the casket of souls and we're good, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'll just go grab a casket of souls and toss it in that army. That might even let me auto resolve it. Whatever. You need money for the ritual? I got it. Well, as soon as things stop happening. So how does the ambush... Can you attack with the ambush stance and does it work? Skaven have a special stance that lets them ambush attack, but it is a really low chance to work after St nerves. Stalk. Yeah. Oh my god, what is holding up... Something is holding up our ability to do stuff. Who we fight. Hello? Attack. You guys doing a dilemma? What's going on? He's doing a dilemma, Who yes. You can see it in the top left. Why is it taking so long to do this? I don't know. He's probably choosing whether or not he wants to take the fight. Okay, are you guys good to play a battle? Uh, let me do mine first. Well, no, 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 we, we can only play out one battle. No, but like, other I need to do my other resolve. There you go. Why is it so laggy down there? Holy shit. I have 15 right. FPS here. I don't know, why is it being so laggy for you? Because, like, I don't... I, I think my army would take a lot of casualties, but I just don't see any way they win this, right? And the problem is if I wait a turn, they're going to get into the capital and defend it. Should win this. We need to win it with, with really good casualties, too. Yeah. Or is my army too... Open field. Shoot, I don't know. I mean, I got a lot of... I got a lot of cannons, or sorry, artillery. Shabti, Karian. I feel like my army might not be able to take this without too many losses to where the undead kill me. I don't know, maybe I wait in the AI attacks when we can win that. Strike like the I don't know, I don't want to take it, because the problem is, if I take it and the AI counterattacks me, I might just get pushed out of the game. Eljik, you good? Yeah. I mean, that's... Uh, 
Get some out it's off. Oh, no, it's still lost. Okay. Uh, then I do do. Yeah, I mean, I, I hope they put their army in the city, and then they can just both take attrition. My real hope is they try to attack me. That would be ideal. I mean, the army is probably gonna attack you. Just kidding off. What is taking so long with people solving dilemmas? I, I'm. It's just war declarations, right? How do they take like 12 minutes to be like, yes, I am being declared war on? Are we talking at the same time? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, fuck off. This guy just like keeps coming down here and killing my lords. It's, I'm just pissing me off. You see this shit with Managor? Yeah, I see him. I can't even beat that, like his army is way too strong. Nope, they ditched their capital. Direct damage. Which is the best one here? Oh my god, he crashed. Oh no, never mind. Good. Yeah, you don't. You I don't... think I'm, I might be fucked here. Yeah. I think I might actually be fucked because Manicor is like killing me with uh, use his full stack. Well, I, I don't know. <sighs> okay, which is my best spell? Chat, is it... Do I go for the damage one? Damn, they gave me the, um... The thing where you get to recruit a hero, and they chose for me and they gave me two prints. Good. I don't know if that's good. Attack! Well, the AI ran away. Get them! So I think at this point, I'll take Put pirate victory. My queendom expands. Vengeance. Goddess wills it. Asap smiles on us. Why do I now have six capacity? Oh. Queen Kalida. No, the Necrotech didn't do it. Get the things. Let's test move. Very well. Bring me Neferata's head! Where are my slaves? Answer your queen! Why do I now have a six unit capacity? Scream! What happened? Asaf agrees. I don't think it has anything to do with her. The goddess wills it. Libarus shall rise again.
So what did you lose in that fight? Me? Yeah. Nothing. Oh. My only hope- okay, if the AI actually runs at me and sieges, that might fuck me, but the AI doesn't do anything ever. Pyrrhic victory and I kill Malagor? Mm. I could also fight- do I fight this manually or do I get the Pyrrhic victory and lose my- Malagor is gonna run around and spellcast. What are you losing? Uh, my entire army. Except like the catapult. Eh, I guess I could just rebuild. Well, I mean, the only thing is, I know, I know, most beastmen start with pretty good armies. You have chieftains. Yeah, okay, I killed him. Chieftains. Aren't I do good. have my chieftains. I mean, I killed him. I just lost like all my. Yes, rats, I'm my saying you. Runners. I'm saying Malagar is a very good starting army. You have chieftains, which are nice, but he's got a whole army. Yeah. Well, I guess Quick is really high level now because I'm getting attacked by a lot of AIs. I don't have my full province yet, but hey. Remember, if you fight more battles, like, they, they have balanced a game so that just free expansion doesn't do as much as you think it will. Yep, okay, they're not even gonna come here and siege down my shit army. Wow, very hard, it just basically turns the AI off. It's so wacky. I just got a good trait. Man, I think seeing she's having a bad time too. Oh, yeah, that's. Hmm. Yeah, I'm level 9, at least. I mean, that's good. High Queen Kalida, death becomes me. I'll have your soul. Did it lost? Kill all. Kill for Asa. I am their queen now. Onward, soldiers. Why is shifting so shit? Only 50 minutes, like. 50 is good for a hero. It's because also they're anti large. Oh. Yeah, like if you're fighting trolls or something, yeah, chieftains are how you deal with it early game. Because your Skaven aren't doing shit. Hmm? I'm making a joke that Skaven bad. Oh. Okay, I think Skeleton Horsemen might be the only units that are actually worse than Skeleton <laughs> Regular Frontliners. I mean, do I bother to put my points in elite cavalrymen? Wait, why am I clan rats? What the f- Oh no, no, no. My nurse still shoots. I mean, my clan rats are pretty much useless. You good? The archer buff doesn't really do that much. 
It only affects a few units. Uh, the ammo isn't really that great either. Into the holes. I mean, are Nehekar and Horsemen any good yet? I thought they buffed them. Yeah. They're not really that great, but they are horsemen. I don't know. They're like they're like really weak heavy cav. I feel like I just sit on my horse. Get a second army, uh, horse. I feel like I just sit I don't fuck, I don't know. Sepulchral Starkers, those are how I scale. Sepulchral. Sepulchral? Those are my actual well, wait. No. Yeah, wait. The the Sepulchral Starcher red buff doesn't even give them better. That's lame. The goddess wills it. Yeah, you know, the thing is, like, her being her, I already get poison attacks on everyone. And I already get 20% ammunition from my thing. So, like, I, I'm never, I'm not really ever going to run out of ammo. So, I beefed up my front line. I mean... Shoot. None of these are really doing that much for me. Yeah, I mean, I could sit, but the thing is, I'm gonna sit with archers. Red King. Eventually, I'm dropping. Eventually, I'm dropping my other units. But none of this other stuff really does that good. God, these lines are actually just so bad. Like, they're just so bad. Come then. I really don't understand why I don't get any money from this shit. Oh well, whatever. Such fines. More slaves. I need more. Sepulchro stalkers are like my best, that's like how this army gets to late game, but I'm looking at its red line and I'm like, ugh. Oh my god, that's a lot of money. These guys give me 7,000 to peace. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah. Take it. Do it. Take it. There you go, 7,000. I have like 20,000 in the bank now. I thought I was doing bad, but I'm still doing fine because the squeaky level is level 10. So long as you keep fighting and keep generating money, plus you've got food, so you can get that settlement up to tier 4 or 5 anyway. Yeah. I think I'm just gonna go get tier 5, so I get a big advantage over everyone else. And I just get my win. Huh? Why is he? What? Where? Uh. Why is he... <laughs> Did he misclick? I'm gonna speak to that. He was gonna lose a, a Blessed Soros Warrior in auto-resolve. 
Oh. Yeah. Well, there's one thing you could do, by the way. There's of course, Hash wants to be the slave. Yeah. So, there is one thing you can do to avoid losing Why would. Guys, wait, we're supposed to. Why are we not playing as the AI? What are you gonna because do? Just you're slaves. Oh, who gives a shit? Ha I'll do as Hash much damage as I can. Hash explaining why he needs a lot of assistance to micro the fucking Skaven slaves. No, I'm saying, like, what are you, you're gonna, you're gonna just sit here and watch? Like, what's the point of yes. that? I was saying, one thing you can do to avoid losing some of your units is you get the second lord, and you put the damage unit into your second lord, and you move the second lord away. It's an so underway interception. Just do that next time, so you don't have to... Like, it's an underway time. interception. Place looks lovely. Honestly. Oh, okay. oh yeah, okay, yeah. What what do map? Waiting for Shin Shin. Yeah, I don't know what Pretty it is. The wheels serve. Honestly, looking at these fucking big ass underways, you makes you wonder how they haven't collapsed yet. Because <laughs> Skaven engineering. <laughs> The Skaven just, like, put more scaffolding up whenever the old scaffolding begins to collapse. I mean, how did they get the giant bell? Like, what is the point of this giant bell that's just in the middle of the... Spooky? It's it's it a whole rings. Skaven artifact, what do you mean? What's the point of the bell? Uh, it's just, like, probably an alarm. Like, did they just ring it when there's people coming through or something like that? No, 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 no. The Skaven actually... I have a religious thing going on oh, with right. bells. With the bells, yeah. Sure. Yeah, they love their bells. Can we like three speed this? Something. Are you guys uh, you guys are whining at me for taking time? You're, you're setting up your formations. Hey, we're the ones with something to lose here. You just have a bunch of funny Skaven slaves that you get to int. Yeah. You guys are like, all right, we gotta have to defend our positions perfectly. Uh, okay, you're in charge of the cavalry. And I'm gonna need you to flank to the shage. I mean, he's only playing it because he would have lost Blessed. Why don't just the... Why don't the massive Skaven Slave Horde just kill their leader and run? The only person in your entire <laughs> army that isn't a slave is the leader. Yeah. yeah. What's wrong with that? I don't think that should be a feature. If you, if you, um... If you have an army of only slaves, they should rebel against your lord. No, but Skavens know their lot in life. They like being slaves. Like the oh, uh, oh, this, this must be a uh, a Rowling novel. That makes sense. <laughs> well, to be fair, the, the Skaven slaves are also like the weakest Skaven. Like they're like the weakest, most pathetic. Like they probably would have died if they didn't oh, be slaves. So they just yeah. they just take being a slave over being eaten. Mm. Yeah, they clearly have leverage here. Maybe they've been so psychologically beaten that they don't even care anymore. That's what it is. They just want to die. Faced. I would honestly be a Skaven Slave, Skaven Slave Slinger. Because you're in a bag <laughs> and you just... You throw just rocks. chuck rock. So, if you see one thing, when you look at the Skaven close-up, they have like flies going around them. Hildrick, yeah. whenever he he runs out of ammunition, ammunition as a Skaven slave slinger, and then he's instructed to pull his dagger out and charge, <laughs> because the Skaven player doesn't want to uh, no, have no, his no, really good take damage. Uh, uh, I think that, that was a bad play, though. No? That Stegodon's just gonna. They don't do any damage. Don't worry. Oh no, not the clan rats. Skaven Literally the highest the quality shield. unit on the battlefield for the Skaven aside from the Lord. Yeah. Might want to charge your Skaven slaves, uh, Ash. What? Why? You think I want my Skaven slaves like engaged as quickly as I can get them? Yeah. Well, they well they have a, a five charge bonus. <laughs> yeah, I I think I want my Skaven slaves out of melee for as long as I can keep them out of melee. <laughs> when you're a rat and you have to fight against a dinosaur. 
You know, I don't know where this moose is more like slings or so units. Because slings are super fucking strong. Like, uh. In the, um, in the SFO mod, they removed Scape and Slave Slingers. Really? Which is weird to me. Why? It's kind of weird. Yeah. I think it's because it that it was just what everyone went, which is Scape and Slave Slingers. Yeah, because the problem is you get. What are they? 140 Skaven Slaves, and even though they only do one armor piercing damage, as you can see, with that Stegadon, you can you can do some whittling. When you sign up to be a fucking slave to carry rocks around, and you, you get told to fight dinosaur people. But no, the thing is, like, slave, um, slaves are, like, even, like, real, 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 real world, the fucking sling could, like, kill you instantly. Well, yes, it's, it's, to the chest. Your it's an underway battle, so you don't need a you don't you don't need to finish this. He he he's harvesting dopamine. Let him have his fun. <laughs> All right, well well played, Hash. Well played, well played, well played. Good it was battle. close. Good kill. Sorry, guys. You I want to lose my my blessed source warriors? This was literally the only thing I'm. I was I would be losing if I would all resolve it. I believe you. Liv. You killed Liv the rat. Hey, I, I, I killed I killed a couple sorry sores there. Yeah. Um do they get wiped if they got uh, intercepted? Yes. Yes, it's an yes. under but I'm not sure. It's so sad, like Liv was just trying to travel to Skaven Blade with his harem of slaves and he got killed. <laughs> By a dinosaur. <laughs> Man. With the giant you dinosaurs. Play a literary dinosaur, yeah. <laughs> Liv was a successful member of the community with a lot of lots of property, and he was brutally murdered. He just tried to live. Well, if the slaves were actually happy, maybe Liv was a nice slave master. Somebody Quick has, is gonna. Quick is gonna hear about this. He's not gonna be happy. Somebody has. Somebody has to tell his whiff. Someone's coming home to Quick. Quick. I don't that? think Liv is making it for dinner. Why not? Why not? <laughs> I I set a place for him. My best friend Liv. <laughs> he got fucking eaten by a dinosaur man. How did don't you have go, friends. You, so you they intercepted them, and it thought in that auto resolve that anything bad was gonna happen when they literally yeah, can't. Wanna be to the blessed souls or it's just so. Ash, don't say, don't, don't say, my friend. Say, my least hated foe rival. Yes. <laughs> um, Shok. So Manfred just ran his entire army down to go colonize Sun Tree Glades, a level zero settlement, leaving his main settlement completely open to attack. I told you, if you plan very hard, it literally makes it easier. I don't know why. The AI, they, okay, I ran at their capital, they left their capital, then they had two full armies, right? And I was like, oh shit, they're gonna defend. And they were like, no, no, they ditched. So, with two full stacks, they never fought a single major battle and lost everything. Yeah, this guy is lo loyalty zero. What happens if he's loyalty zero? He's gonna have a rebel, right? Yeah. Yeah. I know, spawn random units. Good, that means I can just get my XP for free. Good. C Commander rebels and brings dinner. Yeah, anybody gonna, got I'm like? Anybody got like 400? Uh, I have uh, yeah. thousand. All right, let's move back up to people. Yep. Yeah. But I enjoy hanging Crushing out here. Defeat. Crushing defeat. Isn't crushing defeat even worse than PCC defeat? Yes. Uh huh. Okay, I'm gonna be honest, I don't think any of these red lines... The only good reason... Okay, so if I went fully down the red line, I could get reanimate upgraded. That would be decent, but I... Do I just keep skeleton archers until late game? Like, there's no way, right? I don't think so. What? Yeah, because like you you, 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 keep, you keep Tomb Guard until late game, so that one makes sense. But 
The yeah. skeleton archer meme I'm doing, I don't think that lasts till late game. Okay. Caracas got level 4. Here we go. I need more. Good Caracas go. Good job. You had to tier 4? Yeah, okay. Could be tier 5 if I paid there. It took a few tries, but I finally got the Ushabti Carver. So, what does the Ushabti line do? It's Sepulchral Starcher, it's Necrophix, Tombscore. No, not that one. Hero Titan, Ushabti, and Ushabti Great Bow. Are they Doom Wheel? I don't remember if Doom Wheels and shit aren't good. I think I that's be. probably the best. I could. And I don't know what they. If I even bother building anything else, yeah. You know. Rapunz robbed me of 2k. Liberus shall rise again! Nice. Good. I can't even afford to rebuild my settlement. Me on the way to build even more clan rats. Is there literally even a point to going with Skeleton Horsemen? They're like the only unit in the game that is actually worse. The insanely low unit size... The fact... Skeleton Horsemen actually get... Oh god, they're just so bad. Yeah, they're just amazing. The goddess wills it. We begin! Actually, no, that won't work. Asap smiles on us. You can rest in the show. Yes, what does Scaven Corruption do exactly? It's kind of... It fucks me, but it's also good. Bring me Neferata's head! Yeah, I'm going, I'm going with the, uh... Ushabti and, uh... Ushabti Great Bow buff. And I guess Hero Titan, if we ever get Tier 5, but... I'm gonna I'm give you guys a hint. We're not gonna get Tier 5. I like Quick, by the way. He's pretty fun. He's not shit. Hi, Queen Kalida. So, um, I mean, skeleton or archers are not that good. Also, carrions are really shit. Uh, Ash. Yep. Should probably replace that by like a. And I just get the wires. Nope. They're gonna outperform skeletons. Hmm? They're gonna outperform skeletons. I don't know about that. They will outperform skeletons. The only unit that's questionable is a horseman. Mm, yeah, the horsemen are shit though. I mean they do their own. I shall the Karen only for some reason. No, Manfred's giving me a hundred gold for a non aggression pact. If you guys need money, by the way, tell me, because I have like 20,000 right now. Yeah, but you're gonna spend that really quickly here. That's yeah, true. Let's get Karakazul.
the fuck? Scarsing's just confederated uh, Carcade Peaks. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Actually, I guess I could use a special Necrotect. That is true. Perform an action with a Necrotect hero. Does an action count as... That is wait, 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 wait. Does it count just joining an army as an action? I don't think so. I do think so, because it's, um... The goddess will like, uh, maybe then. It yeah. tries. Well, okay, Hildrick, don't answer. Does... Let me ask my chat. Chat, does joining an army count as an action for this, right? They're saying yes. Attacker, Clan Moors. Winner, Clan Moors. Scream! The climate is irrelevant. Such great, I'll set the slaves to work. Asap smiles on us. Well, it's available in one turn. Does he get movement when I use it? Or does he start without movement? Like, am I gonna have to wait a turn or not after I do that right? I oh, don't fuck it. Getting to tier 3 would be really good. Okay, so the Beastmen are now on my southern border. Beastmen? Lizardmen. Uh, money doesn't do anything for me. Eventually, yeah. Next turn? Yeah, actually I will need money next turn. Now that I'm thinking about it. I'll give you like 2,000. What happened to your- didn't you say you had, quote, 20,000 gold? Yeah, but I'm gonna build shit next turn, so... Maybe it doesn't really matter how much I have. Is my faction buff potion? What do you mean potion? Poison? No. Uh, I mean, we, we I get poison on my entire army, but no, I don't buff it. No, I, I, I get it. Kalita gives her entire army poison, but she doesn't buff it.
So like, yeah, I mean, that's one of the reasons my skeleton archers are good, is because they get poison on range. So as you don't know, poison reduces your damage and speed by 15%. So my front line ends up being way tankier because they all have poison. And then my range units slow down. That's why I stacked the shit out of horse archers, by the way. Because uh, if I actually get into a fight here, those horse archers are going to be 10 bitches on a bitch train full of bitches for the opponent opponents to deal with. I really hope it didn't cancel my abandon. You good, Choke? Choke. No, I'm getting erect. I mean, do you need to play it out? No, 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 I'm good. Liberus shall rise again. I ignore the critics. Focus! This is my endeavor! I could shake and break st Okay, does anyone have any money to pull into me? Like, right now? The more money, the better. If I don't have money, I'm kinda doomed. I can spare boots. Cause I just, uh, destroyed my capital and resettled it tier 3. So, like, I can slowly build it up, but with both their armies right on my border about now, um... Yeah, I kinda need to get my Ushapti rolling. Could you suck? Okay, that's Tornado finishing that off. Okay, does anyone else have money? Yeah, sure. Or... Speak that good. Ask me good. for some money, Nash, because I can't give you money. It's like too small. Mm. Might have just crashed. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Hold on. I think it crashed. So we have to do our turns again? Maybe. Yep, it crashed. Uh, I crashed. Oh shit. Hey. Yeah, oh, I'll, what? I'll post the code in a second. Do I just press all the four? Or do I wait until it kicks us out? I mean, I would restart the game when you have the time to restart the game. Oh, never mind. I drew. Gives uh, memory leaks and all that. Yeah, I've completely fucked up the start of the game. Just saying. Who are you playing as? I fucked Zinch. up mildly, but not like in a bad way or irrecoverable. Yeah. I mean, considering I, mean, I never played to start in this difficulty, I think I'm doing alright. 
the thing is that with uh, with Croca, if you auto resolve the first battle, it doesn't really matter because you need to wait about two or three turns anyways to siege the next settlement. Because you're uh, any else, you're gonna lose uh, the fight. You you literally have to abuse ambushing. I mean, yeah. you don't actually have to, but yeah. No, I didn't do actually. I didn't abuse it. Yeah, because Krokar gets a hundred percent ambush chance. So. Yeah, I know. It's pretty. Sad. All right, there we go. Um, I don't know whichever channel you guys are in. This one. Uh, just do. Did your game just crash or did it like freeze? Yeah, I went to open Diplo and I crashed. I'm assuming because he was opening Diplo, so we just double open Diplo. Yeah, that's what that's where we crashed before, right? Because yeah. about three people <laughs> opened diplomatic. Elements. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, like I said, if like human human Camry or human uh Honestly, I actually think Volkmar and Camry are like a great team. I mean, they both hate Manfred, right? Don't well, worry. I mean, don't worry, Tornado. Vlad is a little tricky to deal with, so. Yeah. You're gonna be absolutely massacre murdered by Orkhan. Probably, yeah. I mean, I don't know. What am I gonna do? Cope? And seed. <laughs> Ready up, gamers. Eldrick. <laughs> he's he's muted and deafened. Can you ping him? So how's uh Libaris going, Hash? Yeah, you know, I dare you guys to come in here. We I saw you were abandoning abandoning Libaris. Hash, we have we have Not evidence that player. points to you having a bad time. Uh, I don't think you guys know what I'm doing. No, we don't know what you're doing, but we feel like there's reason to believe that you might be dying or something. No, I don't think you guys know what I'm doing. I'm using advanced technologies far beyond your own understanding. He's dying. He, he's coping. He's, he's definitely dying. Things that you will never be able to understand. He's definitely dying. I, I, that is hard cope. Yeah, I'm just waiting for him to run us down. We'll just walk in there and just like... 10 Skaven stacks sitting in ambush. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I don't know how the Skaven ambush anyone. Mostly because, like, wouldn't you smell them? Kinda, yeah. Like, I think you would like... hear the chittering and chattering. I mean, isn't the point that they come from the underground when they ambush someone? Like, lore-wise? Alright, every everyone, well, your turns. This time. is your end of turn, so just, just click end turn. Bring me Neferata's head! Begin, yeah, Animus! Do we have to do our turns again, or...? No, this is no, the no, end of your turn. It's the auto resolve. This is okay, right... Go, this is down. literally... It took an auto save before the end of the turn. There's nothing you haven't done. If you clicked end turn last time, you can click it now. Yeah, everyone's checking everything to make sure, but I promise you, it takes the auto save as the turn ends. So there's nothing, Ooh. Anhedoniac, there's nothing you did that you aren't doing. So, I'm gonna move. Oh, I can't move yeah. down. Is it just me or is Thoric like kind of a Chad pick? Like legit, almost OP. Um, I would I mean, call him. Getting... I would call him as close as you can get to OP without just being directly OP. It's okay. We so have if... Archon in the West to evening him out. So, so if so, if Thoric would be a vampire, that would make him OP. Well, the, the reason Thoric? vampires OP is they can just. So... Vampires just mass good? expand and take fight after fight after fight after fight, yeah. and then they're also now good in combat. Here's the problem with Torek. Torek is really good, but, uh, but he starts to run out of time. Are they gonna the nerf vampires? I mean, our problem is that we are all I've pretty... No uh, they will probably oh, nerf the raise dead mechanic, because it is quite cracked. This is my endeavor. 
Also, Thorak's kind of nerfed because he can't. I'm pretty sure some of his the uh, artifacts are in friendly settlements, so he won't be able to get them. Yeah, oh, the artifacts. The artifacts are for like the shittiest shit, though. Everyone, everyone keeps being like, I can't get my extremely overcost Carno sword that also I get no buffs for because I'm Thorak. Hmm. All right, let's all move to the channel but underneath. It's a T Rex. Yes, he can get a T-Rex, but it's just... It's a fucking dinosaur, dude. What do you got against it's that? It's really cool, I, I assure you, but it's just not really that good. That sounds fucking sick. Okay, um... How can I not... There we go. Speak that things! I'm just gonna hang out here, do you mind? Yes. Why? Do you, do you, do you hate me in particular? Yes. Precisely. <laughs> yes. I only take heads with meat on skull. <laughs> you know interest. Uh, can I just get like, uh, I don't know, like, like this, this much? Hold on here, this much. Wait, what do you, what do you think? How can much? I, this, this much, can I just, can I just bleed the Skaven bankers? A little bit, you know, set my capital up, you know, get myself a little bit of a... Yeah, I did. Yeah. One sec, uh... Because I set my capital up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... Because I already, okay, I already have the Ushapti Carver. Because I, I was re-rolling my Necrotect. For like three turns, I got the Ushapti cover. So the second I get that Ushapti building going, I can actually just start pounding them out. Should I even produce gems? Is there an advantage? I wonder. Okay, my capital is all set up. Okay. Now we just wait, and it will start upgrading. In the meantime... Okay, do I go... Do I go to Thoric first, or should I go defend against the Lizardmen? I feel like I need to defend against the Lizardmen first. Is it hot? Scotty, no, Scotty. Should I get the Flock of Jeff? Is that a good one or not? Stop, no. I can't remember. It has flaming and magical mm. text, and that's all I know about it. Declare this nest mine, mine. Is a flock of Joff good? Anyone? Anyone know about the flock of Joff? The Joff of Flaka? No idea. Probably pretty bad. You think everything is bad though. Mm. Ah, whatever, we'll awaken it. Maybe in a pinch I can use it. Hi, Queen Kalida. When the time is right. Dead march. Move, but not yet. Okay, I'm gonna go grab my food when the turn starts. No one do anything that'll require me to be here for at least three minutes. I'm gonna wait for the turn to end though. Flock of Jeff. Yeah. The climate is irrelevant. 
The goddess wills it. Armor for infantry, weapon strength for infantry, speed for cavalry, Are charge for cavalry. Let's do that. Under the suns. Oh, he's right on my border. Not this time. The queen. Let's uh, let's just go run down here real quick. Yeah, I'm about to get two v one. Yeah, I see that. Okay, don't do anything that needs me for like one minute. Into the holes. Okay. We're good. Um. Let's see here. In a pinch, you guys could give me gold. Okay, they're declaring war. In a pinch, you guys could give me gold, and I could uh, activate my sand veil. That'd give us five turns, but I want to wait till at least Thoric is here. Let me get one more turn. You guys, just accept it. You guys, just accept the war. There's nothing to look at here. Just accept the war. I, I can't. What do you mean you can't? There's nothing. What do you mean there's nothing? I don't have a request. I think we win that. Okay. Oh, he's just, he's just, he's fucking full bail. Liberus shall rise again. How does he have so much movement? He ran all the way up here and then ran all the way down there. What the fuck? This city, mine, mine. Asaf agrees. Move, march! Affirmation. <laughs> Move, Tyrells! Oh, I know. They're both gonna try to 2v1 me. But I have a plan. What's the plan? I'm just gonna ram into one of them, rather than fight both. There's a man of two armies. Honestly, if Thoric runs up here, I think he's the easiest to take. 120 armor. No, he'll get demolished. Vengeance. He can't reach my artillery.
He can be as unkillable as he wants. He'll slowly get drained away by artillery during the battle and horse archers. Who is giving me a pending negotiation? Get the things. Let's see, I get my second army next turn, but it's not going to be filled with anything good. Good, Hildrick? Yeah. Wait, do you know? Tudor hasn't killed him yet? Mm. Should I send my engineer to make another city or destroy one tier of the dwarves? Or do I send it to the dwarves? The dwarves have shit growth, so knocking him down a tier would actually destroy him. But. Okay. He is Thorig, so it doesn't really matter. Mm. Send like an army of like war fighters or something to you. It'd be nice. I also could use more gold. I don't have any right now. I'm gonna make six war fighters and send them down. Summon me if you dare. Okay, I'm gonna engage with Ironbrow. Are you sure? Yes. I'm gonna encircle him. They have to make a move now. Otherwise, I attrition him. Lizard men should still be one turn away from um, Rosetra. Thank you. 
Okay, well. if we fight this. Is it very victory or close to peep? Oh, that's gonna be a loss, maybe. What really? How? You don't see. I think you'll see. Oh, he only has 145 armor. This is gonna be easy. There's not even. A... Do you guys see my army? Yeah, shit. They literally can't touch his army. Why? Because they're dwarfs. They can't move. They have 28 speed. Okay, what happens when the ultimate troops run out of ammo? I'm. I'm Kalita. I get twenty percent more ammo. Okay. We're gonna do our functions on my phone. Who chose to spectate? Siege. Why? Give me your suffers. Okay, but I'm gonna give them to you. I need you to vanguard some in the back and shoot down his corollar. Yeah, there you go. Uh, okay, so, um... Shulk, what are you good at? I have no idea. Can you manage my front line and make sure he can't get past him? Sure. You're, you're not, you're not feeling me with enthusiasm. Okay, you take the two archers and you just make sure that they shoot at any corollaries who get in range. Okay. Can you get that book in the basket of souls? No. no okay. I don't trust you guys. Hi, Queen Kalida. Yeah, the horse archers have um, twenty-two volleys, so they're likely not going to be able to kill stuff. But then they can go into melee. Um, so long as you use their charge of twenty-eight. They still have three armor piercing, so you can cycle charge. But the main thing is just take out his artillery, and I'm gonna use my artillery, and I'm just gonna blow him to fucking pieces. Be fine, you have 440 range. Should I focus the Declutchers on the Parallers? Get, get rid of the, the Grudge Throwers. Okay. Oh wow, even my artillery has poison on it. Can you get, get the grudge throwers? Like, you just have to take out the grudge throwers so they stop counter sniping me. The most important thing is I don't lose any artillery. So just take out the grudge throwers. 
trying. Oh my god, okay, I'm gonna just have to shoot them. Okay, just back out, back out, you're taking way too many casualties. The grudge thrower... Okay, we won the artillery duel. Mortuary cult! Oh no, guys. They have high armor and shields. <laughs> Whatever shall I do? Aim for the quarrelers. They have less armor, even by five is gonna make a difference. Serve me! Rise my statues! <laughs> I'm just fucking destroying him. I like how every volley just takes half of the North Warriors' health. Oh, he ran his lord right past me. Abandon! Oh, the casket. Oh, he's shooting everything at the guys. Can you can you shoot those with your archers? Get the, get those off me with your archers. No, don't run the art. Get them off me. With, oh no. Great harvest. Okay, so where are... Oh, boy. Of course. 
algorithms. I you you never could get the grudge thrower? No. The fucking wrong is on the shoulder. Get some ships, get some ships. That's really bad. Yeah, I, I feel like you should have just charged the catapult. I couldn't. You had too many troops there. You had six horse archers. Yeah, and they died to quarrelers because they're fucking shit. Okay, but you don't give a shit about the quarrelers. You just had to take out the catapult. Okay, so I lose all the horse archers. Oh, you would not have lost every horse archer. I would. Okay, so you're telling me a couple quarrelers and a dwarf warrior would take out six horse archers. Yes, because the horse archers have no armor and they fucking lose to archers. You literally. Oh my god. Okay. I don't think you understand. Much. Like I, I literally focus fire the, the fucking roadster for like two minutes. It can only go to half HP. Well, the horse archers. Literally are take them and just run them the fuck up. Yeah, that's what I try to do. Hmm. Is this GG then? I mean, you're gonna have to pull up an army, but I kind of lost my late game. Okay, that is shit. How is Kalita shit? Because that she only gets one army and she gets switched down. I have okay. My one army was better than Thoric's army. Mm. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna need a Queek army here then. I'll try. Well, I, I, what, do you, what do you mean, try? Oh boy. Does anybody have money? I do not. I need more! Thoric Iron Brow! Nehekara rises from the sands! The ultimate shrine!
fight in my heart. is from the sands. All right, guys, toss me gold. I, I need at least 3,000 gold to summon the sands. Jason, so ask me then. Ask me, ask me. Speed. If I, if I summon the sandstorm, Damn, I can at scouts. least buy a little bit of time. Ask me then. I'm, I'm asking, I'm asking. Yeah, I got you, Macros. That was actually a good idea. I didn't think about that. I'm asking you. Wait, how am I a strength rank above you? That doesn't make any sense. Right, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Glory. <sighs> Horseman even gonna be good? It's gonna be a city fight, so I think we actually just go with you guys. Okay, I wanna let them walk in here, first thing. And then I'll do the sandstorm. Oh wait, why is it only available after three turns? Wait, I can't do it? Oh, that's bad. Okay, but it's still three turns. That should still be fine. Do I go with Nehikar and Hor- Oh boy, okay, let's just upgrade anything we can upgrade. I think that's... the best play. Except for Ray's Tread. That, that one's gonna get sacked. Nothing I can do about that. Submit to your king. I need to get the- okay, you know what, if I can't get- I mean, I can't get Casket for another 8 turns and I would need another 5,000 gold. Okay, so reasonably at this point... <sighs> I'm gonna kill the growth building, turn that into a chariot building, and then get a... Screaming Skull. Because we need artillery. If I have no artillery, I'm dead to dwarves. My I think artillery is not going to be useful in the lizard men, but in the dwarves. Alright, uh, you good, Choke? I got another Ushapti Carver, so I'm not too worried with my Necrotect. I just need to get the Ushapti building done, and then... Well, Ushapti are gonna suck, because they're never gonna actually be able to land a hit. But... Oh, wow, by the way, uh, what's that when you can? From the sands, I shall strike it! Uh, I mean, just click, yeah. That's just the like Ghoul Kings. Even though, technically, the Marshes of Madness are not occupied by ghouls anymore, which is kind of the whole reason that they're the way they are, but okay. I've always... It's not like I'm annoyed by it, but it's like been one of those things where it's like, hmm... 
Address me as your highness. Uh, what should I walk? Um, do you get any penalty for walk building? I don't know. Okay, Crocker is coming up on me now. I need like three turns. He doesn't see my army on the right, and Raystra to Doomglade is actually kind of a big trip. It's weird, but yeah. What? So Marok, I'm just gonna hold off. Um, yeah, he's gonna go for it, but I built up. Yeah, I built up the best army I could, just to inflict casualties. We we kind of just need to kill as much as we can. Well, okay. Do you have a better idea? Uh, just try. <laughs> you just kind of keep coming in with negativity. Yeah, this is Well, yeah, we're obviously not gonna win. The idea is to cause casualties. Mm. Oh, I should have. What do you mean, ah? Uh? Like, what? What do you want to do? Do you just want to like give it up? Like, we just surrender? I mean, I can't come down there. It's just like I haven't finished expanding. Okay, well, neither did anyone. I think Kalita was a bad pick for this matchup. Okay, I'm just saying, like, I, I keep saying this is our plan, and you're like, well, we're not going to kill his main army with this settlement, so no, no, why no, even no. live? Can we just because surrender? He's just, he's just going to go to fucking Lania and do the same, and then he's going to go to the other settlement and do the same, and then you're out of the game. You're right. I mean, because we can't defend this settlement, I think the game is over. Wait, you realize he's going to kill this lord, I'm going to summon a new one for free, and I'm going to build up another army, right? Mm, yes. Like, yeah, I, I only have so much recruitment, but again, I'm. Okay, this is what you do. You, make a, you should make a gatehouse. Did you make a gatehouse in that army? In my capital? No. You should have. Well, I don't. What, at this point, there's like no way I complete it before he gets over here. Well, let's do it. Okay, well, could you get an army down then? He's not no, gonna be able I mean, to move for a couple I... turns. The, the whole. Okay, okay. Hildrick, Hildrick, please. I'm telling you right now, the I'm whole point on, of this battle, the whole point of this battle, I'm gonna give Anna Donek, you control those. Why do I what have. Wait, why do I have Anna Donek on my team? Wait, who? Like Archon. Okay, wait, okay, whatever. Wait, wait, where were you in the previous battle? I asked for the archers and you didn't give them. Choke, Anhedonia, Kildrick. Kildrick, you take those. Okay, the whole point of this, we can't win, obviously. But we're gonna defend the middle choke point. I'm starting it right now. We're gonna defend the middle choke point. Good warriors I mean, I guess we're just gonna summon tier two dudes. The whole point, don't try to get everyone into a fight at once, okay? Like, there's no point, there's nothing you can do about it, don't try to get everyone into one big death battle, okay? Make them use two or three squads to deal with one skeleton at a time. And we're just gonna do a- we're just gonna slowly retreat. Don't he's- he's putting in a few units on the other side. So you guys need to just, like, block off some of this shit, cause like, I- Skeletons might not beat Dwarf Warriors of even that shit quality, but... Yeah. I'm gonna just have my Tomb King run them down then. Or do I need the Tomb King in the main battle? Well, I don't know. They're not moving. Are they gonna try? Okay. See this gate? You don't want to keep all your skeletons, just one line of skeletons at a time. And back off, do you see the Gretschlers over here? Do you see where they're shooting? Gretschlers shooting to here. So so move those guys before they get killed in Indoniac.
Just move them behind that wall. You send the Toon King to kill their Gertrudes. Petra worships me. Uh, he's he's not really that fast. Okay, all our good, all okay, all our good tower points are on this one, so you we really gotta block them off from getting in there. I'm gonna try and get his rush shores in this tournament. Actually, you could get the Ushakti on the experiment. Gosh. I don't have the Ushakti yet. Did I send? Yeah. I mean, if they do chop down the crudge thrower. Lot of gold. This is gonna go to a catapult turret. And the Ushapti. Quick, quick, it's the Ushapti. I, I have the Ushapti. I was, okay. what, what do you mean? What do you mean? They're leaving. What do you mean they're leaving? The crush shores. Yeah, they're gone. I can't chase them. The Ushapti. You're, you're making me look back here and I'm trying to set up a turret. Ushapti at 50 for speed. Oh my god, if I chase after them, it, they're they're just gonna get caught up in melee. I'm, I'm trying. Okay, you're. you're I, I I'm need. Trying to get I'm trying to put up a turret. Give me a second. Okay. We lost that point. We lost that point. We lost. Do we have any points left for a turret? Best one we can do is upgrade you to a giga turret. Yeah. 
Yeah, see, like I, t I told you, we, we, they just didn't have enough time. I should have just continued to attack Coralines. Okay, we're about to get Giga Turret. Come on, turret. Yeah. Boom, king. It's there. Yeah, I mean, if I take out his melee, he can't really continue to advance. Bruh. This turret sucks. Dude, I'm so unlucky with turrets. Holy shit. Okay, get all the remaining units back here so we don't take army losses. Bow to me. I don't know where these guys are running to, but I just need them to get Diddy to run. Just some good hits, Turret. Just a couple good hits. That's all I need. Obey. Move. There we go. Turret, why? Why do you do me like this, Turret? Stay here. Turret, please. All I ask. Petra, worship Why are you shooting at the Lord? Does it have like ADHD? Do I have an ADHD turret? Three speed. We did not really do much, did we? I, I'm not sure that running a Skeleton Spearman out to get gunned down was the ideal play. If we had held a little bit longer, the turret could have taken more.
Okay, I'm gonna need help, obviously. Okay, well, I'm gonna need someone here, obviously. I'm most king of greatest dynasty. I reign. Legions rise! Quartet Grimlock. I am critic proof. I need three turns for Kalita. Um. Master Engineer. Okay, so King Hakoros, he's just doing his shit. He's not really got a defensive army, but he's got an army of whatever the fuck I found nearby. <laughs> so, take that as you will. Uh, I doubt. To be honest, I doubt he's going to be able to do much here. Mike, didn't crash. Did it? Alive. Don't don't say it crashed unless it crashed. Okay, I'm basically spent all the gold on just trying to get last minute upgrades. My will be done. There is no challenge here. He can't actually attack Lamia next turn, so I've got I've got a little bit of time. My patron. My dynasty reigns supreme. I am sculptor and slave driver. Nehekara rises from the sands. I shall take your advice. Address me as your highness. Eldrick, are you good? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Well, I mean, unless you have an action in your turn. Uh, I'm just, okay, so what I'm doing right now is I'm spamming my Necrotect, and I'm just gonna try to wound his hero. <laughs> it's got a very small chance, but I'm gonna keep going for it. Because getting a rune smith out of this battle would pretty much be best case scenario for us.
Okay, I got... Missile strength are skeleton archers and horsemen. Next turn, we'll get reload time reduction for them. Land of the dead. Serve me. Tomb King. All right, does anyone have any more gold? <laughs> nope. Uh, where's Og? You've been killing people. Do you have gold? I yeah, I can give you like a thousand. I need yeah, I have a thousand. I, uh, okay, I mean, I'll take a thousand. Die, die! I can defeat you, Stop, stop, you die, die! Okay, he's not moving in once again. That's fine. I need people to save up gold to send to me. Because I need... Well, I need a lot of things. There is no challenge here. But I need to get my Ush... Oh, wow, it's five turns to upgrade Ushanti. Right, but now there's nothing I can do. I have to upgrade it. Okay, I need I need gold. Someone, someone send me gold. I need gold. I need lots of gold. Yeah, I let our Anhedoniac play as Archon. You can see how much, like, he barely knows how to play the game, and look at how easily he's expanding. Like, Archon is just way fucking overstat, man. It's just unfair how overstat he is. These fucking direwolves, the hex raids. Look at these fucking Crimkoles with 56 melee attack, 49 damage. Which is not even cool. Your time at once. Okay, um, I can use that and start up getting my Shabdi. It's gonna be five turns, though. Okay, that's enough to do something, I'm sure. Okay, he's gonna be sitting here sieging for a bit. I, I'm gonna save up gold. Oh no, Thor's backing off. Like, if he sits here and just sieges Doomglade, that actually gives me time to do shit. Submit. I am sculptor and slave driver. Agreed. This is my order. Actually, fuck that. Yeah, let's put the melee attack and defense for my cavalry. What's this army? You're a bunch of clan rats. Oh, warp fire throwers. Okay. Even two of those will do good. Address me as your highness. Okay, is a region the entire region, or is it just the one city? So, like, if I build I the, the skeletal garrison, do I get it in the entire one, or only Lamia? Yeah, Lamia. How it's connected. Just one city. Okay, I mean that's still fine. That means he can't fight me in Lamia. Because I'll get the legionary barrage. My will be done. Okay, the army in the south is just gonna have to hold out. 
Next turn, I'll start the sandstorm. I need money next turn, by the way. Because I need to start my sandstorm. Joff is my patron. Such critics. Once I start the sandstorm, the lizard men are going to be forced to attack or attrition with me. I'm getting seven Russian guns from this army. Gosh. Are, are you good with your turn? Yes. But I'm getting seven Russian guns from this army. Seven what? Seven what? Seven rattling guns. Rattling guns. Yeah. It's time you to put me in a war. Could you make it with someone who isn't in the middle of all my provinces? That'd be nice. What do you, what do you mean? He, uh, the Strigoi's empire declared war on him, and. They just have a full stack sitting, so I had to send Archon there. <laughs> I mean, that's not bad, actually. Because that kills them for, uh... Yeah, you guys... We, we need to get the orcs south. We need to get everyone in this. Okay. Yeah, I'm about to expand south right now. Soon. I can sandstorm, and that... The thing is, okay, he'll probably just sit through the sandstorm and not give a shit, but it does mean that he's significantly slowed. Uh, I haven't gotten the Tomb Scorpion, because it's expensive. Henry approves the fact that I'm a strategic threat to them. Uh, it's an okay? Like, I, I don't have any time. I need to get my Ushapti up. Because I lost my main army. I have none of my artillery or anything. All I have left is, like, my shit tier units. <laughs> Okay, I need um I need I need a thousand gold so I can start my sandstorm. Well, I'm not getting the Ushabdi to get the Ushabdi. Like, I know this unit sucks ass. I don't care about actually having the Ushabdi. Okay. I'm gonna keep fighting it out every time he goes for it. I gotta go to the bathroom, so I'll just spectate this. 
Wait, what do you need? No, 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 no. Wait, I need you in it. Okay, I guess I do. Well, just go to the bathroom right now while it loads. Not too much. I got Ushapti Carver, so I get two Ushapti or one Tomb Scorpion. Ushapti can actually run past, and uh, they're not gonna be able to hit his front line. I mean, I'm I'm literally gonna have, let's see, 38, say 28 to 50. So y'all yeah, have like 10% chance to actually hit a dwarf warrior. So there's basically no chance I actually do damage. But against Quarrelers, well, 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 things are different. Okay, this army is ironically mostly cavalry, because it was basically what I could afford. Well, not what I afford it. It was it was all I could really get. Hello? Hello. Oh, oh you're live right now, okay. Yeah. Just in time. Do you guys only play during uh, adult working hours? No, we, we try to get later games. We'll, we'll try to get something tomorrow. Oh, okay. I was just... Because I can quit my job. I mean, that's okay. <laughs> Hold on. Anadonia, can you manage shooting archers? I can. Okay, you know what? No, I don't trust you guys. Okay, Hildrick, you're going to be in charge of the cavalry, okay? Yeah. Okay, that's horse cavalry. I'm going to keep the actual melee cavalry. Let's see. The Nehekarin... Can at least charge and deal. Uh, hmm, I don't know. Uh, um, oh boy. Uh, we could charge up the cavalry or stay inside. Well, that's what I'm thinking. Okay. Um, Anhedoniac, just sh set up archers. Pay attention, dodge artillery. Are you back, Anhedoniac? Okay. Just set up those archers. Choke. You'll be in charge of infantry. Okay, Shoke, okay, guys, everyone set up. We're gonna go here. This is gonna be it, okay? Just defend this point here. That's all we need to defend, okay? Should I harass the certain pictures? Hold on, that's worth. They're gonna go all around. Okay, guys, everyone set up. Guys, I need you, I need everyone here. Yeah. We're just gonna block the one pass. Skeletons don't deal damage. I should have just gone for the early buff on the Hikarn Warriors. I think that's like the best way to play the early game. I'm not sure. He's leaving one anti law Oh, okay, he's setting up more. Alright, it's almost starting. Guys, no one's guarding this point. Guys, 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 guys. No, no one's right here. We, we need people right here. That, we need that. Guys, no one's there. Oh, I really don't want to have to put my neck Karns here. Don't don't try to span out, okay? Don't don't form wide formations. Just keep them nice and bulky. We need the towers doing the majority of the damage. Okay, he's 
moving out. Is he just all spears? Oh wait, I can, okay. I'm gonna go actually just join Hildrick. This formation that he's trying to do is just getting its ass whooped. A couple charges. Don't lose those archers. Don't worry, I won't. Don't don't defend points that aren't this point. We just want to defend this point. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, he was moving up the hill, so I just knocked his units down the hill and they died to gravity. Wait, gravity damage is an actual thing in this game? Yes. 100%. That's a steep hill. If you get charged on that, you just die. God damn. He, he just sits here in melee and fights back so well, though. Holy shit. Kinda thought he would collapse after that charge. They are not liking the idea. Can we can we get like an actual infant? Because I'm just losing all my cavalry here. Yeah. Guys, just take these Saurus out so I can move past. I found his wizard. Kill his uh, survivors. How can they not push past skinks?
Wait. Uh, I need the cav- I, I need the horse archers back. Even if just cycle charging some units. We're, uh, kind of running out of time on this one. I'm gonna use you a shop D to try to get these people off our point. Then I recapture your point. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like we, we don't No, we don't we don't need to recapture points. We need you in the battle right now. Like like I I need something charging, something doing damage. Yeah. Come in. Like we're just gonna lose before. Hildrick is really misusing my horse archers. Like he's getting okay kills on them, but then he doesn't he doesn't like charge with them or anything. He just like sits back at range and like shoots. Like he he never tries to cycle charge with them. Uh Okay, the Tomb Scorpion is tier 3. I, if I could get to tier 3, and if I would have had tier 3, I'd already have um, I mean, my Sepulchral Star Prince. So. just give you one, or someone can give you one. What? Like, we could give you one settlement too. Uh, well, we're gonna, we're gonna hold Libarius. Don't you mean Lamia? Oh, yeah, whatever. Actually, we're gonna... Make walls in that, yeah. Make, uh... I am making walls, they take five turns. Okay. We're, we're gonna hold it. With your army especially, we're gonna hold it. Could we kill Torek somehow? So he lost these knights, that's good. Oh, his, okay, his knights, yeah, but they suck. Yeah. It's really just about dealing damage. I, I can't, okay. So that one is actually kind of bad for me, though. Because that was actually my second production city. Okay, I'm going to start working. In four turns, I can actually start producing an army. We just need to live for four turns. My 
master engineer. Gonna make an outpost in your city. Great art refreshes all. Yeah, we just gotta get, we gotta get the Tomb King back. Or, we, we need to get me, the Tomb Kings, back in it, but... Thoric Ironbrow! Sorcerer Inventor, yes, yes! Okay, so this army, wait, that army's so good. Can you... Wait, did you go for redline buffs on clan rats? No. Okay, because you're, okay, your clan rats were like, they're not good, but they're not complete, utter dog shit, which I'm not used to. Power in unlife. Yeah. I was like, wow, those aren't literally worthless. Still need no money, I should have. Um, if you could get me money, I could get more Tomb Guard. 2,000 gold starts me working on Tomb Guard upgrades. Lamia is tier 3, so in all honesty, I can produce enough out of Lamia. Libaris is likely gonna die, but Lamia... If I'm reduced down to Lamia, I can still pull this back. Itch. Attend your king! Address me as your highness. Kalita comes back next turn. Okay. This is gonna work out, actually. I think. I think I, I have the chest plan all planned out in my head. Thoric is gonna be in that city. He can't take back Marak. So next turn I put Kalita on my army. I take Marak. The Skaven come up behind me. The Lizardmen can't reach Libaris in time. Then from there, I can take Granite Mossif while we're 2v1-ing. At that point, we might actually turn this into a 2v2, which isn't great. But we'll see. If he takes too much time, I can build up on Libaris and set up another... Yeah, because like his units are so beat up right now. That should buy... Let's see, because Archon is kind of going crazy in the West. Alright, who's still taking their turn? Lagging? Yes. I'm not lagging. Well, I mean, we're waiting on you. I, I know, I can't stand. Fuck. Get one of these. Okay, there we go. Master yes. Engineer.
Okay, before you move, put your Skaven army in ambush. Yeah. That will. Because I'm going to take down Marak. He might come for me at Marak. Even if I lose the battle, I want you in position to, like, wait. Because we, if we actually kill Thoric's army, like, I know, I know dwarves. Their recruitment is not quick. <laughs> if... They lose their army, they're out for like 10 turns. Well, if he knows how to do it, it's more like 6 turns, but... Archon is just gonna dogpile Sigmar. I'm just trying to do until... A war happened in the middle of my province. Good. Okay, Kalita's back. Liberus shall rise again. Did he force march? Oh, he marched though. Ooh, what do you think? Should I? Scotty, now, Scotty. Hmm. Let me if I can. Asaf smiles on us. Do you think I still go in for that? Let me if I reach there. Do you want to Yeah, move, move normally behind. Like move as far up as you can. But like you see, like because when I go to siege. Oh, can I ping? Agree. Okay, move, but like move. I, I actually can't. It literally doesn't let me draw where this I want to draw. Oh, hold on. It's like drawing in like a three dimensional plane on a two dimensional yeah. plane. It's like, okay, just go as far to the east as you can get it. But like, still as far. It's like. Focus! Begin! Because like, I'm gonna be here, okay? So like you, you, you wanna move like where I am. Okay, I can. Vengeance is mine. Okay. No, 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 here. Yeah, okay, just go a little bit closer. Can you? Are you good? No. Uh, can you force march then? Yeah. Vengeance! Okay, do we want to take this fight or not? Yes, we do. You want to take him right now? That Okay. Should we just auto resolve? <laughs> I'll go for auto resolve if he does. I don't think he's gonna auto resolve all of his army down, but. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Um. Who's all here? We have we have four people. Okay. Wait. What? No. Wait, is that how it works? Hmm. Oh. Interesting. Okay, uh, hold uh, on. We, we wanted to fight that. Yeah, uh, okay, I just realized... I just realized what happened. Uh, yeah, because we, we, we both auto-resolved as a joke. <laughs> like, if he wants to go for it, fine. And then... <laughs> It overwhelmed your vote, and we got majority vote, and it actually went through. I love democracy. Hold on, hold on. We we, we need to go back. Did you quick save it? No. Oh. Everyone because just do. Your... What? Oh, no, we, no, we can. We can just. Uh, yeah, it's about the start of the turn, right? Yeah, then just we drop. Yeah, was out. that even? Was that even a worthwhile auto resolve for you? We, I literally didn't even look at it. it j I just saw one and we were joking and we were like, do you want to just auto resolve it? <laughs> it's perfect time because I want to get some something to drink. Okay, um. Am I going to get gassed by Archon? Oh, yeah. Oh, you're so fucked. He's so overpowered. <laughs> oh, I mean, God, you're I, doomed. I can't even see how big he is. Uh, let me just say it this way a 20 stack appeared in his territories. 
like from a war decoration and he just killed it with one of his spare armies. Now, I, you might be noticing what I'm saying. One of his spare high quality armies was just minding its own business. <laughs> <laughs> You're fucked. Bulk Bulkmar's got this. Bulkmar is like, how how many undead could there really be? We have a f stack full. He's only got one, two, th three stacks of high quality undead. Do you like the uh, wrestling gunner stack? That's the thing. I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. The anti dwarf stack. Rattling guns. Yes. Yeah. Mm, it's kind of rancid. How do we only have two people in here? Game crash. We have five. Okay, well, we need more than that. Yeah, Kairos, uh, <clears throat> not doing too hot. Good, you're their late game carry. I can't tell if I just did something wrong or this is just how bad his start is, but... Uh, you did something wrong. We, we already know what it is. You didn't yep. fight the battle at the start, and then you got screwed on the auto-resolve, which set you back like three turns. Yeah, Kairos is... Okay, so... Best I can understand it, they try to, they try to like, bullshit spells into the auto-resolve as best they can, but they don't really count for anything. So if you get wiped out, Hash, is that the game over? Uh, this army? No, like if your faction gets wiped out. Oh, I have no idea. Um, no, because what he could just keep doing, in all honesty, he could just keep trading me back one settlement. I only need one settlement to recruit out of. So like if I if I if you guys are like about to kill my capital, Quick will just give me a city. Okay, who's not here yet? Why is why is this taking so long? Tornado and Thoric. Who's 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 on Thoric? Uh Zoe. It says no reply from host when I try to join. Uh, can you join our friends list? Mm, maybe. You're, you're off last online one year ago. Yeah, I'm invisible. You, you've been invisible for a year? Dude. Yeah. Okay, Zoe Silvana, where are you? Least antisocial gamer. Wait, didn't... Zoe Silvana. I'm pretty sure about 10 minutes ago he said BRB. While we were in game. And he's still not back. Uh. No, he was back before, right? Because um, uh, he talked when he got attacked in a settlement. Oh. Or not? I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure he was back before.
Who are we waiting for? Again, we're waiting for Zoe Silvana. Uh, I I don't know what he went to go do, but he rage quit off the auto reload. No, he didn't. No, because he knows they were restarting, otherwise he wouldn't be here. I don't think he rage quit it. He did yeah. rage quit. Why no, would somebody say rage quit? <laughs> also, he, he talked about the auto-resolve uh, because he was also surprised about it, so sure he was definitely there. Maybe he just went AFK because he thought the loading time would be a little high. A little bit higher for him, I don't know. Somebody said they were go gonna go get a drink, but I don't. That know. was me. That was me. Okay, so where where did this guy go? I don't know. Oh, I really would not want to get a replacement. <sighs> Thank you. Oh, he just left. Yeah, he just left the Discord. Probably has a DC. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Any rage quits? Nah, I'm pretty sure oh, he just, he just trombone left DC. Typing. He just left uh, Discord, so I'm pretty sure he just got disconnected and got disconnected from Discord a little bit later. So maybe his internet is out or something. I don't know what I mean. It doesn't okay. look like a rage quit. Well, Tony Trombone is typing, so... <clears throat> Uh, okay, do we want to get a replacement, or how long do we want to wait here? Do you want to just give him five minutes? Yeah, I would also well, say five let's minutes. let's ask Tony. I would I mean, definitely wait a bit. Yeah, I mean, like, wait a little bit, but, you know, yeah, have, a, yeah. have a backup plan. That's a good idea. Hash, did you think you would have won that the the first battle that you did? Uh yeah. It was. Yeah. I think that um, some instructions were misread. Heldrix muted of I told him take out the cannons, take out the grudge throwers, and he was like, I'm shooting them, and I'm like, literally run the fuck in there and charge them, and he's like, they'll kill me if I do. And I'm just like, no, I fucking promise you, six cavalry cannot be stopped before they charge in. And he just didn't. Okay. What, this guy's got three minutes to reply? Okay, do we were okay, you know what, let's give him a few more minutes, because I don't want to, like, kick him out of his own game he played three hours on. Three hours? Yeah, three hours. By the way, see, oh, wow, everyone's just muting. Why are y'all just muting? Uh, it seems that defending settlements is actually really, really, really useful and beneficial. Because uh, the thing is, it lets okay, it gives you one turn of being sieged before you start taking attrition, but it doesn't include the turn you are sieged on. 
So, if they run up and siege you, that turn, they don't take attrition. The next turn, they also don't take attrition. Only the third turn, do they take attrition. Okay, I think at this point we just get Tony in, right? Uh... I mean... <clears throat> I think he would have replied by now if, uh... Which kind of sucks, because Zoe played for three hours, but it is what it is. This guy really doesn't want us to use bloated corpses. <laughs> they don't work. The second you actually enter a battle and try to move them, they just explode. <laughs> no, it, it works for me. None of, none of us are playing... Only if they're full health. If they're not full health, they just explode instantly. Oh? Hello? Okay, Tony Tromboni. Uh, I, I don't know what happened to Zoe, but he was about to fight a big battle. Mm-hmm. That, and by it. big battle, he's about to kick some rat ass. That's what hash means. Um, so what you're saying is... You called me up to the big leagues? Uh, well, he disconnected. I, I don't know what happened. He just left. Okay. Well, I'm here. He's not. Yeah, I mean, that, that's where we're at. I saw you typing, and I was like, alright, just just get in here. Well, no, I saw you typing. Well, I saw him typing. You, what, just because you said it, I didn't see yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. You have, to, like, you have to, like, say shit out loud? See, this, this is the logic, right? <laughs> it's politician logic. Okay, uh... Let me just disable better camera mod. Hurry up, Tony Tromboni. Sorry, I was using the loo, so when you guys called me up. A gamer that doesn't take his PC to the loo with him. <laughs> I need my gamer fuel. Good old classic Coke, right? I feel kind of bad for... Uh... The Zoe Silvana guy, Silvani. I mean, there's not much. We, like, we we can't wait till like tomorrow. It's not like we're gonna get the same people. I mean, maybe I'll run a later game tomorrow for NA people. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, Hash. There was an idea, right, for a eat the donut type game where people plays like Nagarond. Uh, and all the factions at like the coast and then they wait like 10 turns and then everybody just tries to eat the donut and see who gets a peat like the most of it by a certain turn I saw a bunch of those Did someone say coast? <clears throat> okay we're ready alright wait uh Just turn it up on you and easy oh sorry it's not your fault. Oh. Is it normal or hard? Normal. normal. Okay, cool. Yeah, we put the AI in very hard so they'd be easier. Don't Here's ask. an idea. It, All it of which is floated corpse. Makes sense. Everybody needs to ally with uh, Count Noctilus and use bloated corpses. Oh, do we have uh, do we have coast in this one? <laughs> no, it's just this guy that keeps saying don't use bloated corpse. Yeah, yeah he keeps telling us we don't we don't have a van. I'm gonna I'm gonna that, um... <laughs> set the record straight. We're all gonna make. All oh, right, saved here. Oh, for fuck's sake! Wait, what do you need to save after a battle? <clears throat> it's uh, no, it's saved to the bit before, so. I hope this lizard manufaction still ints into me and not take does not take my settlement. Yeah, we should I I have been trying to remember to quick save, but if you're ever in a battle just click the quick save option because it'll it'll force it's me saved. to save. It saved after my um my settlement battle I had against uh Wait, it saved <laughs> after that? It, it saved afterwards. I already have the city. But the problem is that, and that's a little bit shitty for you now, because Torek isn't in Marak. He's, he's still in Rezetra. 
I'll, j I'll just move him to Morak. Yeah, okay. Uh, you have to tell Tony that. Re-kill that fucking video. It's nice, right? Alright, fuck this. The high elves are screwed. It's over. <laughs> it's just... Oh, Alright, okay. um, Tony Tromboni, force march to Morak. Alright, let's split uh, up. Let's I get all are we at the end of the turn or at the beginning? We're at the it's, end of it. We're at the end of the previous turn. Oh, okay. Everyone just do. Okay. All you're going to do, you're going to force march to Morak, and then we're going to run up, and Bring that's. We, we, we had to do. We, you're basically we, we, going to get fucked. We had to replay Wait, the. Wait, why did he force. Why did he force march to Morak? Because he didn't see. They, we, we had no way of seeing that uh, Creek has an army there. Yeah. Uh, Oh, I see. Put up in the chat? Yeah, we're, we're just replaying it all exactly as it happened. Everybody ready up. It was just a 20 stack of dwarves against a, with a 7 unit settlement garrison against about 15 units of the Barras. We didn't actually think that he would attack immediately. And um, yeah, well. Oh, it's interesting. Oh, right. Interesting. We have to. Okay, there we go. Sorry. Yeah. What's up? You're playing uh, the Tomb Kings. Yeah, well, I was going to play Warzog, but I decided to play Kalita. Then I just got bum-rushed. Okay, so what happened is, you know how normally you go from Libaris, then you go to their southeast city, yeah. then you go to the southwest, then you go to the north? They rebuilt their army at the north and attacked Libaris <laughs> instead of in the southwest. So then I had to ring around for a little bit, and then right after I'd done getting ring around, um, they came up on me. Wait, how have I discovered Wargrave of Woe and... Uh... I don't like know. Phone I got a I got a notification before that Templehof got ra uh, got uh, killed. Yeah. It's meanwhile, so I'm just I, I'm about to get suicide bombed by uh, oh, Arcan no. the Black. Sorry. Oh, you can't just call him, man. Arcan Tornado, the yeah. Redacted. Why is it called Arcan the Black? Like, what makes him? Because of his teeth, uh, as far as I know. Because he has black teeth. Okay, so, um, so force marching to Morak, okay. Yes. yes, and then we play it out like it was happening. Don't click auto reserve. <laughs> yeah, please. Uh, waiting for players, sorry. Uh, waiting for players. On here. He, oh, and, uh... and Donak and Tornado are apparently lagging out, question mark? That... I'm also waiting for players. I mean, I'm on a dilemma right now, so... <clears throat> uh, by the way... Yeah. Uh, you said that. Um, well, if someone's on a dilemma or something, click it. I, I can't click anything or do because anything. Because you're gonna wait for a heat. Wait, anyway. is Hildrick on the enemy team? No. Uh. Okay, I think we need a reboot. You? you are Tony. Yeah. Yeah, Hildrick is on the enemy team. He's oh, okay, so it's free low. We win, dude. Hildrick's on the enemy team. I, they can have we? Arkham. <laughs> can we what? Can Can we rehost and like do do it a bit quicker this time? Yeah, I, I'm yeah, stuck I'm, I'm too. Frozen. I can't do anything too. Uh, okay. Fuck's sake, tornado! Is Anhido? Is he? Is he here? Uh, Arkan? I'm ending task. Right Save here. the game as it is. Do I can't. To I can't do anything. Can't I just do anything quit task. Quick. Yeah, I, I had to oh. kill mine too. Oh, kill! 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 Oh, what? Okay. Oh, it let me quit. Easy. Yeah. Once those two quit, you could have saved it. Well, because I'm I'm the host. Once the host quit, you all get out. I wish I was a pink horror in real life. <laughs> Why? Dude, what? You're like a jelly bean with teeth and a dagger. You don't want to be the paladin? Three daggers, no? Don't I have three daggers? Maybe it's four. I, don't, I've, I, I mean, can't... in the unit card, in the unit card, they have about uh, three or four arms, and they all have daggers. And so, you know. Battle multiplayer. Resume as host. Everyone, just get in here ASAP. Let's uh, get this back. Is it up. a new code? Oh, wait. Mm, yes, no, it'll it's... be a new code. Uh, there. I'm just gonna double check. I might have typed that. I don't think I did. Sometimes I get paranoid. No, you didn't. <laughs> no, <laughs> you get it's, paranoid. It's um... No, but dude, if you're a pink horror in your life, like, what is there to lose? When you die, you come back and you split into two blue jellies. Do you have a dick if you're a pink horror? No. Probably. I, I guess that's probably it's what probably your pink horror is. That's why they call them no, pink that's, horrors. That's where the pink is. 
<laughs> no, I, <laughs> tornado, no. I think the fact that they call them pink horrors is because they look like a fucking mutant. Everyone's hey, good. That's ready, ready up, ready up, ready yeah. up, ready up, ready up. I don't ready, think ready, it's ready. the fact they have no dick is the thing, the reason they call them pink horrors. Oh, so, nah. oh, I have, um, I have Kairos on my team? Mm hmm. Yeah. Quokka, Kairos, and Sigma. Kairos is uh, kind of malnourished, not having the best time. Oh, yeah, dude, didn't have a good that start. start really ruined yeah. everything for me. That auto is a fact, you know. But I mean, we have a good. We had a good start on Libaros, right? Oh, they do have three arms. No wait, they have four arms. Some of them have four arms. Some of them have three arms. You I want to be one with four arms. To be honest, if I lose to Hildrick, I might uninstall this game. Oh, you're gonna. <laughs> you're gonna get. Uh, I mean, it's us two against Hash and Hildrick right now. Wozak is kind of doing its thing, and uh, and um, Arkan and Tornado. Tornado is building walls, towers, fortresses. <laughs> oh shoot! Except Tornado, I I think it's gonna be like um, oh, it's gonna be like the better winner. What is it called? Winner hold. Winner. Winner hold. Yeah. yeah. We charge yeah. out. Mm. We die. Take all your cavalry, send them out unsupported into a horde that vastly outnumbers them. Lose your most elite soldiers. But somehow still win the battle. That's and then also, is. and then also, you still have a Dothraki horde. Yeah. Just inexplicably, they should, they're just still there. <laughs> just wait for Arkhan Zombie Dragon. Has anybody watched House of the Dragon? Is it any good? Mm, I didn't watch the first episode. It was okay. I'm I'm not really that interested in the Lord of the Rings or the House of the Dragon. Does that make me weird? Yeah. Um. Okay, everyone, move. T take your moves again. Remember, the end of the turn, so you should just end your turn. It, it, we've done two end of turn saves now, so if there's anything left to do, I think past you would have done it in the two other chances you got. Eldrick? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry. I still have to do that. Okay, everyone get through. If you have diplomacy or any shit like that, just click through it. Yeah, yeah. I just want to take an auto save at the start of the turn. I'm oh. still watching the conversation of, about bloated corpses right now in general. Chat. Yo, this guy really doesn't want anyone using bloated corpses. Dude, I don't know what to tell you. I built like 17 bloated corpses. I win every auto resolve. I don't lose a single bloated corpse. Uh, if they're in a garrison, they're already damaged, they just die. I didn't even know that. Come on, click through, click through. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, sorry. He just wants to kill me, dude. Holy... Get through the tornado. Then, take a save, take a save, right? Yeah, I will, I will. Okay, come on, guys, click through okay. that. And Doniac, let's go. Come on. We're almost there. Why do I hear extremely dramatic boss music? It sounds like a Dark Souls theme or something. Alright, Tornado, get through. Anhedoniac, you have a pending action. Do your dilemma. Okay. Anhedoniac, do your dilemma. Choke, do your <laughs> dilemma. You rushed me through, I chose minus recruit cost. I'm playing Tomb Kings. Good. Mm -hmm. Okay, someone's Good. still got something going wait, on. Wait, wait, no, uh... Guys, stop moving, oh, wait, I want to take a save. No one do Just anything. Yeah, Every, I I can't save because someone's moving something. I'm definitely not moving. Cars. Well, it's not you. It's I one. Know, it's there we go. I can now oh, take dude. a save. This is my no, only. Sarcasm, uh, hash. No, it's it's your only army. You're gonna get fucked. Yes. Oh my goodness, dude. Okay. Surely um, we don't we don't do this. Hold here. Okay, now move up the Skaven. And it's a weapon team Skaven army. It's not. Uh, Oh, look at look at Hildrick. Oh, uh, Hildrick, Hildrick you need to be closer. Look me in the eyes when you kill me like this. Hildrick, I need you closer. The, the point is the point. Hildrick, is... I need you closer. Okay. Okay, let's move. If he would have reacted faster, yeah, also could have just. Uh, Why is this time are we getting defeated? Nope, now we're oh, back to pure victory. Oh, you didn't. You didn't put in Kalida. You didn't put in Kalida. Oh, that's why. Uh, can you change by your sieging? Yes. No, he won't. Oh wait, he can. What the fuck? You should be. You can let's. Uh... Okay. Wait, you're sieging? 
No, he's attacking, but he needed to change his law. Yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna take okay, another everybody trip, so. down. Don't get hope. <laughs> Don't get oh. hope, Tony. Alright, click your buttons. Click your buttons. Hello, Buddhist man. I can't help but notice that the Tomb Kings do not seem encumbered by, you know, death. How many armies have you guys wiped out? More shit. Oh my god, that's so many rattling gunners. So you know, every time you guys wipe out an army, I just get a new army. That's why I told everyone, I'm like, I'm not fucked yet, but if no one gets an army down here, eventually they will whittle through. Okay, uh, I have shit... Okay, I have shit cav. I have three shit skeleton. Okay, so, okay. Hildrick's gonna have to manage his army. So we have four people. <sighs> okay, um... And I don't... Okay, one of you... Uh, who, who do you... Which one of you do you think is the worst, period? Probably me. Okay. Shulk... Okay, we, we've got... Hildrick's gotta manage his range, but he could probably use help with managing his range. I think I'm the best at microing here. Um, this is not a great defensive settlement for them, for what they want to do anyway. I'm gonna go on my side, we'll go on my side. Okay, so you're coming up from that side. Do I just... Okay. I'm gonna start it now to not give them any opportunity. Polita, are you on a mount yet? No, god damn it. You guys are damage dealers. Okay, um... Okay, uh, Shulk, I'm gonna have you manage my infantry. Split into three different groups. Don't go down the middle. Oh, no, he's dwarves. That doesn't matter. Just don't go down the middle. That incline will make it suicidal. And then I'm just gonna attack both sides. I'm gonna have my heroes over here. My Ushapti are anti-infantry and armor pen, but they just don't have the melee attack to do any damage. If they actually fight a dwarf, they don't do anything. And then I just have the cavalry up here to run distraction. And let's see what he does. Oh, I have I have armor piece and weapon damage uh, ability. You're more scans. Armor piece and weapon damage plus 50% for 28 seconds. Affects allies in range. Oh. That's good. I don't do any armor for using damage. <laughs> no, 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 split up into three different groups. We must! Don't don't be in one group. Like move up each area differently. If I kill him here, I might get Kalita on her mount, which makes my life way easier. Uh, you could go mid. I, I could charge them, but I just don't see any reason. Oh, wait, ca to. capture, 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 capture. They're gonna capture. Oh. 
Okay, he's crawling on his own here. Oh no. I'm not sure is there too. Wait, I actually see an opening here. Where? Uh, his cavalry, or sorry, his archers are all on their own, and my cavalry is performing some good flanking right now. Yeah, I'm getting his I'm getting his archer lines all tied up. Oh yeah, I can flank him if you can keep him there. Yeah. No, Bert, you can give me some units. Sure. Yeah, Melee. Who are you? Uh, and hand on me? Oh the miners. Does a Necrotech coming. actually have any abilities early on? No. He's there just a go. shitty lord. Sacrifice them! Okay, I got his corollers all tied up with cavalry. Just, um, yeah, move units in on them. My units have guard on by default, by the way, and no skirmish. Yeah, his corollers are just completely packed in here. Okay, now we just gun them down with archers. Let me move my archers up a bit. Do I have any units not moving? I feel like I do, and yet I don't. Yeah, just get those infantry in here. Alright, and then I'm gonna send some towards the middle. The rats are coming up? Okay, the rats are coming up. Don't tell me I actually basically beat him by trapping his corollers like that. Okay, get his infantry. Uh, he's, he's, um, uh, he's running infantry into my archers. This does not deal any damage. I'm raining all this damage down for nothing. I am vengeance. Yeah, we need to get um spells or so. I, I I'm like I'm shooting them to hell, but they're not dying. <laughs> My, core, my, art, my poor cavalry is dying here, and we're not actually killing them. Wow, that hurt. Okay, the Ushapti, I made fun of them for a very long time, but they're actually doing fairly well. Not gonna lie. Archer's about to be a flank. No, yeah, no my archers are getting... Can, can we get more melee on these archers? Well, no, we also need melee over there. Okay, can, can we get someone to kick these melee units off my archers? Okay, I'll, I'll just get the Ushabdi over here. Okay, I'll keep one squad back, but everyone else, come on. Those dwarves literally just face tanked through everything I chucked at them. <laughs> yeah.
Us are Actually, no, you guys keep killing. I'm loving these volleys of arrows landing and their health bars just don't even move. Oh, okay, the rattling teams are here. That'll do it. Oh, wait, Thoric. More avatar. Oh my god, finishing these dwarves off is such a pain. Okay, uh, Kalita's got 75 melee attack. What's Thoric's melee defense? Okay, I, uh, Kalita can kill Thoric. Uh, watch out, because he's got dudes all up in your rat guns. Okay, can you, uh, Anadonia, can you move those rats to the side? I, I just need to get through here. I mean, we're kind of pushing you aside anyway, but yeah. Of course. He's got 160 armor, but these guys are armor piercing. At least they should be. Yeah, they're mostly armor piercing. Oh my god, look at the door for us. In the storm burst with my uh mm -hmm. fire, but I would probably need to shove these. Okay, well the door for you are gone. Okay, don't don't shoot Thoric, he will die. Yeah, for the plan. Okay, they they wanna go. Yeah. This is a siege battle, so we win it and he's all dead. Okay. <laughs> this is a victory. That uh I'll be honest with you, I I lost all my cavalry, they're all dead, but boy oh boy, they did a pretty good job rounding him up there. I saw the opening and I was just like, I saw the opening. I just shoved them in there. They 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 got like 16, 13, 6 kills. Doesn't matter. They rounded up the quarrelers and kept them still. My well look engineer is two thousand value. Who is two thousand? My well look the engineer. Your what? Spells. The guy that did the spells. Oh, the spell dude. Yeah. Because it does armor piercing damage. It's so good against dwarves. Okay, so I guess Torek dies against Quick. Torek is not as good as me, as we talk. Uh, my Necrotech though, I have Ushapti shaped around him, so my Necrotech is giving me more Ushapti. I don't think without that second Ushapti I'd win this. I made fun of them forever, but, uh... Boy, they actually do do damage. I'll give you that. Okay, so, yeah, 1800 value, 450. Oh, no, my Ushapti, my one Ushapti was 1600 value. Archers with basically no value. Tomb Guard did decent. Nehekara. I, I, I feel like, in all honesty, Nehekaran are just the best Tomb King unit right now. They always overpunch, they always get good value, they're always good. My Queen Dam expands. Do you get the perk for killing him? Do you get old Grump Slayer? Eldrick. 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 Yeah. 
Did you get old Grump Slayer? Yes. That's gonna be insane on Skaven, by the way. Yeah. So, don't lose this guy. Every single one of your clan red suddenly having nine piercing. It's kind of a big deal. Yeah. The question is... I feel like I still just go Spearman. I mean, I don't know. Oh yeah, that's right, because she has... Oh, I totally forgot, because she has my will be done. She's giving the Ushapti enough melee attack to do something. Yeah. You're trying your hardest to find a reason why you shop here bad, aren't you? They are not good. <laughs> they are not good. Okay, I've finished upgrading my Ushapti now. I have the complete red line. Okay. Um, oh wait, Kalita leveled twice. She leveled three times on that. Jesus. Does she have her mount? Yep. Well, she has a chariot. Okay, so now I get ambush success, trans missile strength through my skeleton archers. I don't think that's really gonna matter. Now she gets the AOE reload skill. Okay, that that's pretty good. Kalita's solid now. No, actually, I feel like... Do I go for the heal or the restore? Or do I even need to increase mobility? Well, increased mobility is just really good. What? Yeah, Nehekar and Warriors are just solid, solid units that punch way above their weight. You know, I was looking at buffing the archers at the red line, but I'm putting three points. Because they never run out of ammo, you're putting three points into 8% missile strength. It just... Ugh. You know? Ugh. I think I need to get more cavalry back. Well... I'll save my Nehekarn warriors. Hi, Queen Kelly. Or sorry, my ne I'll, I'll save the Nehekarn cavalry. My cavalry is actually doing decent. If for nothing else, then they can get there faster to lock things down. No, I think putting Kalita up with the Nehekarn warriors is probably the better play. Nehekarn warriors are just pretty solid right now. They always punch above their weight. They always do well. Oh wait. Oh my god. I spy my dome rocket. Ha! I forgot you're about to blow up his capital. Yeah. I mean, should I do this? I think it's gonna be BM, no? Why is that BM? Attend your kings. Wait, I got half my one province torn to pieces. Yeah. Uh, if you have such a tomb guard or just straight up, I'm not gonna say OP, but kind of OP. If you're c any other tomb, it's inevitable. They're okay. With such a, they're busted. It, it, I, it, I rushed the tech buff for tomb guard, and then you get the Setra buff, and then the red line buff, and I shit you not, your your um. Halbeard Tomb Guard have 70 melee defense. And they, they just never break. They just stand there and never break. So then you just get some uh, Tomb King artillery and you're good to go. Dude, the oh, fuck, this game I can OP. I can literally colonize everything. <laughs> Wait, isn't that the thing with Skaven? They can just colonize everything you want? I have no idea, to be honest. Everything is green. I can. Everything is 
Ähm. Was was ich gonna say? Uh, Tomb Guard. Like, they're not. Your author, but be they're like defensive infantry, but they're not like elite infantry. Tomb Guard aren't gonna win battles, they're just gonna stand on the front line, generally frustrating people. If you play Cetra. Mind you, if you play other factions, they're just like a generic, kinda tanky melee unit, that's it. They're not really anything special, but due to the due to how math in this game works out, eight extra melee defense, and if you get the tech buffs, yeah, they just kinda go nuts. I went for the technology on my horsemen and archers. I'm not sure that was the best play. Yeah, okay, so my skeleton horseman and a Hecarn horse are now have a melee attack and defense. So they shouldn't be absolute jokes anymore. Apparently, that should really apply to your skeleton horse archer, but oh well. Focus. The ass. Your queen. Okay, I'm gonna pull back. Up, come on. Get the things. You might want to pull back to Hildrick. I dare yeah. to move. Do you want to get message? No, no, no. I challenge you, kill, kill. I don't want to push because what's going to happen? He's going to be sitting there in ambush stands. <laughs> and then I'll die. It'll be funny for him, it won't be funny for me. Declare this nest my mind. Do I want to upgrade that? No, I need to save my gold. We begin. Should I go back north? And, and... No, 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 no. I, I need you here, but I, I just want to like, I, I want to recruit for one turn here, at least to get back to one cavalry. If nothing else, although I lost my other cavalry recruitment building. If I stay here for two turns, well, we'll see. Actually, to be honest, okay. do I make an under city or do I cause earthquake? Do you do what? Do I make an under city or do I make an earthquake? Ah, uh, I guess it depends on you. I'll just make a fucking under city. I, I feel like you're trying to be nice, but. I mean, Thoric's out for three, sorry, five turns, but like, once he gets back. Yeah, I don't worry at all. I hope. Higgin bore iron brow. <laughs> I mean, that is true, Brad. Yeah, remember, he can move in ambush stance, so what he's likely doing is he's just looking right at us. In fact, he might be next to Libaris right now. Come then. I'm gonna move to the right, though, because there's like no way we can take Resetra back. He's just gonna kill it. Mehikara rises from the sand. Uh, let's see, I could push her tier 4, maybe? Oh wait, what would you even do back in the north? Me? Don't, don't go all the way back to the north, that's so far away. What, me? Yeah. yeah I'm, I'm staying here. 
<laughs> You're pretty good on money, aren't you? My horse units are actually decent now, which is good. Are you good with your turn? Yes. Yeah. my What is this supposed to be anyway? Crater of the Walking Dead. Oh. It looks like Tornado is getting help on killing Manfred. I didn't realize Manfred was still alive. You don't mind, I'm gonna kill the sea corpse, the my lord. That's right now for you. Um, the witch with my lord. Yep, there's there's Gradgar. Yeah. Head. Liberus shall rise again. By the gods. Do I never get more? Oh no, okay, so once my tier 3 I get 6 skeleton archers out of it. Do I have a quest? Oh no, it's twelve. Ugh. Don't cross wires. Where where are you going? Do you not see? No. Warlock of Skaven Blast! Okay. The climate is irrelevant. Strong tough rat rat. Dead no more elite units? Okay. Attend your king, slaves. Oh, he's coming for me. Return to Liberus. We stalk, not hunt. Tomb King of Mehikara. Batteries need recharge. Sars are considered small, right? Yeah. Okay, he doesn't. He's not actually bringing any dino boys in, so... Recalls me. Well, I think still going Spearman is better. Yeah. Get 
It's okay, next turn I'm getting kicked into overdrive. We're gonna start having the real bullshit hit. Necropolis Knights, properly buffed. Run for more. My dynasty reigns supreme. Hey, can I fight this uh, crystal? Can you fight it? No. I can't auto resolve. No, it's uh, the the one that was bugged, and you can't auto resolve it anywhere I want. Wait, you can't auto resolve it, and it's bugged. The. Um... Yeah, because it's like uh, the ambush one that you get quick the quest bar. Oh, uh, yeah. I'll just go through speed. That's fine. Uh, okay. Apparently, he apparently he needs to play this out because it's bugged. Oh, I don't know. I we're just gonna three speed it. Well, at least I told him to three speed it. Yeah, just assign assign your units to everyone and then three speed it. Yes, 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 yes. We can't play as the dwarves. That's very weird. It's because it's, it's his quest, quest battle. battle. You can play quest battles. Yeah, auto resolve your quest battles. It's just some of them are basically you can't auto resolve them. Period. Because it, it, some fuckery. Yeah. Are you sure you Pilgrim. can beat this? Yes. No more. It's, it's really easy. Pildrick, you will rue the day. Don't you worry, dude. You will rue the day that you. Stepped on dwarven territory. That, that was actually my land. <laughs> <laughs> ah, but it's became dwarven territory now. They've colonized it. Well, I mean, I have it back. Not for long. I could give it to the flaming scribes. Hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, the dwarves died a lot easier than I thought they were going to. <laughs> the rats barely had to show up. Dwarf. They were on post match, right? <coughs> yeah. <coughs> Press escape, by the way. Fight, fight. I can't. I can. We will give them battle. Yes, yes. I'll take back Gauja and collect many the Queen dears. sounds so sketchy, dude. dude. I love his voice. He sniffs so no much fucking rat cocaine. Slay more than me, me. Any who attempt to outkill me, me will pay. I wonder what the voice actor looks like. The voice actor had a lot of fun on this job. Get them now, now. He really lifts his roar. All right, all right, give us units, and then we can just three-speed it. Ready, ready. Quick, quick. <sighs> Yes, yes. Uh, your clan rats aren't redlined, right? No. Okay, so they just. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Redline's really fucking bad. I'm gonna let them like. Well, if you're here, I'll charge them. But I was gonna let them get to a bit of this steeper incline. You know what I mean? Yeah. Don't worry, the dwarves have got this. The dwarves will pull it through. I believe in the dwarves. Update, the dwarves have marched the uh, rangers into melee range. I Sometimes when a unit can melee, the AI doesn't realize that it shouldn't melee. Me when it's marked as a hybrid unit? Oh god, it actually only has 18 melee attack. It's not a melee unit! It's, it's not a melee unit! Is that the clan rat? Or the, is that the chieftain on the... Um, uh, Rat Ogre? Yes, yes. Okay, so they lose their anti-large, but then they just go giga damage. Yep. Has anybody else seen the trailer for this Winnie the Pooh horror movie? What? No. Yeah. Have you not seen the trailer for it? Go it. Oh, well, actually, you know what, I'll just... That is not a joke either, it's not like a... Blood and honey. It's not a, what's it called, it's not like a fan-made trailer. It is an actual, like, it is going into theatres around the world. Winnie the Pooh horror movie. Oh, oh, look at Hildrick's guys getting massacred by these flamethrowers. Oh my god. Oh yeah, Iron Drakes. 
great guys. Oh, poor Hildrick. I, I like that I've just completely surrounded these dwarf warriors and they're just sitting there. It's just, just four packs of clan rats, just doing their best. I mean, one of them is a regiment of renown with flaming swords. What is the, uh, what did you get for killing Kalita, by the way? What's her kill thing? Her trait? Yeah, like the trait. I don't know, I didn't kill her, did I? One you did. Thor no, did. No, that was Zoe. That was Zoe Sylvana. Yeah, because the Thoric defeat trait's kind of, uh, really, 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 really good. What is it? Uh, all our units get plus three armor pendant. Dude, this, this fucking really movie good. looks like complete dog trash, and I'm gonna watch it. Is it, like, it's an official Winnie the Pooh horror movie? Yep. Yep. It is a... Because what? the Winnie the Pooh license went public. So Wait, it, it went public? Life. Oh, no. <laughs> I, no, no, Hash, but the weird thing is, except for Tigger, Tigger is the only one who didn't go public, but everything else did. Winnie the Pooh Blood and Honey is an upcoming independent slasher <laughs> film directed and written by <laughs> Reese Frank Waterfield. The film serves as a horror retelling of A.A. A. Milne's 1926 book Winnie the Pooh and follows the anthropomorphic characters Winnie the Pooh and Piglet as they become bloodthirsty murderers while when Christopher Robin abandons them for college. <laughs> okay. Are you gonna watch it, Hash? You know, I, I'm kind of curious. I'm not saying I won't watch it, but I'm saying there might come a day where I have nothing better to do. <laughs> and the Winnie the Pooh horror movie might be an interesting option. <laughs> it, it's, I, I, it just, uh, it looks, I, I, watched, I watched the trailer. These are some of the most fucking wooden actors I've ever seen. <laughs> Hash, the defeat trade for Kalida is... Diplomatic relations with vampire counts plus 30 and plus two recruit rank for range units. That's. Well, if you actually had Thoric alive, that might be okay. Which I don't get, because I'm pretty sure Kalida hates the vampire but didn't counts. But no? didn't you beat Kalida? Uh, I mean, you weren't in here, but uh, Tony, uh, the guy before, you already beat Kalida in a battle. Yeah, that's so what I'm saying. He has her defeat tree. Ah, okay. And then Ark and the Blacks good. is diplomatic relations plus 20 with Tomb Kings and weapon strength plus 25% when fighting against vampiric undead. Okay, so don't let Ark on the Black die. If it comes down to it, you drink that cyanide. By the way, um, hold on, Archon, dude, because you're actually expanding out of Canoptic Jars, make sure to get your Immortal Leader from above. In your tech tree, the one that takes 200 canoptic jars. I can't really afford that. But you, it would be good to have an immortal leader. Because, yeah, having your leaders reset won't be good. I wonder if they're gonna give uh, the read the Isabella von Karstein defeat trick to somebody else. No. In Can't fact, she still be a norm? I suspect they did that intentionally as like an oops. Oh, oh no. Yeah, let's go, baby! You're, you're so fat, IRL. Hell yeah! Wait, Assassinate wait. critical success. That's what I call esports. Wait, what did he do? He killed the lich priest I literally just bought. <laughs> <laughs> Witch hunter. Ready. Oh, no. but hash. I think they'll probably give it to like Nagash or something. No, I, I okay. I think they're trying to peel back on the whole. You can literally go unkillable. Because like the thing is. If you could get that off like a rare item or something that was like late in the campaign, the problem with the Isabella trait is you could farm it on like all your dudes pretty early on, and it made way too much of it. Like, okay, the we Thoric trait's it. pretty brutal, I'll give you that. The Thoric trait could maybe be toned down as well, but like getting regeneration on your main 
legendary lord early in a campaign kind of really good yeah if you defeat um what's his face what's the fucking dwarf guy called but the berserker guy uh gortrek he gives unbreakable good who hasn't ended their turn uh by the way tornado uh tomb kings can just bring heroes back okay okay I'm friendly von dragon will just keep killing them I'm just saying, for future reference, they can just pull them out. So long as they're not at their limit, they can, for zero gold, keep pulling them back out. It's fine. I'll just keep shooting them in the head. Friendly, I mean, like, re friendly Von Dragon, the Witch Hunter reloads his pistol, sh shoots a level one Tomb King hero in the head. They respawn. He does it again. He keeps doing it. He he's trying to reload, but the dog shit level one heroes keep coming out too fast. Okay, so he he doesn't wound; he kills. He, uh, yeah, no, that it was is a correct. critical. It was a critical success. So it's a kill. It's kill. Well, some heroes yeah. can kill and some wound. It's this like it's no, I'm pretty sure it's always wound and then no, 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 assassinate is critical. No, for for, the, for for example, like if this was an imperial captain, he could wound a hero, but he can't kill them. Which hunters can kill? Yeah. Like, for undead counts, I think it's Banshees can kill all others wound. Like also, if you defeat Archeon, you only get immune to psychology. That's his defeat trait. That's so meh. The Thoric one is a bit absurd, and the fact I got that on Kalita... Like, if I, if I could just put it this way, let's just say Clan Rats, although they're really bad, Clan Rats with that trait would be kind of brutal. Okay, let's go back to our VCs. Thank you. Oh, we aren't gonna hang out together? Good luck. I'm gonna keep summoning as many Lich Priests as it takes. <laughs> Friendly Von Dragon will not run out of bullets until every last undead is purged from this fucking desert. This man's a fucking legend, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, by the way, the, the Kalita thing is because if you kill Kalita, the vampires like you more. You don't get the trait because Kalita is like... I mean, you know what I mean. Oh, holy yeah, shit. Yeah, we we know what you mean, Ash. Alright, good, good luck. I am going to keep shooting your uh, Lich Priest. So just prepare yourself. Yeah, I think is this is hot? best. Next hands move. Good. No, no, no. Wait, what? All these units take two turns? Oh no. Yeah. Is that where calls. I have arrived. Soon, not now. It's inevitable. Oh, I'm gonna be here for a bit. Well, that takes a long time to build. I did not realize that. Uh, should I go get the treasure, Ash, or want to come down there with you? Uh, I mean, you can do whatever you want. Okay. Hi, Queen Kalida. Boy, my shit is really bad. Uh, I guess I'm gonna be here for two turns recruiting. Yes, see it is done. No, I can't. I can't move away, or he's just he's just gonna one one v two Kalita. Yeah, you can see like he's he's moving in and out of ambush stance over here. Peter, oh. I'm gonna have to start fighting folk 
Yeah, that's good. Remember, if you get the Great Desert of Arabia, you get a unique landmark that gives you, like, crazy, uh... Who had a pending trade deal with me? I saw it a pending trade deal, but I was in intern, so I couldn't accept it. Who was that? Hello? No idea. Okay. It's quite like a buff. It's not buff, uh... Storm Thunders? I thought he gave them like melee defense or something. Queek? Yeah. No, he literally does nothing other than recruit rank and I think maybe upkeep or something. Mm. Yeah, that's why I keep saying, like, Queek's just not really good. Shit, it's gonna take me so long to recruit my army. Attend your king. But I can't move this army out. Shit. And then an imbass here. I wonder if halberds or sword and shields there. Uh, halberds. Ha do halberds still have a shield? No. Probably swords and shields. Sword and shields is 43 melee attack, 41 melee defense right now for me. Uh, see, hell okay, the thing is, Hellbeards actually have armor pen. So you might think yeah. Hellbeards are anti large, but they're actually also your damage dealers. Yeah. So it comes. Do they only have a bronze shield? Uh, the shield, yeah. Ah, uh, it's probably just better to go with Hellbeards then. Yeah, I would say so as well. Yeah, because then the thing is, at, at the very least, you can hurt units later on. I mean, it comes down to, are you purely there to just tank? What, what's good is I, I buff melee attack on them by lots. Like, I could, they can get, like, 50 plus melee attack. Well, I mean, I think your main carries are still your chieftains. If you can find a way to get, to get yeah. your chieftains to immortal, that would be your ideal. Yeah. That's why I'm like... I sure do love being at war with Nimric. Yeah, <laughs> It's Doric, Volkmar, um, Krakar. All three of them make sense, and then they got Zinch. <laughs> <laughs> well. I mean, I could see Skaven and Tomb Kings, maybe, kind of? I really do need a hero capacity for Lich Priests. Is that, I mean, that's definitely worth a thousand gold. Oh, Gregs, we, we've got Archon, don't worry. Don't worry, we got Archon. Archon's gonna fucking 1v3. This is a lot of pressure, I don't like it. Uh, Queek sucks. Queek, okay, all Queek needs to do to be viable, take the recruit rank away from Storm Vermin, give it to, um... Take the recruitment rank away from Storm Vermin, make it plus four melee attack, plus four melee defense. If you want to be fair, make it plus three, plus three, I guess. It'd be weaker than what other lords get, but it would probably be fair. But then definitely he needs a skill unlockable at like literally level one that gives clan rats plus three attack, plus three defense. That, if you did those two changes alone, Clan Rats are a bit stronger early game, so we can expand better early game. And then Storm Vermin were better late game. Those two changes alone would make Queek something. Asaf smiles on us. Stand sentinel! Mine will. Oh, I forgot. I could just sit here and two. Wait, I forgot. I don't need to give a shit. Your advice. I have entombed beneath the sands. Yeah. I can just walk up with 75 ambush defense. I forgot Kalita hard counters him. 
He's fucked. This is my climate. Even with Krokgar going full ambush defense, he would only have like a 30% chance to ambush me. Archon's really overpowered right now, yeah. Just, I, I don't know what they were thinking, but like, I'm looking at this shit just like, what the fuck? This just doesn't seem fair. Volkmar is just doomed. My dynasty reigns supreme. Full stack of units. Seven anti inf So like, if any of these seven get into the free warriors, they're doomed, or the, you know what I mean? The hex rates are insane. I, you, and you know you can build more of that building in more areas, right? Can't you? Okay, so what makes Archon so broken? He gets free hex rays from turn one, which wouldn't be that bad, except they're actually stat as if you have full technology. Okay. Their stats are high enough as if you have full red line and technology from turn one. So you can see they already have 46 melee attack. For undead, they would have 18. Or say 20. I mean, yeah, they are like 7. So even with that 7 down, they'd be 39. So they would still be like 14 above. They would still be like 14 attack where other hex rates are. Now, I think hex rates are underpowered. But then in addition to that, his hex rays get 10 more damage than normal hex rays. So they do like 25% more damage because fuck you. And then they also get more melee attack. The but wait, there's more. They also, I think, I'm, now I'm not 100% on this one, but I think they also even have more HP. No, here's where it gets even better. Do you see these fucking ghouls with 65 melee attack? 49 weapon strength? Archon gives plus 5 melee attack to his entire army. So, like, even... Oh, I thought we were gonna lag out there. I'm gonna take a Didn't save. just gave up my tower, my tower for no reason. Wait, what happened? He, he took my settlement and gave it to another siege faction for no reason. Did you take it back? Yeah, it just gave me XP. I don't know why he did it. Well, you had to sack it a bit. Right, so you're back to tier one? Tier one. Oh. I think he was just experimenting. But like, okay, so like here's an army. Okay, this is a this is an act to, this is a really good show of how broken this shit is. So here's his Felbats in an army that has absolutely no buffs. This is just a generic level one Tomb King, right? 34 melee attack, which is 16 higher than average. 49 melee defense, I think it's 8 higher than average. 27 weapon strength, I think that's 8 higher. Dire wolves, the dire wolves aren't really that overstat. They're a little bit better. The big thing are these stupid crypt ghouls and the hex wraith. And here's the other thing if you know how tomb kings work, Archon starts with plus one army. So... He starts with two armies. The other Tomb Kings start with one. So he's got more units than you, and they're a higher quality. That's actually what makes the Rapunz start so frustrating. Because... He just... he... Like, the Hex Raids will fucking destroy any Bretonian cavalry you try to send into them early game. Like, it's not even close. It's a complete shutout, complete massacre, utter annihilation. Yeah, it, it's he's really OP, but you it's okay. Engage with Volkmar is pretty OP right now too, but I don't think Tornado really knows how to use him to his fullest extent. But I don't think Anhedoniac has any idea how to play Tomb King, so it's even. 
But once he gets the Great Desert of Araby, he's gonna have really good Ushapti. Well, it doesn't give really you both Ushapti, but you make... Doesn't it give them perfect you. vigor? Uh, oh wait, I think it does. Actually. Perfect vigor is way better than people make it out to be. Oh yes, it's really strong. But what it does specifically is that it makes you like, you make like 12 Ushapti, like 6 Great Bows, I think, or... Ten, you you can go giga Ushapti with it. You can have a lot. And then you can get a tomb king that buffs Ushapti. So. Yeah, no. If you combo the Ushapti buffing tomb king with a full Ushapti stack, I think he gives them eight melee attack. You can get another five from tech. Then you get perfect vigor. Yeah, they're they're pretty. They can get pretty good. They're good, yes. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm done recruiting. I'm gonna start power sliding to the south. Bring me Neferata's head! Do I move in a oh, stack of off. two? Okay, do I buff Necropolis Knights? You could, they're very strong. Uh, no, Archon gets Hex Rates, so this is best. Now, Hex Rates are underpowered by default, so I, I think normal Hex Rates should get buffed, but his Hex Rates, particularly that early game, are just a bit much. Particularly because he gets everything else. Okay, so. Necropolis Knights and Artillery Buffs? Or. Ushapti and Kimrian. I, I think. Ushapti. Necropolis Knights are super strong. They're very good. Okay, fine. Check. I'll just go Necropolis Knights. The goddess wills it. I have risen! I'd like to get my second Ushapti Bowman, but there's just no way. My rock I'm not putting any money into. We do have my Sepulcher Stalkers now, so Dwarves are fucked. Can- wait, can- you can't block Sepulchral Stalkers, can you? I don't think so. Mm. All right. Uh, Klepta Guard- okay. So, I believe... So it shall be. Every- yeah, wait. Self. Do I not? Yeah, everyone- okay, so everyone gets a Kepra Guard. Okay, so let me explain this one. Okay. Kepra Guard works better. They're like the best way you can do one of them. Kepra Guard? Yeah, they're OPS though. Oh, yeah, 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 I know. What I'm saying is everyone gets a Kepra Guard, but Cetra gets three. Wait, <laughs> he does? Yes. Every game, every game I've played with Cetra, I've ended so early, you guys have not even seen how actually stupid some of this shit gets. Yeah. I'm gonna be honest, I think them not wiping me out in the first 20 turns. I mean, they got me hurting, I'll, I'll, I'll be honest. Gorrock is probably at least setting up his provinces, but the fact that I'm not dead... Iron Brow might be able to come back, but my constructs are coming online. Hi, queen. Which is the best, Death, Light, or Nehekara? Well, my clan rats are rank, rank 8 from the game. Yeah, I mean, your high-level clan rats are okay, I guess. Yeah, I mean, they're... they only cost 95. Clan rats are expensive, how hey shit they are. That's weird. Wait, do you have less units in this army? What happened to your warp fight throws? I just removed them because they're shit. They're not too good. No, 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 you want warp fight throws. 
Okay, if you actually micro- Oh, Thark's coming back. I don't know how he crab stacked up this quickly. Oh, but it's a shitty stack. It's got like miners and shit on it. Oh, he filled it up with slayers, I bet you. But I guarantee you, let me look at it. Yeah, his slayers are shit. They're, they're vanilla slayers. I mean, they are anti-large, I'll give you that. Okay, actually, that might fuck me. My army is like half large. If my Nehekarn warriors get into him, they're dead. Honestly, okay. I feel like buffing Nehekarn warriors was better than buffing my cavalry. I don't well, know, because it's cavalry and horse... Er, but it buffs my skeleton archers. I don't know. I feel like it's just not worth it to go for skeleton archers. Then again, if I didn't go for the cavalry buffs, I might not have been able to push through the early game. So I don't know about that one. My Nehekarn warriors are decent. If I just... Well, I don't know. We'll see. Hell, you gonna end your turn? Yeah. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Get water. What the fuck? Emrick? Hmm. hmm. I'm gonna fight that. <laughs> oh, what's going on here? Knights of Kalidor attacked me. What? The Knights of Kalidor attacked my army in the sea. Oh. Yeah. Uh oh. I don't really if I can win this for a minute. Are those all archers? Oh, you're fucked. Yeah. Uh. Okay. If they actually and know the how to, hand? if they actually know how to use terrain, you're doomed. Um. Mm. Yeah. Rat gunners have one large weakness, and that's if you actually terrain them. Like if you use trees. Or you use like inclines and stuff like that. The rat gunners can't really deal with that. Yeah. Okay, give that me the give me give me give me give me give me rat gunners. All of them? At least like four. I, I'll give yeah, I'll give you like most of them. Because I need to yeah, we're we're like okay. Okay, so where are they? Do we not? Oh, this is a oh you you got like the luckiest goddamn battlefield of your fucking life. Yeah. No, 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 give, give the, um, give the melee to someone else. <sighs> yeah, basically what we need to do is we need to have, um, we need to spread out as, there we go. Okay, because you need to go as wide as possible to make sure the archers don't screw you. Okay, so who do you- oh shoot, if you lose this guy, that's the Thoric buffed guy. Yeah. Okay, so the clan rats, yeah, they're actually gonna be better than you think, because they have plus three damage, so they should- But I don't think they buff- okay, you need to get the clan rats around. Avoid going into melee with the spearmen. Try to micro them the best you can. Okay, oh, you give me all of them, okay. Yeah. Okay, try to micro all the rats, so that they get around. The spearmen. I can gun down the spearmen. Just try to. You're faster than the spearmen. Just try to get into their units. You, you've got Thorax buffs. So you have plus two armor piercing. Probably GG for this army. Probably. Scanlan. Yes, yes. Were you in Force March? I don't know. Probably. They have dragons movies. Okay. Uh, take the start. I did. Okay. I mean, the dragon can get fucked by the gunners. Yeah, I think, okay. I'm gonna split out a little bit, just so the dragons can't. Make a check of formation, make a check of formation for them. 
Well, what I'm gonna- you guys will run up. And you guys just run around as much as you can, avoid the spearmen. I'll gun down the spearmen, just try to get on the archers. Just try to not stay in front of rattling gunners. Yeah, so like, just, just get out of range of the rattling gunners. Like, you see, the rattling gunners are aiming for their archers, so just keep out of their way. See them? We we are by. Okay. I should. <laughs> their archers are just destroying your rattling gunners. Yeah. Holy shit! It's just not even close. Yeah. I mean, we got the high ground, we got good terrain on them. Uh, someone's lagging out. Oh. Retreat! Retreat! You can shoot at the rug and I'm gonna move in. Our tail is yours! Agree, Rick! Srik, Srik! What, what? Yes, Master! Scary! Uh. I mean, I tried to get on the archers ASAP, but. A rattling gun! Greet Anaka! Don't don't go back into the spearmen. If you're on the outside, who is it? Oh, the the clan rat said he was controlling. Counselors, come on. Move, tail. Daedas, horn one. Rattling gun. Faster, Scotty. We we obey. Fire, shoot. What what? For the famine tide! For the famine tide! Rattling again! The smell must be fear! The ready, ready! <laughs> Rattling gun! Fight, fight! Guide us on, man! Rattling gun! You know, you'd think machine guns... You'd think machine guns would beat archers. What the orders? Retreat, retreat! Now move! Rattling gun. But no, the archers shred the rats. Why is it that rattling guns lose so hard to archers? What's causing that? Curse it, baby. It's just one thing I've always noticed, rattling guns lose to archers.
I, I told you, Hildrick, in this lifetime or the next, I would have my revenge, and I had it. I had my revenge, and you will rue the day you ever stepped on Dwarven lands. You will rue it. One thing I had, it was Undead Land. We, uh, we had that one. I don't want to Did you get caught in Force March, Hildrick? No. He wasn't. I mean, he wasn't tired. He didn't get caught in Force March. I mean, I'm in the sea. I'm out in the sea. Yeah. And I couldn't retreat, so probably wiped out this army. But that's why I'm getting lucky long now. He's he's extremely rich. He's the best ever. Number one. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They had ten archers to our eight rattling. You'd think eight rattling guns would beat they get arranged. They get arranged. Dude, fucking yeah, high because the archers, the archers also, had more range than the rattling also, guns. Also, the archers have way more missiles. They have about three times the missiles, and that just wrecks weapon teams. It's like a like an artillery unit. The uh, weapon teams. What happened to the guy? Did he just crash? Mm. Oh, Anhedonia? Yeah, where is Anhedonia? Yeah. I'm right he here. My did. internet died. Oh, are you still, like, able to play? Yeah, 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 I'm still. Okay. I'll take a save then. Yeah, the, the fucking. Click I didn't okay. expect the art just to m melt the weapons teams as click, much click, as click they okay. did. Eldrick, uh, the, these are the, uh, the archers. Eldrick! Uh, no, 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 no. Who isn't Eldrick. clicked okay? Is click okay? Click the big green button at the bottom. It says don't run anyone, dude. I think it's, uh... It's cause, um... Somebody dropped now. Yeah, in the middle. That's a long lance. Okay. Uh, Hildrick, are we... Hildrick? Yes? Can you choose a battle option? No. Are we stuck? Yes. Uh, okay, oh. we... Okay, well, we have to go back then. I'm just gonna have to resolve it. It's fine. Yeah, I don't resolve might do better. <laughs> I I'm not but sure. I mean... That one was brutal. I'm... We never even got to the dragons. I thought at the very least we'd gun down the archers. No, nope. that's not oh happening. Oh, bro. it just crashed my game completely. Uh, mine too. Oh, wait, there's an update apparently for the game. Should I get it? No. Or maybe it was. Uh, it already downloaded for me. I don't know. Don't well, I doubt there's an update that's gonna. Yeah, but we yeah, need to that be was the an same. update. We need to be on the it same was upgrade, workshop right? related though, so I don't know. Ah, okay. Yeah, I mean, what other mods do you use? That... We can try, but I might not be able to join if we are on different versions of the game. That's what I mean. Okay, well, just come join, and you know, a lot of you guys yeah, are. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm people trying. are gloom and dooming here before we even get in here. So, Arka, now how, how destructive and. Uh... Detrimental was me giving your f settlement to the flaming scribes. It did. It was already tier one. It did nothing. Yeah, you actually only give him XP. <laughs> In all honesty, if you had taken a settlement that was built up, that would be bad. But you, he literally just walked, took it, got free XP, and yeah. Oh, oh what cool. I wanted to say, by the way, um, in your comment on YouTube, Hash, I mean the little information that if people want to join your Discord, you talked about people uh, should be on NA server. Um, I'm on EU and I'm probably one of the people that are loading in the classes, so I don't think that the region actually... It, okay, works. I don't think it either is an NA or EU thing. I'm gonna be honest, I think what people are doing, to be blunt, I believe what people are doing is trying to keep their graphics as high as is possible on their five-year-old's mm. PC lagging out and then saying but it works fine in single player oh, it must be something uh, else yeah i get what you mean i'm just saying that the region doesn't matter actually it doesn't uh, really there's one yeah. guy in, in he's in sardinia but i can understand why sardinia can't play with us where the fuck is sardinia sardinia is that island to the west of italy not Corsica, the other one. Ah, yeah, but I'm from Germany. Uh, and well, the thing is, here. if you go from Sardinia to Italy to NA, that actually starts...
taking time. Yeah, I get it. What you mean. Hey, what the fuck are the orcs doing this whole time? I haven't heard a peep out of them. Am I I'm gonna be honest, I haven't heard the orcs either. Where have you guys been? <laughs> chilling. They were, chilling. Like, ten That's turns it. ago, they were like, don't worry, we'll come save you. The the Tomb Kings have gotten their production into full swing. By the way, this is like this is this is like America has gone to war. <laughs> if you kill this I'm army, fucking, I'm fucking horrified of Ark and the Black. Black. Did you get oh, oh my god, he could do what I do times three. By the way, because he I I can only recruit out of one province, and that's how much uh, I can do. Ark and the Black might be the United States, but I'm the Taliban. Well, Ark on the Black, Ark on the Black, literally, oh, he's, somebody... he's called Ark on the Black because of all the oil, I guess. Okay, somebody yes. said something it's that popular. Tornado wasn't doing with, uh, uh, what's your dude's name again? Volkmar the Grim? No, yeah, someone, okay, who, who in my chat said there was something you could do with Volkmar that was really strong that nobody's done so far? Say that again, because I want to know if that's, like, an actual thing, or if this is, like, like a I thing... Mean, Tornado hasn't done it, it's probably not an extra thing, right? Well, I, really, I mean, like, I, I don't know what I'm doing, so. It was like uh, spamming a hero or something. And, yeah, oh my God, I'm gonna have to look this up. Warrior priest. Warrior priest, yeah. Somebody said warrior priest spam. Yeah, they are pretty fucking crazy, but like, we're not at that point in the game. I can't even, I don't have the, the settlement to build that. What happened mm. to Friendly Von Dragon? Uh, Friendly Von Dragon had an accident involving one of the 80 skeletons he was assigned to, sh to shoot. He's recovering in Sudenberg. We wish him the best. <laughs> I shot like seven Lich Priests and they just kept spawning. I ran out of ammo. Used the eighth bullet on myself. Didn't have to. Just wanted to. <laughs> it's just good for the dramatic effect. <laughs> I'm gonna get a new PC. I think it's my SSD, but it's also probably yeah. It's, um, it, well, it's so it's and, so SSD dependent the loading time. And Hedoniac, can you can you see my army? I can. <laughs> I'm assuming Tornado's gonna win the first couple of involvements, but I don't think his economy will be able to keep up. Do you see that? Do you see the army? <laughs> you see what's inside it? Did you look? I didn't. No. <laughs> what the fuck? I was, I turn, right? <laughs> oh, your main army? I can't see that. I can only see Oh, one holy one. shit. That's going to be fun. Okay, this should be... Care. Guys, this should be at the end of the turn, so we should have nothing more to do. Oh, wait. Yeah. You, you can't see it. I don't think you can. Yeah. No, he can't see it. You can't see it. Guys, this no, is... No, you can see the little... You can see the little army in Sudenberg. Okay, yeah. We can see... We can see that, but we can't see what's in it. It's a bit hidden. Guys, we were at the end of turn, so come on, let's go. Go, 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 go. Are they okay. just gonna auto-resolve the battle? Or do we yes. replay it? Well, do you want yeah. us to replay it? You think we can do better mm -hmm. this I mean, time? I mean, oh, I, mean I, don't know, I don't know how the auto-resolve is. If it's auto -resolve. pretty shit, then, was painful. Yeah, then just auto-resolve it. I mean, getting completely wiped is pretty shit. It doesn't really matter. Yeah. yeah. It's happening then. Yeah, but not getting 5k. Emory? The northern economy is turning on. The south might be winning battles, but we're just outnumbering them. It's more like the fucking Soviet Union. I think you guys forgot about the dwarves. Uh, I mean, we didn't forget. It's just Queek wants to PvE, and the orcs want to <laughs> PvE, and I'm like, not even on one province fighting for my fucking life over here. As people are like, mm. I, I, I need, I need to get one more. Pro oh, hold on, I just want to get this. One. Uh, hold on, can you, can you last seven more turns? <laughs> <laughs> we have, we have just uh, the hero, um, Kairos Fate Weaver, just moving up. He's like, I'm finally coming. I'll yeah, be... I've got my chosen of He's Z doing H. everything you can. Okay, I'm just gonna do that again. Alright, uh, let's go back down to our yes. no, one why, channel. Why, why can't we just vibe together in one channel? Oh my god, no! My movement just got dicked up. <sighs> I 
I don't understand how you beat the Tomb Kings. Like, you just keep pooping out stacks after others get killed. So what do you do? Um... Well, my units aren't really that good yet. They're getting there. Asap commands. The bird death differs. Impossible. Are we frozen again? No, show kid a thing. Okay. Queen Kalida. Hmm. Um, okay, Hildrick, I need an army to defend Lamia. I mean, it, it's barricaded and all. I could also. Oh, shit. Libarus shall rise again. Shit, I mean... Weak. No, I, I just gotta start pulling back. Other and us. Bakwasur! March! Libarus shall rise again. Soon. Oh, okay. Well, he decided to go for me. Um, I think my army seem to have really bad auto resolve. Because this army is really fucking good. This is I, yeah. I I've got constructs and shit now. Yeah, yeah he's hard. Joke. Yeah. Okay. So he does have. Okay. He's got the blessed spears, Sars. Those guys will fuck up my constructs. You have to stay away from those. But the rest of his army is not very strong. Use the range to kill the attacker units. Like the list is really sophisticated. Yeah, my, my army is strong. I've got Ushapti's. Um, I've got some Polkal Stalkers. I mean, his army is tier 2. The skins are useless though. Well, that's what I'm saying. His army is tier 2. If he, okay, if he had the Saurus with shields, this might be harder. But regular Saurus, they're not bad. Okay, so... We need... Wait, we took him to terrain, we took him to terrain. Oh wait, it is a choke point. Yeah, but uh, oh, wait, I do outrange him, that is true. Yeah. Um... Just put your knees in this choke, easy. Yeah, I think I win this one hard. Queek is just trying to PvE out, like, the biggest fucking lead of his life while I'm here not even on my home province yet. I feel a little bit betrayed, but I'm not gonna say anything. Okay, uh, Hildrick, remember, horse archers can ca charge. They do have 35 charge, so, you know, pinch, you don't need to let Coralers just trade blows with you. Okay, I need... who's gonna man my front line? I'll do it. Okay, and Indoniac. Um, okay, these are not the greatest frontliners of all time. You got a Tomb Guard, he's solid. I'm eating, I'm eating, I can't play. Are you serious? Yeah. Holy okay, no, I meant, um, I meant the battle, I meant the battle. Oh my god, okay. Um... You guys should be on two, you guys will be on four, you guys on three, you guys will be my heavy The crop knights are heavy cav. They might not look like it, but these are heavy cav. You want to get in? No. Well, nah, fuck. Oh, Fine, right. Hildrick, uh, cause I have too much to control. I don't trust you guys controlling my, like, super high-end constructs. I'm not bad at the game, bitch. Well, I mean, take him, take him. And then my shop do will does Kalita get her, um, sneak? A little bit later. If I win this battle, I should be good. So you want me to just, uh, the front line to the chokes? Yeah, just take the front line. Uh, if things start going bad, I'll have my Ushapti crash through. 
Yeah, don't the stalkers... The stalkers should have good ammo. I, th their ammo got buffed recently. So... They have more ammo. Oh, I thought... I thought Sepulchral stalkers had anti-large ammo. No, it's just they themselves are anti-large. Yeah, but their melee attack is so shit. They're basically a ranged unit that can... They, they don't even have a charge. No, they're terrible. Oof. Okay, just take the chokes. Take the chokes, take the chokes. Go! The Necropolis Knights. Get the Necropolis Knights to the left. Because those are large. Yeah, okay, he's lost them. Alright, just, just take the chokes, just take the chokes. Send the Nehekagarn warriors in. Guys, you gotta let. Oh boy. I just need to sit Kalita nearby so everyone gets her buff. Okay, I'm going to heal. Oh, no, I'm just healing the Usha update. So wind! Cross them! Hobey! Oh. This is well. Hobey, move! Uh, get the Necropolis Knights on Krakar. Right here. Please, please get the Necropolis Knights on Krakar. He's 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 hunting Kalida and your anti-large heavy cav. Invocation. 
Okay, I just need to stand next to you so you get the melee attack. Just don't, just stay on top of him. Just stay on top of him. No, but I put us some magic. No, I put magic on you. Oh. I'm, I'm telling you, you just gotta stay on him, please. Do not let him charge me. I'm gonna die if he gets one hit on me. So be it. Half micro. Legions <laughs> forward. They see me rolling, they hating. I agree. Fucking Kalita on the chariot. The queen moves. I, I'm only killing four units. Ed, you're, you're, you're doing a very good job. Thanks. Why are the Necropolis Knights not on Krakar? They are. They're not. I'm they watching them be. not being on Krakar. I literally have them you have to keep clicking please if i lose kalita we are done Okay, please get the Necropolis Knights to just take out the Stegosaurus. I am. Because I'm just being completely surrounded because I, we had to take everything onto Kalita. I know. Okay, you got horsemen in the back. What are you doing with them? What do you mean? They're, they're like in the back, but could, could we get those in here? Yeah. You, okay, I, I'm taking the Krampus Knights back. <laughs> what do you mean? Because you're, you're not... They're, they're continuously doing nothing, and I... I Really need them more than ever doing shit right now. That okay, whatever. I don't think it's not what I was doing. So. It, you're, it, it's because they're on guard mode, and you're not you, you're not telling them enough to do stuff, so they keep not doing stuff. My necro tech. All my heroes are dead. That's shitty. Oh well. Okay, at this point, I'm taking the Necropolis Knights out. Because there's no way. I mean, all these units are dying. Yeah, I mean, the little serpent boys are taking them down. It's really close. Just 
take out the spearmen. This guy, these people's ammo lasted so long. Yeah. Am I faster? They're 39. I'm 50. Yeah, we run these skinks down. Uh, okay, I lost heroes that I can't replace, but he lost blessed units that he really can't replace. Are those score searchers still shooting? Yes. God damn. They have a lot of ammo. Yeah, they do. Uh, have the uh, count thing, but there's a small chance that you need to just come back. No. Okay, these stalkers, they didn't even get that many kills. How is that possible? What about the gun value? It's the gold value. Man. What? The gold value. What? The gold value. Um. Gold value not great either. Well, okay, this one does, but I think that one was shooting a Stegadon. Now imagine this was the choke point now. This is on the choke points? Am I really gonna chase these guys for like two kills? Yes. Uh, that's everything. Well, I mean, could you get those? Mm, yeah. Thank you. I mean, how do you still have ammo? You've been shooting all game. We beat the shit out of each other pretty hard. Yeah. He didn't lose Croc Guard though, which means he levels up this and I don't. I tried my best to get rid of the fucking knights. They just didn't want to be a spam kit. They just both their balances. Alright. 
Ugh, I lost every hero. Oh, shit. Yeah, you. They were just shooting forever. They just. Ne I mean, I. I think horse archers scale decently. Not amazing, but decently. Nehekar and Horsemen after they're buffed. Yeah, I mean they're doing good. Nehekar and Horsemen will stay. Skeleton Horsemen, not so much. Yeah. It sucks that you can get so low level buff. If I could just get her on her fucking snake, she gets armor. Until she's on her snake, she doesn't have armor. Yeah. Can you chase the army down? I mean, I could heal a little bit, but I kind of need the Canoptic Jars. I haven't been generating them at all. Throwing them. Um... Is my throne ready? Your oh. king. What? No, I'm I'm pulling back. Find my harem. I uh I will be done. I said they move. Snake Skyrim. Two archers is fine. If I actually get a front line, that's far superior. You need a bit of some fire. I have two. No, I do have two Nehekar and Horsemen, but the other one. Shit, the other one's in the other army. Not now. Submit. For a giant brow. Oh boy, you gave me Skaven Slaves. And a Skaven Slave Slinger. <laughs> yeah. Can, can you upgrade that? I won't. Like, cause, uh... Not that I'm complaining, you know, I'm just... You know. You know, just making some casual stuff. God, I'm getting all the worst. <sighs> Okay, well, let's look at what I can recruit. Necrochect. That's not great, but it helps a little bit. Bitch Priest, that's strong. Which is the best? Is Nehekarn lore really good? Because. Yeah, it's meh. I could get. Uh, do, do any of these lures heal? Well, probably not because I'm a construct. Oh, I think Nakara does. Oh, yeah, Nakara does heal. But wait, you guys should make outposts in um, Lamia. No, that'll be too much. Because you're only at 20 units to get through. Oh. Yeah, it's weird, but that's just how it'd be. If you guys could get me gold, I could go to sandstone walls. Oh, it's fine if you don't, I'm just saying. I'll give you 4,000. How much is four? Uh, 400? Uh, I don't have I, I'm trying my best to just upgrade shit. I mean, I could also you know, upgrade the outpost and give you money for the walls and stuff. Can you get in the, uh, tier 2 money-making buildings? I mean, I've got a lot. I just need to rebuild my army. He is gonna take- cause, like, he lost blessed units. So, he's in a worse position than I am. Thorax coming up. Thorax army is so shit. I don't think it'll push back my shit tier army. But I do want to get the Nehekar and Horseman off it. 
Dark looks scary. Volkmar looks scary. Address me as your highness. Attend your king, slaves. What does this uh, Giga Skeleton Spearman do? It's literally a normal skeleton spearman yeah, was that, uh, with less leadership. I oh, know more was leadership. That? You should recruit your Giga. You get a regiment of renown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's like you get like a Giga regiment of renown? If I do what? Okay, combine some of your savage orcs and um, recruit. Sorry, that took me that long. I needed to recover from that awful fight. Man, these stalkers fucked me up bad. Okay, uh, put some of uh, you... Shok, Shok. Okay, take some of your Savage Orcs and recombine them. And then um, you should have a Regiment of Renown for a huge Rogue Idol. Do you see it? No. Uh, okay, you need to send that again. Wait, don't don't actually send it again. It's just gonna bug out. Don't do anything. You don't you don't have a regiment of renown for a rogue idol. On Wurzag's himself army. No, I don't see it. Uh, Are you sure? Because everyone else got it. Weird. I think he's just not finding it. Uh, I'm not sure. Wait, so what am I looking for? Are you in your yeah. regiment of renown? Click on Wurzog, go to regiment of renown. That's the second recruit button, not the first one. It just says you currently cannot use. Regiment of Renown. Or Regiment of Renown. What are you doing there from the territory? It's fine. Go ahead and start the territory. Go left here. Okay. Well, the Lizardman army has been temporarily stomped on. Remember guys, I'm on two cities, and I've been here for a long time, so I, I kinda... Like, Thoric is scaling. The Lizardmen are scaling. I'm not really scaling. Like, I should be at probably tier 4 by now. Dude. Like 14 cities. Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. Y'all are sitting there PVEing, and I'm like, I'm very close to dying, at which point we will lose the game. Don't worry, my friend. Sending like I'm defending here, but I'm just saying like your 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 guys' little PvE adventures are gonna reach an impasse when they start pouring up 4v3. I because the AI keeps attacking So what do we do? Do we just go help you or I'm saying you you gotta like make a second front and hit people. I am Okay, you should now Shoke be able to get your regiment to run out. Oh. It's still grayed out for me. I how? It says you currently you cannot currently recruit regiments of renown. It said that the whole game. What have you done wrong? You're just sitting in a village and you can't recruit regiments of renown. Yeah, because I maybe for multiplayer. I don't know. I don't like how I can't move my lord out of his way, and Volkmar is just gonna. Break his face.
Are you? I I, I have to. Are you in like March stance? No, I I. When I tried to move, it was just gray. I literally couldn't move. Just you should have to resolve this. It's death. You don't want to do as much damage as we can. Yes. Why do you just want to like give up? Who who would want to just give up? Honestly, we just need to get a couple of ghouls onto those free company, and they'll take so much damage. Just give me the ghouls. I'll manage the ghouls. Zinch frees me in place. Yeah. I didn't even know he could do that. Yep, that's what he can do. That's his special powers. Yeah, wait. No, he should be able to get regiments for now no matter what DLC he owns. The button should show up. Give me the ghouls. Ghouls are... Yeah, I don't own much DLC. I only have a... Isn't Warzog free? Yeah, I have that one. But I only have one, uh, three, two, and one. And I didn't buy any additional uh, DLC. Um, and I got the free content. You might need Grom for the... the 30th gun? anniversary. I think so. Okay, guys. See where I'm deployed? The, okay, well, why did you give me the Tomb King? Okay, well, whatever. Um... Oh boy, you guys are not gonna be able to... Okay, so I could put the ghouls here, but they're gonna die, aren't they? You guys aren't... Okay, guys, move up here. Guys, 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 pay attention. Okay, we need to run here because he, I guarantee he's gonna run back there and wait for reinforcements. So we need to set up in a position to just run up there. These ghouls have... They should have... Stock, yes. So he can't see them. And we just need to get the skeleton chariots. Are those archers? We have death glow vomineers too. Yeah, we can do so much damage to them. Are our units divvied out? Yeah. Okay. I give um, Hildrick the range units and choke the uh, chariots and. Okay, guys, move up, move up, move up, move up, move, 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 move. See, I told you exactly what he was gonna do. So we should be in exactly the position to deal with this. So I want you guys to move. Okay, I need you guys to move like that. So then I can go in like that, and he won't be. No, see, you guys are moving right next to me. That's that's the opposite of what I want. No, you guys like this. That way my ghouls can get right into range without him having to weapons deployed against it. See, like, see how he's he's already maneuvering to stop that. I don't want him to maneuver to stop me. Battle awaits. My will be done. Wait, don't tomb kings have? Oh, cause you're on cavalry, so he doesn't have. Tomb king. Yeah, he doesn't have a silver shield. Guys, I need people not. Uh, see, the closer you are to me, the more he's looking in this direction. I want the ghouls to basically get on top of him uninterrupted. Because, like, he literally can't see them due to stock, is what I'm saying. Like, he literally does not know they're here. So, like, the, the more we give away that we're here, the more he's looking in this direction. Things 
long as you. You skeleton archers aren't moving up. Here, give me the skeleton archers. Okay, he's gonna find out I'm here pretty quickly, and we. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, he sees me. Damn it. That's why I didn't want people on the right. Yeah, see, he's just kind of been completely foiled. Like, he moved out in this direction to block you guys. Ugh. Okay, well, there's nothing I can do about his cap right now. Fuck off. Hell that hammer! Who's <laughs> Don't give them an inch! We march! Lag is so annoying. Yeah, who is lagging? Yeah, I'm not sure. As long as we have with them, we will hold! Oh my god, dude. We are mere men! What a thing to do! King! What level was this guy? Uh, only four. Not too bad. Okay, his army is tough. Even if we get those ghouls into melee range, the free companies still perform pretty decently. Oh, that's right, we had Death Globe Bombardiers. They didn't do anything because they didn't go on range. They did what? They did nothing. Oh. You can go through speed. I am. I'm just waiting for him.
easy like not ending. Uh, can, can you, can you, Why are we all moving in here? What's up? Can you, can you three speed? Oh, oh yes, sorry. That's oh, not me. Fucking death blow bombardiers. So, Hash, how did you like uh, the men of colonial Britain? I mean, what did I say, Hash? I mean, uh, Archon. Archon? Uh, this wasn't a really great stack. It was, it was well, a good stack. This wasn't a great stack for the uh, for the memers either because they they got crunched in from the edge of the battlefield as reinforcements. Uh, this is not this is not how they're intended to be used. I mean, the flagellants died, dude. Oh yeah, mm. my favorite unit, the flagellants. They will be missed. Mm. The mortar survived. It's the only important thing. Volkmar is kind of a haunted unit on the battlefield, by the way. I, I, I know this was a little bit of a, of a mop-up, but, like, he's still a gigantic meme. You don't like Volkmar? No, I mean, he's a meme in a good way. Just all of his spells and shit. Well, actually, those direwolves got so much damage. They did, yeah. Good to know. But what if you do a, twin, a full stack of turn rolls and you send them out of the Felicia? Which is 19 dire walls. <laughs> there would actually be. I think I could do something about that. I'll get waiting for players. Also, who is lagging during the fight? Somebody must be able to see their FPS drop. Yeah, I think... There's different types of lag. Well, it's the lag with, because somebody's having low FPS during the middle of the battle. That's what the lag was because of. I mean, either someone has a really shitty connection or someone is lagging, and, uh... I could go either way on this one. Attend your king, uh, okay, do we move in separate channels? Wait, Neat stops movement for all of my lords? Yes. That is Your a entire fair faction. and fondly designed faction. I'm really glad they added that. <laughs> I'm a bird, dude. What do you want from me? A two headed bird, might I add. I'm fucking scared of you. Um, what's your face? Funny bird man. You're scared of me? Why? You're, you're Arcan the Black. Wait, what? Wait, you said you're scared of the funny bird man, that's me. Oh, no, oh, no, not not you, Arcan. I'm, I'm scared of Arcan. I can't move. It would be scared of <laughs> So you're just continuing what Hash and I have been doing for the last hours, staring at each other. I'm not staring at anybody, I've been fighting it out. Do you know how many Tomb Kings have died? <laughs> A lot. Not enough, I would say. True! Well said, friend. Alright, back to your channels, mate. Go on, off your trot. Okay, so a little bit of a setback, but Archon can replace indefinitely. Plus, you kind of have five provinces, which is a bit of a lot. Well, I lost a level four lord and I gained a level eight lord. Good. Good. I'm ambushing next to my capital, so hopefully he doesn't see that, runs up and dies. If anyone has gold, I could start upgrading Lamia's walls. I, for once, I actually do have gold. 
I mean, if you guys have gold, I can upgrade Lamia's walls, and that gives us... Uh... Actually, it, it's taking too long. Just request it. Wait, what faction are you? Oh, Archon. Try this again. Okay, nope. It, it went back to these random orcs. Take three. We may be able to aid each other. My when do we get a? I demand three thousand gold. Fantastic. Do you have endgame um dilemmas on? What? Oh you yeah. End? You can't turn them off in multiplayer. I, I really doubt we're gonna get that far. Oh, I was wondering if you had them on like super early. No, no, you, you can't even change them at all. I could get some stronger weapons. I mean, just so long as you have some weapon pieces to do damage when he runs up. My army can't. My army can't hurt dwarves. They'll just tank them forever. In six turns, Lamia will be pretty well defended. Uh, actually, money? I think you money. No, no, I, I have it building. At this point, I can't do anything with money. Like, I actually need to get some land back. Uh, put kings in the fucking thing, I don't know. No, he's ambushing. He can't see him. No, the whole point is to try to convince him to run up. Should I make mortars, by the way, or just those? Poison wind mortars are really good. They take two turns, though. Half my army takes two turns at this point. I'm just deploying an advanced construct. Did you, okay, did you want me to make mortars, or do you want me to make or this water units and move up to Lania? Um, just make some vanilla units and move up. Well, you know what I mean, like, just gunny boys. Motors would be really good at being able to take them out in sieges, though. It's gonna take two turns. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying. I mean, I could, if you want me to. I'm just saying. You know, you do you. Do you. I'm just saying. I could get Necropolis Knights with Halberds. Oh my god. His lords wouldn't stand a chance. Okay, how are we timing out, guys? We're uh, using a little bit of time here. Oh my god, we're actually gonna time out a turn. I'm just getting nothing but the lizard men theme going on now. 
No, I'm still ambushing. He doesn't see me. Yes, see it is Okay. Um Well, I didn't roll up shit for my lords. My will be done. The greatest artist. Where are my slaves? What did you have? Treacherous melee attack for two scorpions. That's not terrible. I should just keep the Canoptic Guard jar guy. I don't know. God, I wish I had Canoptic jars. The jar calls. Attend your king. King of tombs. Priest king of greatest dynasty. The problem is they're both legendary lords, so like, I, I can't use one army to beat either. Oh my good god. Is that you pinging? No, you can see who it is. Oh, he probably took vision of you. I don't know why he's pinging that. He backed out, so I'm just gonna go. Tomb King of Nehekara. I'm gonna swap you over to here. Then you all start getting some advanced My units on. I really need to get my Ushabti cover back. Where are my slaves? 
Slay. This guy's not bad though, because he at least generates uh empty jars. Land of the dead. Nothing else, I just wait for Kalita. I could really use some help at some point pushing these people out. You see the army I'm making? I'm just saying, like, I'm sitting on two cities. Yeah, I got but... people having field days PvEing, and I'm I'm on two cities. Dude, I do you see the army I'm making? Yeah, I mean I know you're building one, but could you get Queef? I'm gonna build this as hard as big stuff, okay? You got a level 25 Queek? Naga Shizar? That's actually a solid thought. What do I get for Naga Shizar again? Isn't it like a crazy buff? If you really want to help me, go take um, Broken Teeth. On Naga Shizar, there should be an extremely powerful Skaven army. But if you have a level 25 Queek, you could probably kill it. Yeah. Like, it, that's the best thing you could do to help me, is to get me that. Are you good with your turn? Yes. Okay, we really shouldn't be... Five turning these, sorry, five minuting turns where no one's doing anything. How's it going out west? Pretty good. I'm finally. Look at Karen's work. You can see Karen's on. No. Still no. What? Didn't you vermintide his capital? No. I could, though. I'm saying, aren't you getting a vermintide ready for his capital? I could. The problem isn't the turn timer, so to speak. The problem is that, like, people are sitting here contemplating every single action they can take. Outpost. Timing out every single turn. In all honesty, wow. I do need to move it down to a three-minute turn timer. I don't know. I, th I think after this game, we might go three-minute turn timers. Sure. Too many people are sitting on their turn just sort of like... Thinking through every possibility, and it's just like, hmm. Pay to get the tomb prince. I shall take your advice. I deign to move. Okay, he's just sitting in his province. They're, they're just sitting here waiting to outscale me. A bold strategy. Power in unlife.
Okay, I think I get rid of my Lich Priest of Life. If nothing else, the Lich Priest... Well, let me think here. I want to get light. Let's... Okay, here's what we'll do. Close the shield. I mean, don't read too much into auto results. Okay, this is winnable as fuck. Yeah, it has purple units, though. Don't oh, you have no. purple units? No. Okay. Why not? So, are you in a stance? I'm in the, uh, the anti-ambush one. Oh my fucking god, that's perfect. Holy shit, that's perfect. Okay, here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna set up a front line of your four front liners. The ghouls are gonna flank. We're gonna use the ambush thing to hide the hex rays. And we're gonna ram the knights with them. Go can hold your foot units do you want. Ah, uh, you could give me the X rays and any units that like make my crew intensive, second micro. It's just a flat planes. Okay, the only unit. You just need to set up your hex rates to compete his knights. Other than that, the casket of souls will slowly win it. Okay, um... I'm thinking... Give me the... Okay, so one dude should manage our front line. I'll manage the Ushabti. Um... Okay. I'll manage the Ushabti. We have the front line, we have the Ushabti. Oh wait, we get Vanguard. Should we Vanguard? Yeah, probably. Do you guys want a vanguard? Because I forgot. No, 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 no cause uh, we, need, we need range advantage with the archery that we have. I think we should stay behind. But he's got range advantage. Wait, what? He's all ranged. Any militia. Every militia is ranged. Heldrick. Oh yeah. Every single militia is a gun. They all have guns. Okay, move up the archers. I don't blow Put the hex rays a little bit. M move up the archers. Move up the archers. Don't blow up too much. Like, make lines. Make uh, space down lines. Yo, are you here? Yeah. Sh move up the archers. You're the archers. Move up the archers, Shok. We have Vanguard. No, no, no. Like, like just literally space them out so they don't get. Spelled. Yeah, like you see how my shop tier spaced out. Yeah, just do like that. Make wide. Don't don't try to go like tall formations. Go wide formations. Although, oh, actually, if a unit has a shield, keep the shielded units in um, thick boy formations because they're gonna get shot with guns. The hex rays should be a little bit farther. I honestly think if I was Tornado, I'd put the cavalry on the left side. I think the cavalry will be here. I have the remember I have the crib goals in the back, by the way, so they're gonna like ram ass in. Start about. I wonder if he expects me to put the ghouls what back here. What you do here. with is you spend the reflection vault more, I think. Honestly, okay, I'm gonna put the ghouls back here just in case he guesses I'm gonna do the same trick. Although this is the same trick, so maybe the same trick would not be going for this trick. You could always put two on each. Yeah, I think that's the best way to do it. Then if he calls our bluff, we lose two ghouls, but we stay in it. Well, I mean, I don't know if it's a bluff. Plus, a casket will be shooting while he does that. Are you started? Yeah. Nope, he oh. didn't. What the fuck? Wait, how did he know? What the fuck? Guys, start moving! 
Guys, 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 we're playing. Oh, you know that. It's so weird. Some units because they don't have any left. Archers, get the archers shooting. Anything. There was Archon. Give him Archon, I guess. I don't know. Hey, give me Archon, I'll manage. I, I'm. Okay, the ghouls are actually fucking destroying him over here. Fight, man. Fight, man. He has his knights on my. Yeah, no one. Uh, take the archers. Archers, shoot back on the Empire Knights. Archon, where is Archon going? Put Archon back on the Empire Knights. We need to save the Casket of Souls. Guys, the most important thing right now is the Casket of Souls. Don't take the Nehekaran warriors back. You're going to get gunned down before you get back. All right, get the casket of skills shooting again. We kind of got completely destroyed here. Can we spirit leech Volkmar? Oh no, wait, that's right. He has. Get the casket shooting again. Get the casket shooting. Just shoot. Just shoot. What spells do we have? What do we Okay, losing the Hexer has kind of completely destroyed us. Where did they go? Okay, guys, get the archers on the Empire Knights. Oh, I mean, we got nothing. That was bad. Yo, how did the Hexer die? They got circled and died instantly. Yeah, oh. he vanguarded his units into our vanguard and they just shot them all right at the start. Oh, uh, that was really bad. Now, son, these hex rates are in Texan territory, and you know what that means. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm just so happy to settle it. It's yours. Okay. That was, that was insanely cringe, I'm not gonna lie. The battle's that's not, a free, that's not a free company, Mr. It's a free win militia. <laughs> Jesus How did you see the units? Like, we couldn't see yours. Uh, because uh, I don't know who you was walked into here. the ambush. The, the ambush was foiled. Um, the thing is that usually the one in the field battle, the attacker should see the enemy army. 
uh, in a settlement met battle, it's the other way around. So I'm a little bit confused why you, why we could see Arkan because Arkan was the attacker here, right? Wasn't he? Wait, how do the rules work? Uh, in in a field battle, the attacker can see the army of the defender, and in a settlement battle, it's the other way around. Well, in this case, it was a foiled ambush, and he was attacking. Yeah. But I guess that means I was that's, attacking. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I mean, because if he walked into it in the ambush foiled and that counted as the engage, then that means that you are the attacker. If he would have just, you know... Those hex raids, by the way, just got fucking... Britannia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They just that's got, how, they that's just how got the samurai. Indians felt in uh, yeah. America. Uh, I isn't like this, like and I think Doniac, don't Indian. tell me you crashed again. Don't even go there. No, 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 he's there. He's there. Okay. You didn't lose a single fucking unit. Following Sigmar's path. Wait, did that King Meshep not reinforce? Did you not move him close enough? No, 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 no. He it was a foiled ambush, ambush, so he didn't reinforce. It's like it's like it's a ambush, but it's we don't get the uh, the unique ambush thing, you know. But it still counts as he walked into your ambush, so he, uh, he gets engaged. It's like uh, if you um, intercept the the tunneling stance or something like that. I, the fucking hex wraith meme. I, I just I can't. This army shouldn't be working. <laughs> Please punish me for my sins. I, I don't deserve victory. Okay, hold on. Wait, is this? No, wait, tornado. I, I need you. I need you. Uh, I need you. Uh, leave for a second. Goodbye. Okay, spam the fuck out of direwolves and ghouls. Holy shit. Direwolves and ghouls. Direwolves and ghouls. Your your melee is fucking useless. Your skeletons cannot reach him before they die. They're they're, they're actually dead weight in your army. Hex rays are good too, but direwolves and wolves. Your your skeletons just are, they just don't like against other armies they sort of tank. Against that army they just get kited and died. Even the Nehekarans, their speed is twenty eight. They're they're useless. Unless you got nothing else, like, holy shit, they're just direwolves and ghouls. They can kill them, nothing else can. Direwolves and ghouls. I reign. Arise, legions. Um, Khalid is coming back next turn. Attend your king, slaves. Priest king of greatest dynasty. Yes. What does the... Wait, I thought I got... Did I delete my witch? No, 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 no I didn't. Is death good enough? Because death has wise. I, I really kind of need these canoptic joys. What does death have again? Spirit leech? Ah. Purple sun is okay. Um, incantation preservation. You're coming. I mean, that's good. I is there any lord who trains? Holy shit! I just need canoptic jar generation. I need canoptic jar generation so bad. Yeah. No, those direwolves earlier got like 160 kills. They were no, no, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, you guys are confused. No, no, no. these are not. These aren't undead direwolves. These are Tomb King direwolves, which for some reason are just better. Hunting the wicked. Okay. Uh, yeah, you have like five. I'm, I'm, I'm not like I'm not worried you're gonna die at any rate. You Shopti did okay as well. The problem is we we started the battle and we were instantly down units. By the time he fully replenishes, I'll have another full stack. Or is there a difference? Because Tomb King Direwolves are just better, because fuck you. Don't ask, it's just that this thing. Does Archon come back from the dead quicker or anything? Or is he out for five turns?
the astral lock. I, I don't. Did, did he leave and then donate? I'm gonna be honest, the dire the fell beds are okay. I, I don't know. Gonna do two Nagashi's army. My lord, I am so fucking turning three minute timers on. Considering every possibility, every turn is getting old. Sigma, grant me strength. I can't really remove any more melee from this army, but I kind of have to. Uh, free company's weakness is range, but I don't think he's got any range, and he doesn't buff archers. Um, they do armor pen when they're with Volkmar as well. If you could fight an army that wasn't Volkmar, it would not work, but the Volkmar army does work. Why did the Skaven declare war on you? That's weird. You guys, click through. Get through. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. The, the longer you take, the more it lags, and the more it lags, the more it can crash. I, I I don't know where Zog's not doing too well. Okay, if you could just pull your army down, I could get land. Yeah. It's just like you're PVEing a lot, yeah. and I'm and I'm literally dying. Wait, why am I not doing? This? I mean. You're just kind of not expanding much. I have double your expansion. No, I'm just kidding. Like, if you kill that orc leader from the guy above you, you'll just take him. I'm just stuck in non-stop Lizardman music. Is there any way to level my army while sitting here? I thought Tomb Kings could like level their armies while being stationary off some shit. Cause like I need it all the way up here. Beach. I can't draw. Okay. Hey. Oh, Siege is right there somehow. Oh yeah, because he's been expanding. Attack and melee defense on skeleton chariots? Wait, this guy is so good. Holy shit. 
Wait, if I knew you could get this guy, this guy makes chariots like legitimately amazing. Okay, what units do, do I want to get rid of my skeleton horse archers finally? My father demands it strengthen our legions. I think that Shinshin needs help. You look like you're about to be, be collapsed on the two people. Yeah, I've been, been happening all game. Yeah, everyone. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna send a support arm. I, I've needed help for uh, quite some time now. Only me and Hildred are close enough. Left. Well, if someone could hit Thoric, if, if they, if you could like hit. Kerag Urug and just oh, take yeah, that because like he needs to get the fuck out of here he's not trapped in his mountains and I know he's scaling up and we didn't blow up Kerag Zorn so he's yeah he's, he's upgrading yes it is done next time Undying Prince! That's Chariot Master guy, holy shit. Hmm? Although I don't have the chariots upgraded. Is there a way, can I get like a Cavalry Master? I don't want to lose my Canoptic Jar Generation. Be done. But I need to refresh my Necrotex to get to more units. me as your highness. Run, fools! Oh, are you moving up? Okay, let me move up with you then. Onward, soldiers! Well, should I save to get the. Okay, sh here's a question. Do I go for the Necrotech now, or should I save, the save to get Rakash? He's not that amazing, but he'd be an Immortal King. So, I could actually have a second Lord that doesn't get constantly wiped. What do you? Honestly, let's save for now. I could also do one of these. There's no herald for cavalry. There's one for Ushapti that makes Ushapti good, but there's no herald for cavalry. See, the, the tomb guard one is so fucking good. Yeah, the one. The problem is... This doesn't really do anything. 70 armor piercing damage? They don't even do any armor piercing damage. Yeah, they do one. are pretty bad the only good one I'm, I'm gonna work over here because I really need to get an immortal leader so my leaders stop dying Servants. 
I would sit in El Calabad. You don't really want to fight Volkmar in an open field without Archon. Are we really timing out another turn? Okay, timing out our turns is not working. Well, I mean, it, we're, we're barely... We're, we've like totally crawled to a stop here. But because uh, I have so much to do, actually. We're, we're not, that. we're not doing much of anything. I need to build buildings in my twenty settlements, some to work with my units, and my heroes. Okay, we're just coming in. Make okay. your offer, but use um auto construction. Don't they have that? Why would you use that? Dude? That's so bad. Quick time. Uh, you should see each uh, Torek right now. I'm coming with this one. A brand is sitting right next to a settlement. Why would you drag me to this war, man? Okay, that orc faction to the north that's killing you. Literally just kill their leader's army and you'll confederate them. What is a confederate? What does that mean? You, you take them. Oh, you can get Cavalry Master. Ready, father. Okay, so I just need a roll Cavalry Master. Move that army to the north back into the poles of despair. I have arrived. Don't let him take a fair fight. Prince, but I don't need the shit he's giving me. I don't need chariot master. I'm not really even using chariots. Unfortunately, my necrotech is giving me canoptic jars, and I can't. I'd, I'd like a better one, but I can't afford to. Summon them.
I'm not gonna move forward for a turn. I have a few reasons for this, but yeah, I don't. I just don't want to. Yes, grovel and beg. Consent given. Um, move your Skaven forward a bit, though. Warlock, master of scrap. Well, no, 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 actually don't. No, 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 no. Well, no. Move them forward just like a tiny bit so you can reach Marek on regular sense. Let me, let me just... I'm gonna scoot forward a bit. I'm just gonna scoot forward. I'm gonna scoot forward. Ah, it was Ironbrow was here. Hmm. Uh, I mean, this army's doomed. Mine is coming. Um, I could just run for the ambush point, actually. Does that work? Does anyone know how that actually works? I think it's both. This would be useful. I've literally never gotten to the ambush point and gotten away from an ambush. Just fight, like, so many ship and units. Yeah, but I, I can't just recruit a new army out of thin air to take another three turns. My army's in the back, so... That's what I'm saying, if I can just get to the retreat point, we'll 2v1 him. Yeah. Well, I mean, do you not want me to try to get to the retreat point? I don't know if you'd want to, because I tried it and it doesn't do anything. Okay, run to it and press leave. Okay, yeah, it, it, they say it works. It's better than just, these are just skeletons. Like, these are unbuffed vanilla skeletons. I'll kill seven dwarves throughout this fight. It will yes. not do okay. anything. Okay, sure. I don't know why you're being, like, snide about it. I'll just sacrifice your calf. Don't sacrifice my calf. <laughs> Suck, like the only units in this army that can do something, you're like, let's get those ones killed. Make sure you stop the gun as soon as you can too. I'm literally they're dwarves. I know they're dwarves. We'll take their fire, we'll run to the escape point. You can also like sacri sacrifice some shitty skeletons to I don't want to sacrifice anything! Even to shitty fucking buff, why? I don't want to sacrifice anything. I want okay. nothing to die. I, I don't know why you're like, you're starting to pay me this. Well, kill your entire army, and then I'm like, let's not. And you're like, oh, kill most of your army, and I'm like, no. <laughs> yeah, I think we just run to the, the escape point. Dwarves don't do shit. Sure. I mean, yeah, he's gonna gun me down, but like that's why I just run away. <sighs> I don't know why you're sighing. What? Like literally, you, you, yeah, it's like a bad. Why in every bad situation are you always like, well, it's hopeless. We should just like move on. Fifteen. My command. Was it close? Where is the escape point? Oh, it's right here. Where? Behind us. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's just fight back for it. Oh, give me some units. Um, fine, he'll do. Just manage that. Um. I don't know. Uh, Shok, you manage those melee. And Hedoniak, you manage that melee. Carry on 
Lord. Guys, try to run past to the escape point. We literally, like, do you see how much damage we're doing? We're, we're just, we're all clumped up, just getting shot at. Literally try to get to the escape point. Everyone try to get to the escape point, I'm telling you. We will not do any damage. We will, we're, we're, we'll tank for like a dwarven weapon team, but these people are unupgraded, very shit units. Yeah, someone is clearly lagging. I can literally tell it's FPS lag because I moved all the Nehikaran. Or sorry, I moved all my army at once and someone just completely lagged out. Yeah. 80 FPS right now. Okay, can you get the skeletons into the retreat point? I'm trying. You're clearly charging them in the back. Well, cute. We should withdraw. Tomb King. Sepulchral Majesty. How does it work? Charge. Okay, I'm like in here. My way. I I literally don't know. Uh, My will be done. Oh, I think you have to stay in it and then you retreat and you need to retreat to the... Ah, uh, okay, so put your king in here. Put your king here and make him retreat. Is that how it works? Yes, yes. okay. Okay, want me to help you here? Agreed! I move! I want to click that. I mean, get, just get the something out. Having any army is better than no army. I have retreat them now. Acceptable. Wait, so you have to get them into the retreat Move. point, then yes, run and up. then they retreat to the field. Yes, so you keep on withdraw, and then they retreat. There we go. That's so fucking weird. Yeah. I mean, I think I have it on my Tomb King. But then he just went into combat. So, I don't know. Let me help you. Hey, you too, Shakti. Oh. Yeah, I figured this army was not going to really do any damage. That doesn't seem to work. Oh. Tomb King. Yeah. Can't send my army. No. Well, yeah, don't. Why? What? Why would I not do that? It's like instant wars. <laughs> I said, don't send your army in. But why not? What? What? Why not? Why would you not send your army in? I, I can probably just kill them if you want. Is your army? What level is your army? It's like a game of an NCR monster. It's not even Queek! If you finally brought Queek down, yeah, you'd crush him, but... A random lord against Thoric Ironbrow, who's, like, turbo-leveling? No. I don't I don't think you'll win that one. Even with my tier 4 units. I mean, yeah, I can I can try to bring some units up, but... Oh, I should have just gone for the buff on the Hikarn warriors. 
Skeleton archers just don't do shit. Nope. Okay, it is kind of shit to shit though. You can't say every single character is shit. I can. Kalita's one of the best legendary lords. Just because she gives basically infinite ammo. It's okay, Hash. At least one horse survived. Make them pay. Never mind. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, I, I, I kind of don't like how I'm stuck in the menu raising a lord like 19 times and then you get to attack. Oh. I'm not a real fan of that menu. Of I also think it's actually pretty oh, stupid Lord, that you can move God. in Ember Stance because that's how he got you. Who? Really? Oh yeah. The game freezed for me as well. Come on. I auto-saved before the battle. Yeah, you quick saved, right? Yeah. I, I auto-saved before the can battle. Can we auto-resolve it? Yes. I, I crashed. Yeah, we all crashed. Oh, hold on. I'm. Oh, no, I hard crashed. Yeah. Someone. Okay, I'm going to explain exactly what happened because I guarantee this is what it. I didn't get to choose a lord after the battle. Yeah. Uh huh. And because I kept. He keeps giving pop ups. After someone loses a battle, let them move. Let them take the lord because you killed an okay. army with no I lord apologize. and it just hard crashed yeah. everyone. <laughs> I guarantee Did that's what happened. game crash? Yes. Yes. I'm, yeah. Okay, I'm going to explain this to everyone here. After a battle, I wants me to select a lord, but because it keeps popping up so many different pop-ups, I couldn't select one in time. So when he attacked, he killed an army without a lord, and I guarantee the game had no logic for that. What I thought right. happened was that you moved your army, so I was like, oh, he moved his army because it looked like you moved with a lord or something? No, what happens is it pops up select lord, then give, goes away because it wants you to deal with something else, then pops up select lord, then it goes away, then it pops it up, then it goes away, and then you attacked me, so I actually didn't have a lord on that army. I auto save before the battle because I've been getting in the habit. We'll just auto resolve it. I I, I thought, but no, the, the problem is you just encircled the retreat point. Dude, like, I, 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 I don't know what to do. I feel like Arcan the Black has issued order number 227 and like he, he's in full mobilization not one step back for every tomb king army i cut down there's another one tornado you just have to attack through a settlement battle just do it <laughs> wait so i would have thought with the ambush if you touch the escape point you get out but no you're like inside it so no, he so throws new forces to the front without regard to heavy losses and penetrates deep into the Soviet Union. Okay, wh new what regions. happens is you need to reach the retreat point, then you need to retreat off the map from there. So it's really not doable unless you like fight through it. It's really fucky. Tornado, no matter how many times you go into ambush stance, it won't help you, it won't save you. Yeah, by the way, one ambush stands per turn at the beginning or end of your movement. Otherwise, uh, yeah, it, it's gonna get really fucky-wucky. Also, like, how how are we handling the encircling a settlement thing like I tried to do? Because that, that could have gone either way and it's just sort of micro and APM and it's sort of scuffed. Uh, what do you mean? So if you siege a settlement, then... That I settlement. forced him to attack it before he could get his reinforcing army there. Yeah, so if he had you... to retreat. Yeah, it's just weird. Like it, it, it's like micro APM. Uh, I have no idea, but I'm gonna go get a drink of water real quick. Sure. Turn it. I promise you that'll happen on every single settlement. God bless. God bless. I mean, what time is it for you I guys? I gotta get my hex rates back. Four a.m. What's what's your plan to from, from I mean I mean I'm I'm East Coast USA. What's your plan to handle <laughs> What's your plan to handle the funny Volkmar army? Three armies and you'll just auto resolve it because you're a nice person. <laughs> <laughs> Tornado will la will fucking hold his ground to the last pistol. <laughs> <laughs> You will have to kill every one of those fucking red coats, and the last one will still be screaming. So we auto. We want to just auto resolve. Yeah, yeah. just auto resolve. Um, auto resolve. Who said? 
Who said for him? Auto resolve. For the love of God, why would you click spectate, guys? Why are you clicking? Because that's the only button. That is literally the only button on the screen. Uh, is join team or spectate? Click in the middle of the screen. Oh well, he just fainted. I actually that's really did more sad. damage. That that's way. Ark and the that's Ark and the Black's reaction to the pistol, the free company militia. <laughs> he has a heart attack and dies. Yeah. Uh, Heldrick, move back here, Lord. Yeah. Move your tails. <laughs> Bring me Neferata's head. Oh, Imric is going to tickle Hildrick a bit. Uh, I don't know about that. Oh, he's definitely going to tickle you. Wait, your locus of power? Is that dope or what? Yeah, probably. I don't know. I mean, it's of power. How could it not be? Wait, why did we go blue? Snake, Scotty. Hi, Queen. Interesting how we leveled this up, actually. Okay, goodbye. Alright, good luck gamers. See ya. Oh. Uh, before we leave, can we stop driving every turn to five minute timeout? I know That's everyone... That's literally not me. It's I, I know everyone wants to consider meal. every single action possible, but driving every turn to five minute is gonna make me put this on a three minute timer. Okay. The goddess um, I can't really move out there because, like, the thing is, he's just sitting. Krakar is just sitting here in ambush stands. For a Kyan brow. Asap smiles on us. Bow. Is there any penalty to detecting an ambush? Yeah. I feel like we're very quickly gonna fall into a meta of everyone ambushing non-stop. Get ready for a settlement battle. They just said they would siege immediately. Okay, this is the thing. I'm going to to kill him. Is that Scarbrand in your top island? Warzog declared war on him and put me in there for some reason. Warzog is losing ground. Yeah. Wait, we, we need you to be gaining ground, not, not losing ground. Are you going red line to buff your savage orcs? getting into by the camera. I couldn't move my army because the camera was moving. If you, if you just go red line and you buff your orc infantry, your savage orcs should kill everything. And then you, you just auto resolve through everything. So. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I am. Okay, uh, he's mostly, once again, free company, so all we need to do, get a bunch, okay, get some tier 1 towers, they're not gonna do a lot, but you might be able to do enough damage that your second army can just come and circle him. What? 
Which one beds your skin to skin damage? Say it again? No. I, I have no idea what you're saying. The Globadiers can do some damage. The Trumpet... Globadiers! There we go. Yes. Max, are, you say you don't like French people. Are, are you paying upkeep on the Globadiers? I am. I'm paying like 40. Oh. Okay, um... Give me the Globadiers. Get some tier 1 towers in his advance, and then start, just start the battle right now to keep him ticking. And then just assign, just just start divvying up units so we can start microing. Just start the timer. The most important thing I've ever found is to start the timer. Yeah, see, because he's going to keep moving. You want the timer started. Okay, guys, we don't, we don't actually want to line up like that, but okay. I know. Here, give me all the archers. Because I know no one actually micros archers. Everyone just sits them. Like, everyone just sits the archers. And then is like, alright, good enough. <sighs> okay, um. Let's do the timer. Okay, get some tier one turrets. Cause he's just he's just free company, so we just need tier one turrets to start shooting at him. Watch out for the mortar, watch out for gunfire. What what orders? Like you don't wanna yeah, like like play around the corners and shit. You don't wanna just like let him let him walk up and shoot you. Are we getting turrets? I mean, I just need more supplies. Did you start with zero? I put two turrets down. Uh, your king can kind of hurt Volkmar, but you no, know, I would recommend. Well, Volkmar doesn't really do that much. Yeah, guys, don't let him take free shots at you. I mean, he's, he's just gonna keep moving in and out. If you can, at this point, try to save up for a tier 3 turret. Okay, clear me a path. I'm gonna use these Globadiers and take out the Satyr Souls. Move, 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 right here, Hildrick, move it. Uh, I'm moving in here. Guys, I need this path cleared for shooting. Pull back, pull back, pull back all your units. So I can just get a clear firing line into the Tatter Souls here. Pull back, pull back, pull back. Pull these units away. Pull these units away, please. I guarantee these Globadiers will fuck them up if I actually get to throw them. Okay, guys, you're, you're way too bunched up here. Yeah, he's, he's using a banish on you. We, we don't need everyone bunched up. 
Because you're, you're so clumped. We need to unclump this. Remember, skeletons don't deal damage. Your skeletons are there to keep them out of range. That's it. Hildren, you gotta stop moving exactly where I'm moving. Your desire? Forward, backwards. For the famine time. Okay, that should be it for the Tatter Souls. Okay, Tatter Souls are dog. Oh, where? What? 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 what, what how did these poison wooden globetiers get called into combat? I don't know. You guys, stop throwing. Stop throwing. You're wasting ammo. Okay. You guys get up. Oh, that won't work. Okay, we're just gonna hide the Globadiers again. Okay, do you have enough supplies to get a... Uh, are these our turret positions? Do we have any other turrets in this vicinity? Uh, we have one right here. Uh, okay, try to upgrade... Do, how many supplies? We have 50? Yeah, upgrade... Okay, this turret here... Upgrade that turret to a uh, tier 3. Get the here. You can Actually, a tier 4. No, 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 I can't. You guys are blocking all the lines. I can't. If I would, I could, but I can't. Um, they're flanking here, so be careful. Okay, if you guys... Okay, I'm gonna move. Everyone clear this path, okay? I'm gonna be moving the Globadiers. He's instantly gonna try to shoot them. I guarantee he, he understands what I'm trying to do. So everyone needs to clear this path. Clear this path. Clear this path. Go to the right, not the. See, yeah, see, he's just running right at me. Oh my god. I need someone to block this guy. Is anyone here to block this guy? Good on. No, this is just not gonna work. Yeah. He's just he's he's on the hill so the Globadiers won't actually shoot. These ones, though, yes. God's Skaven are so dumb! Run, you fucking Skavoids! Guys, um... So many... Oh, boy. Okay, well, the, the turret... Can we upgrade... No, you, oh, you're already upgrading it. Perfect, perfect. Okay, he's he's fucking with that guy, so I'll move in these Globadiers now. Oh, 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 the path is clear. Oh, I'm gonna get him. Ready, ready. Are they on... Oh, that's the problem. They're on... Okay, whoever is... Skirmish on by default needs to turn it off. Okay, 
as he's flanking behind. Yeah, I mean, there's no shuriken too. Okay, I'm gonna get. I, I have to reposition the archers. And we gotta get the Globadiers back here too. Come on, guys. Volley. Please shoot a ball. Honestly, if he was smart, he would just be running them into melee. Okay, well, I dealt with that advance, but the problem is he just has these heroes in me that I cannot yeah. get rid of. What? What? Orders? It's back here! Now it is! That's one from when you go. Quick! Quick! I can try to shoot. Yeah, that's not trying. Kill the maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna try to aim everyone at their hero. Maybe by sheer force of firepower we can kill. Oh, he's got 131 armor. Volkmar would be easier to kill. How good's your other hero? Mine? Yeah. About the same quality. Uh, he doesn't. He doesn't have like any special units. I don't think so. One bow is between uh, the flashers and the uh, regiments. <laughs> I mean, we killed two units. Potentially the swordsman. No, it's just not like. The problem is that Clara has way too much quality compared to you. Well, yeah, he, he he's not putting... Like, again, these skeletons are fucking worthless. Like, skeleton spearmen you only put in an army if you have literally nothing else. Yeah. Like, I mean, you can see their kills are just not there. Well, we clumped up for a banish there. That was, yeah, not great. Hey, Hash, I have work tomorrow morning, so um, like one more turn, and then I gotta go to bed. Uh, okay. We didn't do like any damage. 
Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, if we did enough damage, you could pull in your other army, but we did, like, nothing. Sigma, grant me strength. Honored to serve. Okay, so we need someone to play... Shoot. You need to go too? Yeah, it's 6 a.m. What, what the fuck are you guys doing? What do you mean? Oh my god, hold, hold on here. I mean, if you don't get people, you could also like save the game and reuse it. Because I want to play this game. Uh, yeah, we could come back tomorrow because I'm also getting kind of tired. Oh my lord. I can see this turn. Yeah, see, this is why I think if you want to do like a longer multiplayer game, you have to give like every lord immortal. Because this is kind of the issue. The goddess wills it. Kill, slay, maim, kill no fuzz. My dynasty reigns supreme. Seeking High Queen. Get the things. The problem is if I move into the Lizardmen, they're all just sitting in ambush, waiting. I deem it! Death becomes me! So I just need this northern army. Hooded one watches me! Uh, I mean, I could move up in my anti-ambush stance, but then he's just gonna move up two people. We begin. Yeah, see, like, you're getting too many skeletons. Are you telling me you can't get anything else in your armies? Not right now, because they take two turns to recruit. In my other army that I'm recruiting right now, it's Crypt Ghouls, Yishopti, and Dire Wolves. Okay, well, I can't. I Like, I, I'm just trapped here, because if I move up, the Lizardmen are just going to 2v1. I'm gonna be down Bring Kalita again. Head. So like the issue is I'm just getting two on one. did the thing. He's big now. Uh, nice. He tried to underweight and I intercepted it. Oh, you wanna fight? Well, yeah. Obviously we fight. Uh, I've got good auto resolve. But wait, his army is shit. Oh, wait, are those Longbeards? No, those are Dwarf Warriors. And Slayers, and a bunch of Miners. I don't know why he went with Miners. They're good against Gates, of course. 
Three. Why did Diesel choose to spectate again? Okay, um, I have the very obvious range advantage here. This army is shit. He clicked the wrong button. Hi, Queen Kalida. I ambushed him, so I get to chew. Does he see me? Yes. Wait, does he see me? Wait, hold on, 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 hold on. I have a question. Yeah. Can you guys see me? No. 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 Okay, so I see you, but you don't see me. Yeah, yes, exactly. Just, right. Okay, I'm you trying to understand said. the mechanics of this site, because it's just not very clear. Uh, it's... Okay, they can't see me, but I can see them. That means I can just deploy... Okay, Hildrick, you have the cavalry. I'm gonna be honest, there's not much you're gonna be able to do with this shit. Uh, who wants to man the front line? Anyone? I guess I'll do it. Okay, and don't act. You just need a man that front line. I don't actually have artillery. Sir. So... Chin, just one thing. Basically, if you can't see the enemy army, the enemy army can't see you. It's literally always like that. Is that how it works? Yes, this is always the case. If you see the enemy army, the enemy army can't see you. As I said, I don't know exactly how it works with ambush battles or like the interception, but if you see the enemy, he can't see you. Okay. That's why in the moment before we could see your, where you put your hex wraith, but you couldn't see anything. Also, so you guys. Okay. Actually, I'm gonna be honest, let's move back just a smidgen. Because we can get some shots off with the Ushapti. I'm, I'm gonna keep the Ushapti at optimal range. Yeah, move, move back, move back. Yeah, that that's... that's uh, you're kind of in my shit, Ushapti. Yeah, I just want to get a couple of volleys off with my Ushapti. They don't really have any range. This is like the shittiest army. Um, don't sacrifice the melee. So like, put the melee to block, but don't actually attack with the melee. If, if they're running past, then block them. If they're not running past. There's like a stupid ridge here. I couldn't shoot over. Didn't they have one ranged unit? Two. Yeah, two. Okay, I can sand veil. Necropolis Knights, and then we're gonna get a downhill charge right here.
kind of don't want to give my heroes beat up, but Necrotect is still anti infantry. Hi, Queen Kalida. I just have everything aiming Thork right now. Where are... Oh, you guys are trying to get downhill charged again, huh? Actually, those are Slayers? Slayers don't care about my archer's lack of armor pen, because they don't have armor! Sitting here trying to kill those dudes the whole time? That's just mean. Worthy, uh, are the Nahikar Warriors supposed to be winning? My Nahikar Warriors are pretty good. Because all of my units have won, except my for my own. Nehekar, okay, this is what I was saying in the beginning. I, I think I really should have just focused Nehekar and Warriors instead of our Cavalry. Yeah, all of my units were winning except one who got absolutely destroyed by minor bombs. Jesus, wiping out the last of the Slayers is so tedious. Just die, you little dwarf fucks. I am vengeance. Onwards, legions. I just sand veiled Kalita. I don't think you can even see this her now. Is well. Yeah. Queen of <laughs> Okay, now Thoric is. Who's a good lord in your opinion? No. Delson. Hi, 
Nightwing Kalida. Obey me. Run. Sacrifice them. Fighting on their team still. No one better because it doesn't work. Yeah, okay. My uh, snaky boy spitters shit on Thoric. Yeah. The bow is the tricky one for you. Yeah, I'm tricky. I think the problem is he, he doesn't have enough quarrelers, and he had to. He, okay, if he replaced every one of those miners, all of them with quarrelers, this would have actually been difficult, because his. Yeah. The, the two quarrelers he had actually were doing pretty good. Wait, were you thinking Tomb Guard or Ushapti? Or no, you, you, you mean the Tomb Guard beat the dwarves, not the Nehekarn warriors. Oh, the Nehekar warriors beat the dwarves too. No, oh, I don't know then. I know my sneaky spitters did a good job, my necropolis knights. He he tried to charge the slayers into my necropolis knights. Unfortunately, I saw it coming. Let their souls We withdraw! The goddess wills it. Hundred march! Now we go! And now I replace everything. Wait, why does it take two turns? Oh, because the other army is trying to recruit. Sorry, other army, you're... Not as important. Do I want to go up to four archers? I'm going to be honest, I don't think I do. My front line is uh, squished enough as it is. Master! I got one skill point off that shit? Looks like it. Going! Does anyone have uh, money? Not My 
my father demands it. Submit to your Okay, you guys are generating canoptic jars, right? Yeah. Well, that's fine. Hi, Queen Kalida. Um, okay. Force march your armies to the left and pressure him. And then I'm gonna reinforce and move on the right. Because I took the campaign movement range. Yeah. Yeah, and my, my gigafort's about to be done. Um... I mean, is it more worth it to get... Well, two more stalkers and a knight. I mean, getting the necropolis knights. I need to get to tier four more than anything. Although, maybe I should just go for tomb scorpion. I could just go for Yushapti. I'm gonna be honest, with the buff Kalita just gave them... Corning you. What do you want of the warrior? You, uh, are you coming down now? Well, okay. The orcs actually killed that dude and confederated him. So if okay, so if you confederate the dudes in your west. Just find their leader and kill them, then finish the Marsh Marshes of Madness, then that gives you the Marshes of Madness, Western Badlands, and Southern Badlands. You just need to find his, find his leader and kill him. Queek is enormous. What? That is why. Ooh, I could do my special quest. He's gonna be running in my army. Yeah, this will give me the money I need, too. Ugh, he kills a bunch of my units. God damn it. Of course it does. Decent, but we still might lose. I, why, don't don't you have anything better than skeleton? You can't build anything better than skeletons. You have literally nothing better. Like, like I, I promise you, literally any unit is better than skeletons. You can't upgrade them via tech, you can't do anything. Like, at this point, they're so outscaled, they literally only exist to sandbag the enemy. So, like, the problem is, although this looks good, we could very likely end up not actually being able to do anything. Uh
Like, we actually can't engage him, not really. How long does it take like our reinforcements? I mean, okay. I, I think we need to play to keep him off the ambush point, but I'm gonna be dead honest. We're gonna get wrecked so fucking hard. Okay, the Kepra Guard is gonna be our only actual damage dealer. Two minutes? Oh boy. Okay, don't engage them. Sit here. Uh, just basically step on the point. And just stop them from getting on the point. We march! Can't you get your Hex Wraith back or something? I like, don't have the building upgraded. Guys, you're like super clumped up and you're gonna get mortared like hell. Everyone, everyone like space out a bit more. You can hold space bar to see where other people are moving. Keep the spears on the outside because he's gonna. Okay, we need to get these units in here ASAP because remember, these guys are shit. Like, like I'm telling you, skeletons are roadblocks. Yeah, 
crap, you know that she's dead in here. Guessing the moon's gonna fight the last this. Yeah, like we we can't fight with skeletons. I, I keep telling you we need more than skeletons. Uh, guys, we're so clumped here on the right. We, we gotta unclump. We're gonna get banished. Okay, we're getting more reinforcements as we're dying here. Okay, I'm like trying- the problem is I have the Kepra Guard, but the Kepra Guard can't do shit because their cavalry are on them. And I can't move up because I don't have shields. Guys, you're so clumped! Stop clumping! I- I- oh, we're getting banished. Okay, I just gotta rush the Kepra Guard in. I can't just sit there, but they're just gonna... Okay, we just have to hope they can get in. Okay, if we just keep the Kepra Guard behind the shielded guys, we can sneak them in here. Oh, you have skirmish on by default still. Shit, if that wasn't on, this would have worked. Damn it. Sigma demands blood. Yeah, you gotta you gotta turn skirmish off by default, otherwise my units continue. Like if I ever try to like set up. A firing line they get like the enemy comes near them and they all just run away which just destroys any capability to actually I mean, I think we might be able to win it. Wait, we need to get those cav off the archers. The archers are at least, like, whittling people away. Do we have any... anything that can get these... Let's see, half 
my units still have skirmish on. Okay, guys, if we could get the cav out, I actually have enough archers that I can fuck these people up. Uh, yeah, the Kepra guard is just getting demolished now, unfortunately. Guys, just stay with the archers. Oh, they don't have guard on. That's what's going on. Problem is nothing can kill Volkmar. All our units are just so low tier. Yeah, we're just so horribly outnumbered. We can't... Like, like we have more units, but they're all useless. Imagine... Imagine ambushing an army. <laughs> It, this is all skeletons. These might as well not be units. <laughs> Sorry. Ah. These, these, uh, these 50 oh, militia have oh, out and oh, 24. This army is Wait, so oh, rancid, dude. <laughs> we, we, I, I'm, I'm begging you to please build more than skeletons. They're so outdated. Y you want skeleton spears because they can make cavalry really frustrating, and that's it. Like you, you don't, you do. If if your main damage dealers are skeletons, you're doomed, and we're doomed. It, it's yeah, fucking five thousand five hundred skeletons died this day. <laughs> That's not enough. Volkmar gets ambushed. Ah, finally, <laughs> a real challenge. Cock shotgun. These aren't even tier one units. These are tier zero. Tier one are Nehikar and warriors. 
Yeah. True. I mean, the thing is, is that tier one is free company militia. That's what I'm saying. If we at least had some like Nehekarn warriors, direwolves, felbats, like I mean, they get shot though. Well, just get focused. That's what I'm saying. If we have more of them, we we have like three felbats and two direwolves to kill like ten free company militia, and it's just like that. That's not gonna work. See, if you brought a bunch of direwolves, I just adjust the tactics though. I have multiple angles, hash. He just likes the smell of gunpowder in the morning. Sterling's revenge survived, Pog. The mortars didn't. Eh, who cares? They were pussies anyway. Yeah. Liberals. I feel like the mortars are the least actually of his units at this point. Okay, please, please go build any building, do terror. anything, build anything. I, I, anything that is not a skeleton will do better. Build buildings, anything. Can we, some, we, why is Garban just standing in your land, like, just chilling? He posing menacingly. Don't worry, I'm getting new and interesting oh, regiments of renown as Volkmar <laughs> levels up. Death becomes me. Your queen moves. God bless. Okay, hold on here, Kalita. Do I want to move Kalita to the left? Or... Oh, so rip Thor. He yes. just wanted to yes. travel over the to pull her out. Yeah, he kind of had the same problem the Skelly Boys had. Like, when you bring in non upgraded tier 1 units, they, uh. Kind of hard when you. Uh, yeah, these stalkers are really, really hard to deal with right now for us. I. I feel like they tried to give some lightweight buffs to the Free Company Militia to make them, like, a little touch more viable. And they just, I, I think they went too far in a few places, to use a phrase from a, a, a famed man. Um, they went, they went, they went, they went a little bit, they, they, they did a thing. I think it might just be Volkmar though, giving him magic yeah, it's, pits. It's Volkmar, it's a lot of it is Volkmar, yeah. Like, he just, he's pretty good against this type of army. Man with gun. Chat, wins wait, which is which is the best here? Six thousand skelly boys. I can just. Not so there's ever gonna be a zombie apocalypse. Uh, I wanna be on tornado side. I I think Volkmar is way more beatable than you guys think. <laughs> it's just yeah. Ag yeah. Again, like oh, remember that go one. Back. Go go back down, team. I gotta tell you something. Yeah, you, yeah, you have said that. I, I'm hearing you. Hmm? Uh, you have said that. I'm hearing you. Yeah, I think in all honesty, if you want to do a game like this, you kind of need to make lords immortal. Or else the issue is that, like, if, like, one player has a bunch of successful battles and kills lords, Sigma he kind of just becomes unstoppable. Yeah. Answer your queen! Is irrelevant. I'm gonna go after this one. With five provinces, you should have so many special buildings and shit. I think so. Well, I'm, I'm just saying, like, where are they? Well, I have... Uh, in the mountains, I have all of them. 
Okay, so we should you should literally have nothing in your army that isn't one of those units at this point. Well, yeah, but they have a cap, so... You have a cap of 12 of each. Um, actually, a cap of 16. Okay, so no more skeletons. The instrument okay, yeah, but I recruit them all, so I have to have one army of skeletons. No. No, at, at this point, there's... I, I can't imagine... You could need skeletons in your armies. You have Ushapti, you have Ushapti Great Bows, you have lots of units that are not skeletons. <laughs> at this point, I look at Dire Bats and I think, thank God, Dire Bats. I have never wanted Dire Bats. The okay, so if I global recruit, which I have to do, it will take 15 turns. You have multiple provinces. You should be able to recruit out of each province individually. Land of the dead. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Oh, uh, no. In my one province where I would be able to recruit Scarbrands there. Well, okay, you have the Land of Assassins, the Great Desert of Arabia, and the Adelaide Mountains. The Great Desert of Arabia, the only building in it is the special one, because that's the only one you can build. Oh, right. Uh, okay, so... God damn it. So Hildrick needs to go. I'm just gonna keep. Uh, Hild Hildrick needs to go. Yeah, I'm fine with that. So, I, I guess we could resume this tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. I'll take a save at the start of the turn. At least let me kill Tic Tac Toe. No. So, Hash, what do you what do you think of the free company militia spam shit? Like, I, I fucking want you to have okay. If he would just build, just please build. Like, do you see how I have two cities and yeah. I nearly have a full army of elite units? Just please, yeah. no more skeletons. <laughs> okay, but here's the problem, right? Like, I feel like I can just stat check even like your army, Hash. I don't think it, your army would fare that great great against me. I would do. A lot better. Where the fuck from the what the fuck? Okay, There's a couple a couple Tomb Guard. Tomb Guard have silver shields. They tank, they're very good. Skeleton Warriors, they don't. So we get Tomb Guard. Boom. You're you're already struggling because you're gonna have to punch through Tomb Guard. No, I don't have to punch through anything. You have to punch through me. The the the, the free company militia spread out on the field and begin shooting you from every direction. Yes, but have, have you seen what happened to the other people I'm fighting? Well, they didn't have free company militia. They also tried their best, and sometimes when you try real hard and you do your best, you just might find it's not good enough. Did you save? I'm taking a save. I'm taking a yeah, save. Because people, people are already. I'm taking a save. There's a save. Okay, we'll continue this tomorrow. Hold on. I'm going to leave up a message in announcements. Okay, tomorrow, 3 p.m. So, same time we started today, tomorrow. Wait, can you okay. make that, Tony Tromboni? Sorry? Because you weren't here when we started tomorrow. Can I- Okay, hold on. Before everyone leaves, could- uh, At the same time we started today, could you all start tomorrow? I could. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, could anyone- oh, yeah, it would be nice for me, but I still can join at around 10. It was 10, right? It was 3 p.m. Central. No. So, oh, yeah, sorry, no. sorry. It was 10 o'clock for me. Uh, 10 p.m. for you, uh, 10 p.m. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, earlier is fine for me. Uh, the Does anyone have an issue with earlier? I mean, I, I have this thing called work. Yeah, see, yeah, see that's the thing. Any people have work. I, I, we'll just say th the same time. So 3 p.m. Yeah. Central U.S. Convert to your time zone. Tomorrow we start again. Yeah, okay. So, and, 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 and Hendoniac, let me tell you. So, like, if you have a single tier 3 barracks... You get four Nehekarn warriors, six skeleton archers, two tomb guards, and a tomb guard with a halberd. So a single tier three province is already giving you three tomb guards. Since you had three, although one did get killed by Scarbrand, which I'm, I'm hoping <laughs> Warzog uh, compensates for with a little bit of help. But at this okay. point, you're okay. Um, your Grave Hill. Can can you get the tier three Grave Hill? Can I? Can I take the stage to uh, describe all the bullshit that I'm putting on these on these fucking free company militia? Yeah, go for it. Okay, so I've got 
pistol core, which is 20% ammunition, 8% missile strength. And then I have, uh, let's see, blessed bullets. So they do magic armor piercing projectiles for free company militia units from Volkmar. Which is going to fuck world leg. <laughs> um, and then also, for some reason, it also gives frenzy to free company militia. Good. Good. And then uh, oh, so War Eternal so gives 20% speed and Wayfarer to Free Company Militia, as well as 10 charge bonus. Ooh, you need that charge bonus. Tools of Absolution gives flaming attacks and again. three armor piercing damage. You don't pierce shields, do you? No. no. Okay. You can, don't you, can't you get gunners for that? Or uh, maybe the, uh, the Dwarven Thunder wait, to wait, pierce? Wait, there's more. State Troop Standards Tech gives 5 leadership, 5% 5 speed. Mass Produced Ammunition gives another 10% ammo. Uh, volley Fire gives 15% reload time reduction. And Rifled Barrels gives 10% missile strength. Good. It's it's nothing but Free Company Gaming. I'm looking at uh, the Free Company Militia. Standard guy is ranked 7. He has 34 melee attack and 39 melee defense. And also, finally, to round it all out, before I forget, Strength of the Penitent gives 15% physical resist, 14 melee defense if the unit is losing. And they also have a bonus 10% physical resistance and 8 uh, melee defense in Volkmar's army. That it? Yeah, that's it. That's, that's everything. I mean, that's not even that many buffs. <laughs> you, you guys are going to be crying once I get these Necropolis Knights. Well, I mean, I got the one. I okay, if, I, if you if you bring knights, I'm just gonna form into a square. <laughs> They're necropolis knights. Those are those these, these, those big snake boys you guys are fighting. Those are the tomb guard. Sorry, tomb lord heavy I'm, cab. Yeah, I'm I'm most I'm actually more scared of the stalkers right now because they are a, a really a really big problem for lizardmen. Oh yeah, at least tier three. Did you guys Did you guys like me taking out Thor? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, like, Hash, oh, yeah. you're a fucking warrior. You're just... You, yeah, it's we'll it's the fucking done, Soviet yeah. Union out there. <laughs> I have literally... The problem is, Hash has been literally PvPing his ass off for the entire six hours. And Hildrick and fucking Wurzaga just PvE in game. Yeah, they're yeah, just you're sitting. PvE as well, right? Where, okay, I <laughs> literally, okay, I literally heard from Hildrick. Oh, don't worry, I'll just take out Scarsnick and then I'll be. Oh well, I you know I might as well go take out the dwarves while I'm up here. Well, I'm building you one army with a tier your level one lord. Okay, well here I'm I'm just gonna go take out uh, Nagash while I'm over here. And oh, uh, you know what, Imrik's down here, so I'll just and I'm like I have I have two cities, I have two cities. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it, that actually explains why you have so much uh, IT units because I, all your money is getting funneled into. I, I'm not even getting that much. Money. I literally ran a fucking Taliban campaign in, in the desert against Arkan out here. Okay, um, I'm I'm looking. Uh, where the fuck is Queek? You want to know what level Queek is? Tell us. Queek's in the center of your screen. He's up to twenty-eight. What the fuck? 28? He has PvE so much. is 16. He's, he's pve so much, he's up to level 11. 28. He's gonna do that okay. shit what Queek does, where he power spikes like a bitch, comes at you with 35 anti-infantry, like, boosts his melee attack to, like, or sorry, his, his um, a damage to, like, 1.4 thousand, and then just, like, kills five people as well. <laughs> and that's what he's gonna do. But, but he, here's the thing, Hash. In addition to all of that, I, I'm rolling okay, out yeah, a new super go. weapon. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm rolling out a new super weapon to need it. surpass Metal Gear. You know, I, I'm rolling out a super weapon too. It's called, could I get some fucking help so I can have more than two <laughs> cities? <laughs> no. Hash, don't be ungrateful. Alright? Some people don't have any cities. Uh, You know, Anhedoniac, if you just built up your cities... uh. You could be doing what I'm doing, which is you just keep throwing tier three units in over and over as and opponents. Someone's... Literally, what is the point of expanding as the Tomb Kings? You need more buildings so you can get more limit. Like right now, I can only get one Necropolis Knight. I need more. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, so like I can keep rebuilding the one army, but it's going to get to the point. Like my second army is kind of getting the scraps, so to speak. Like it's it's picking up some <laughs> Nehikarn warriors, which I'm not. they're not bad, but they're clearly not good. 
the catching Thoric out gave us a big ups. Because then I could do my quest battle, and then... I mean, one of the things is Tomb Kings get a uh, recovery um, ancillary pretty early. That, that's one thing I definitely think we're going to have to do, is make every lord immortal. I have... I have no idea, like, what I'm going to do later. Like, the, the free company militia thing is, is just extremely based, but I don't think it works forever. Uh, it is certain... I don't... I, okay, I don't know how to transition out of it. Okay. <laughs> I'm in too deep, man. One second. I'm going to end the stream. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for being here. Thank you, everybody. We're going to be back tomorrow um, at the same starting time with this. Um, yep. So, bye-bye, everybody. Come back tomorrow at the same time to see the maybe 